All right. Oh, shadow, no, shadow. As it stands, it is currently impossible to read chat without looking at it. So until further advancements are made in telekinesis, is that the right thing? I don't care. Hello! Welcome, everybody. Oh, yeah, a little Ben's war cry. I haven't had a call with Ben's in a while. It's too much time. Hero, welcome, musician, Maples, Zack Attack, first one of the I think, actually, I don't, you know, chat resets a little bit sometimes. Archer always broadcasts. He can't just say hi. No, no, he has to broadcast me. Emerald's here. Emerald's been a lurker lately. Just chilling. Locker to her. What is, uh, Supercharger, Phantom. I just hit the 100 character limit, so I figured I needed to get quicker with my words. Oh, good! I've done zero 160s. Fuck. Okay. All right. We're just getting straight to business then. <laughs> um, yeah. Room for three. Let's get it going. Just hop it straight into a game. Shay, thank you for the sub. I appreciate it. Almost a year. Mythic leads. Uh, they're available in mission rewards, llamas. Um, if you ever see a daily video where I point out that we have super people llamas, that's a great day to open up your game. Hero? I'll wait for her. I'll wait for her. I know she's always excited to join, but that doesn't necessarily get in. I'll got you. I'll wait a second. Yeah, nobody ever asked to play. Hero's getting a pass this time, but nobody needs to ask to play. Right now, we're perfect. She was the next one anyway. Storm God, thank you for the bits. Epic just announced on Trello what traps will be fixed in a future update. Oh, that's great. Speaking of which, I sent some Reddit messages, and I don't check Reddit. Uh, well, at least I know. Uh, yeah, Hype Train's almost active. You got a bad thing out of your people, Llama? Yeah, it happens. I got my two Mythic leads. <laughs> then transferred them. Oh my gosh, the overwhelming feeling of coming back after not playing for a while, and then suddenly having to decide what loadout to use. Uh, okay, I'm gonna do the storm believe it. Did they rearrange this? Am I cracked in the head or did they change where? Oh, that fucks me up. Oh my God. Did they shift that around? <laughs> that broke my brain. <laughs> I have 7,000 hours in this game, and the overwhelming bulk of that is in this menu. And and that just... I'm glad you guys found that as funny as I did, because I'm like, wait, wait. This is like walking into your kitchen, and somebody shifted the switch for the light over like an inch or two, and you'd be like, hang on. <laughs> it's like immediately confusing. What What's different? Why Why did they do that? I, uh... Oh my god. Okay, what even goes in this build? Uh, oh, this is where the soldier should be! Ah! Why would you do that to me? Oh, okay, all right, all right, all right. Wow, that was hard. That was like reading a new language. Yeah, Stormblade loadout's awesome. Uh, Supercharger resets today. It's Wednesday. Yeah, resets in that time right there. Four hours and ten minutes. I need to do ten one sixties in four hours. I can't be fucking with my loadout every game if I'm gonna do that. We have two minutes before the hype train kicks off. If anybody wants a hype train emote, you know? Maybe we can all get the golden kappa if you guys donate half a million dollars. We can get to that level 100. <laughs> Trap recycling's a bug. They'll fix it. That's... Can you somebody link me the Trello? I'm sure Archer's got it bookmarked. I want to see if that's real. I have not finished ventures. I think I'm gonna need to do like a nice fat Sunday stream or something. I don't know what day it'll be. It, Chaos Agent is absolutely worth it. Did you see my video I posted today on getting stuff before they go away? Thank you, Archer. Weekly quest. Um, there you go. That's why I love when people ask questions on Twitch. I can answer it. That was an hour ago. Wait a second. 
Did my Reddit message do something? Hey! Thank you for the sub and crew, I appreciate it! My message was almost three hours ago, and then an hour ago, the Trello gets updated. Aw, oh, maybe it is worth it to message your community managers. I'm looking out for you guys, I'm trying to let them know. Cause I just don't know what Epic knows, I don't know... When they break things... I don't know, I just don't know. How am I? I'm pretty great, actually. This break has been serving me well. I'm doing well. Did they fuck up the movement again, or am I just not used to seeing it anymore? It still looks like I'm moonwalking. Ugh, whatever. Watch them all at work! Well, I appreciate you stopping by. Dropping a sub, getting us to 68% of level 1. If anybody wants any emotes, um... Uh, 100 bits, gift sub, prime sub for free. Hey, Shade. Cycling weapons give you a lot more back than usual. Yeah, I wasn't sure. I don't recycle weapons that often, but are we getting, like, way more than we normally do? Because I remember, like, four Sunbeam being the cap. So you guys are pointing out a lot of things that, as a very, very late game player, I haven't paid attention to in years. So I, I need you guys to just remind me. Like, I'll recycle a weapon if it's 1 HP, but I don't even look at it otherwise. Um... Maybe that's the tan- well, I, I think the traps is a real bug. Oh, why am I sliding around again? I swear, I thought this... I thought this... I don't know. I wouldn't have indulged in copy- I would have indulged in co yeah. So, Save the World is a game that's best enjoyed in... small amounts. You know, like if you're an endgame player, Grinding it out is a path to misery. Like, I get depressed if I play this game, you know, eight hours at a time or more, usually. It's really important to just check in a couple times a week, make a whole thing of it. That's why I've been... <laughs> oh, that's awesome! Yeah! I hope it, uh, I hope it arrives t in a timely manner. I know they've been swamped with orders a lot recently. I appreciate you checking it out. Have you tried Advanced CG before? It is delicious, and I'm drinking some... Right now. I'm gonna kill enemies while drinking of ANCG. Look at this. Look how look how good of a gamer this makes me. One-handed gaming. First time trying it. Yeah, let me know. I am not... I am not just shilling random sponsors with, you know, money in mind. I Obviously, I do financially benefit, but I genuinely care, like, about of ANCG. If you try it out and don't like it, let me know. If you try it out and do like it, let me know. I'm a genuine fan of the product. I like Advanced CG. Drink it every day. I've met their CEO a couple of times. He's actually local to me. It was the weirdest thing. I didn't get much of a story out of it because I was on like a morning walk at the mall. My brain hadn't really turned on yet and I, I didn't stick around to chat like I should have. But yeah, I bumped into the CEO of Advanced CG. He was meeting with some of the partner managers. It was like, oh, hey, that's the... <laughs> The most random thing. I wish I would have stayed and chatted, but you, you guys know. I, my lights weren't on yet. Hello, Sig! Alright, uh, I attempted to do it, but it was too hard to solo. I'm reconsidering... What are we soloing? Doing labs? Too hard to solo? Oh, don't solo anything and save the world. Get a team going. Get a team going. Let people in chat know you're running lab trying to get, um... Chaos Agent. Why should I something? Yeah, maybe. Maybe. I want to just catch up with everybody. So, are we recycling for more items? Do you guys know? Is it possible to beat 20 endurance level 1 metal walls? Probably. Not necessary, though. Does it cost things to upgrade them? It probably does, actually. My yo's are not in the emote stuff. The damn prime sub is not working for... Oh, that sucks. Was that a... Generic B emote? Wait. I thought it was your emote, because Emerald used it earlier. Oh, that is! Hermit Jankyo. What the fuck? Are you both just a hermit? I thought that was your emote! I guess you and her are just subbed a generic B. Or is that somebody else's emerald? Where did that emote come from, if I'm wrong? She joined because of me. That's awesome. I'm glad you two are getting along. I like it when people in the community make friends with each other, you know? Because I remember early on in the Minecraft days, like, nothing would happen if I wasn't involved. This this has been true for a lot of years, though, now that, you know, people in my nerve are actually friends with each other without me needing to be there, which means it's kind of like a real community. It's not all just... We're not all just fans of ease, like we're actual humans who are getting along, hanging out with each other. It's... It's nice. There were people who... 
I don't think Pingo and Bunny met through my nerve. I think he invited her. But there are people who are like, damn good to find. Who like actually found like relationships and stuff from people they um, met in the community, which is pretty cool. It's pretty cool. That's weird, Sig. Um, yeah, thank you for the 10 gifted subs, good to find, to Alucard, Embar, Joshua is gonna, is a gonna, all right? Uh, Mentatter, Geo the Grinch, <laughs> it's in his name, Storm God. Geo is the Grinch. <laughs> Take that. Um, <laughs> how do you pronounce those? Uh, let's find out. Uh, Travis. Travis Scatter, Sean the Cutie is a regular, a name I can't pronounce, Dirty Dan and YT Beyonds. Thank you for the gifted subs, nine of which I could pronounce with relative confidence, but that that one's just a bunch of dashes, so I don't I don't know what I'm supposed to say there. Uh, we're gonna do everything in the shadow favor. Where the Leviathan skin? Just where? Yeah, no, we don't we don't encourage that. Leviathan's been bugged for many years. I don't know why Epic hasn't done anything about it. Uh, but yeah, save the world's a game, you should play slowly. Dude, man, you don't need to ruin it for yourself. Try to take it in small steps. Positivity is key. Being toxic about the game doesn't help people. I don't think you did that, but, um, some people do that. They, they fall to this mentality that the game never gets updated and Epic hates us, and neither of which is true, so... I don't know. If you really enjoy Save the World as much as you have to play as much as you have, it could be worth it to just take a break. Hell, Horde is coming back, like, next week. So maybe just don't play Save the World, dude man, I'm talking to you. Don't play Save the World for a week. Wait until Survive the Horde comes back around. Uh, they definitely tweaked it, and they even added some more modifiers, so... I need to update the timeline with the information Archer sent me, but... Um, that is genuinely new stuff. Like, I know Horde already came out, but it should be refined now with harder difficulties, and you might have a good time doing it, so... Yeah, Horde is always fun. It's a good time. 11 meme! Gifting 10 more subs, getting her to the 50 sub badge. That's awesome. Gifting to ZB Mike, Zaforlb, uh, Logdog Rocks, <laughs> Glads, OG Swift, It's Fooly, Zyro, C. Oh, that's Oceanic, so that kind of. Uh, Crazy Cappy, Brothine, Brothine, and Him Friendly. Thank you so much. Hopefully, some of them uh, enjoy their subs. Back for the channel point grinding. Yes, indeed. Okay, I know I missed some. I know I missed some comments before the gifted subs and Sig's message. Who has watched Legend of Korra? Is it worth the time? I think so. Korra is a different vibe, but if you like the universe, you should give it a try. Uh, Bob Rom, welcome. Welcome, Xenon bro. Welcome. I'm doing great. Off college for two weeks now. Nice. Yeah, I. Ah. Uh... So how about the P.O. Box thingy? Okay, you are the only person who wants to send me anything, to my knowledge. Sig and I tried to open a P.O. Box, and it, we were so lazy. It was slightly more difficult than we expected, and then we were like, eh, never mind. <laughs> we drove to the post office. Good to find! Thank you so much! We talked to the post office guy, who was a real treat. Sig knows what I'm talking about. And we just... Needed like my parents for some part of the sign up process for a PO box because it's not my home and then we were like, eh, never mind. Yeah, like it required my name to be on some kind of paperwork, which meant my mom and dad, mom or dad, needed to open the PO box for me, which makes sense, it's their house, but then we were like, eh. <laughs> In my entire YouTube career, I think three people have ever wanted to send me something. People that I, I didn't know personally well enough to trust them with my address. Like, Jaffe wanted to send himself to me, and I, I've known him since before I made YouTube videos, so I, I did trust him with my address. And then he did. He delivered himself, and he and I hung out, and it was cool. Anyway, uh, thank you! Good to fight! Thank you so much! Yeah, Tucci, let me ping for it. Uh, let me ping for it. Uh, big hype train by my current standards, since my current standards is streaming once a week, so any hype train is big by my eyes right now. I think level six is uh, not as crazy as we could do, but we'll see. If anybody wants any hype train emotes, I barely mention it because I'm trying to have a million conversations at once. Uh, if anybody wants to get in on the hype train, you can cheer 100 bits or gift um, uh, a sub, prime sub for free if you have it. A thousand bits will push it along as well. Thank you so much. Mini Dongle coming in with the prime sub, getting in on the hype train, pushing it along, getting some hype train emotes. 
yeah, Leviathan skin makes you invincible to bees. I think it's just an open secret at this point. Like, Levioth Leviathan has just been bugged for years. I don't know why that's still not... Fa I don't get it. it. It might just not be well utilized. I don't know. Um, about the weekly supercharger 160, can you repeat missions? You absolutely can, bum. That's what I'm probably going to do today. I'm just going to run the same couple missions like 10 times. Uh, good divide. Thank you again, again. Um, do you think I can get the 10k? No. So... Channel points, uh, you're a subscriber, I believe? Yeah, so subscribers get uh, 220 as base. I think 254 is when you add on the 20%. These are just memorized numbers. So if it's 220 per hour on average and you're a subscriber, it's 264. That's how many channel points you get on an hourly basis in the stream. Um, if you jump off the map, it does not actually affect your channel points. Dragon, thank you for the Prime sub. F Nordy, thank you for the Prime sub. If anybody watching has Amazon Prime and hasn't used it to get a free subscription on Twitch, you know, just saying, I'll take it. I'll take it. I do this full time. I rely on people's support. Actually, I don't want to pressure people like that. I, I do rely on support, but I'm okay if you don't Prime sub. But I'll take it still. I will. Although, if you guys want to donate for zero dollars, check out Marvel Strike. Link in chat. If you get to level seven with my link, I get financial benefits, and that also goes for level 20 and 30. I really do appreciate it. It's a fun game. You can play for free. You can reach those levels for zero dollars, and you get a good time. So you get to support me, play a fun game, and have a good time doing it. We're all winning there. I don't know if we have to pay for the P.O. Box, but seeing as there's been very low demand to send me stuff, I just don't know. I also don't know what he wants to send me, so that... That would need to be known, bloodier. If you want to DM me what you're trying to send me, I, I, I'd love to open it if people want to. How does Prime Sub work? Do they not lose money for it? Well, you have to pay for Amazon Prime, and then you get a ton of Prime benefits. Um, but then, yeah, I think they actually do lose money on Prime Subs. It's a whole thing. <clears throat> Yeah, Storm Guide, I see you. 11 meme, thank you so much! Papa Bear's a fun weapon. The typewriter's actually decent. If you want the fullest breakdown I am possible of making, I made this video right here. Typewriter's identical, 11 meme. That video is three fun loadouts for the typewriter. It shows the weapon extensively, and if you think that looks fun, then check out the uh, Papa Bear. There's a student rate Prime membership. Yeah, I think, I honestly think Amazon does lose money on Prime subs. That's why they adjusted how much creators get based on your country location. But it's still offered. And I do get the money as if it was a real sub. So, yeah. Find an abandoned house near you and have things shipped there. Yeah, there's no flaw in that. Uh, level 7 hype train. I'm trying to catch up on chat. I haven't even glanced at YouTube. I looked at your Raven build and made it my main loadout. It's so good. It's so good, Thrax. Shorts, Welcome. We'll beat that mission instantly. Yeah, we went through it easy. Easy. Um, yeah, last round I had a level 132 player that used fire guns and brick walls. What? Yeah, no, not everybody knows how to play the game. It's just a thing. Aura, getting in on the hype train. Thank you so much. I need to queue these missions quickly because we are on a rush here. Good to find. You guys know if you cheer, like... You guys aren't fucking around. Thousand, 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 thousand. Like, you know, if you cheer a little less, we can fill up the tip jar, have a little fun with it. Not even necessary. Just no fucking around here. God damn it. Thank you so much. Thank you so much. What is the game Marvel about? You get to play with different Marvel characters in Marvel Strike Force. Uh, it's free to play. You can check it out and learn everything for zero dollars. But um, you get to fight as like Spider-Man, Deadpool, basically every Marvel character, Hulk. Uh, I can't name them all. And you get to save the world. There's a whole storyline in the game. It's pretty pretty fun, actually. Uh, it's not what... It's not what I want it to be based on the game, but it's pretty... Yeah, I've heard that say. Like, the reviews for the show itself are good, but it kind of let down the gamers. I'm a gamer. I would be let down by it. Soon as Master Chief took his mask off, I my heart broke. Mystics, welcome again, by the way. I think I said welcome, but... Um, yeah, I'm doing a million things at once. You thought you were screwed? No, bomb. You'll be fine. You'll be fine. Uh, have you seen the new Korra style? Isn't it just like a different hairstyle? I don't know. Get a box at the UPS store. Well, good to find. That's what we're talking about. It's just getting a PO box. I don't know everything involved, though. Um, been grinding. Got to 42. J plays. That's awesome. Because, like, a part of me was like, bro, settle down. I only needed people to hit 30. But, like, the fact that you're enjoying it makes the sponsor happy. And I think they do, like, check in on people who downloaded the game with my link and like they they keep track of that data and if you keep on playing it you know <laughs> it, it it works well for me and obviously if you're enjoying the game that's even better 
I I feel like that's the ultimate goal of a sponsorship. They want people to find the game and either get into it or get back into it and, and just have a good time doing it in the uh, in the hopes that you'll keep playing. So I'm glad that I could at least re reintroduce you to uh, a game you used to enjoy because a game I've been playing a lot lately is Bloons Monkey City. I have been... This is not a sponsorship, by the way. Bloons is just a game, but I, uh... This is gonna be loud, I'm sorry. Here. It's just so fucking loud. Jesus. I gotta collect my farms. I'm gonna be doing this all stream long, by the way. Mm-hmm. Yeah, okay. That's all I gotta do there. Alright, sweet. Shit's free on Steam. So fucking fun. I love that game so fucking much. I hit level 40 years ago. And then my Ninja Kiwi account says I have a an account at 34, and now I'm starting over again. <laughs> Game's amazing. So yeah, there you go. That's that's my sponsored. No, Bloons isn't sponsored. So check out Marvel Strike Force and Bloons if you want. Actually, um, I don't think they sponsored like this stream specifically. I'm just letting you guys know anyway. Play stream a couple times, and so many people who play Bloons games never do- Yeah, Bloons Monkey City was like, not the most popular, but it's so fun. It's super predatory with the money. Uh, they want you to spend money on Bloons Monkey City hard. But, like, I'm not gonna, so... Bloonstones are easy enough to get, and that's the only thing they sell, so... Well, they sell the... Decorative packs, but I care very little about that. Um, they want you to spend time on that game. Dude, when an upgrade takes two days, it's like... It's... yeah. They, they, you cannot speedrun Bloons Monkey City. There's... there's no speedrunning this game. Uh, Hype Train has one minute left. We are exactly at level eight. Thank you again, everybody who's participated. Good to find an 11 meme just with the fucking gifted. There was one more. There's one more. I don't want to forget people. 11 meme, good to find... I think that was it, actually. But there are a lot of- I was talking about the big gifted subs, a lot of people getting on it. I really appreciate it. Um, yeah, Clash of Clans is a very different game. Um, they sell banana farmers- yeah, that's the only thing I might buy. It's like two dollars, but then you can put banana farmers down, which is really convenient for farming. If I spend two dollars on a free game that's given me dozens of hours of enjoyment, I won't feel bad. I won't feel bad. I've, I've done that in Pokemon Go. Like, I will spend money on a game if it enhances my experience. That... That makes sense. You know, like... Monkey Farmers, like, you're not just speeding up an upgrade. It's not a one-time purchase where you just do a thing and then you never experience it again. No, 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 no. If that unlocks Monkey Farmers, that will forever and always make using Monkey Farms easier. So, to those who have never played Bloons before, when you farm money in that game during a defense, you have to pick up the bananas that pop out of the farm, and then they give you extra money that you can spend on other towers. Monkey farmers do it for you, and that is so convenient. Every game in Bloons that has ever offered monkey farmers, I take advantage of them because they are awesome. But, I don't know. Uh, level 8, perfectly on the dot, 0% past it. Thank you so much. I know I've been on a break, and I know I'm streaming once a week, so when these crazy hype trains happen, even when I've been streaming as little as I have been, it's truly humbling. This continued support, even with my absence, is just... It, I really appreciate it. I really appreciate it. Can you go same mission every time for Weekly Supercharger? You can, Bugra. Uh, bu Bugra? Bu uh, Bugra? Help me with your name. But, yeah, you can run the same mission ten times. That's what we'll be doing. Uh, want to face off contested territory? Yeah, we might have to DM uh, there, Storm God, because I didn't. I, I think you and Jaffe are the only two people I'm aware of that even have the game, and I will need to do contested territory stuff. I'm currently playing on a account that's not linked to a Ninja Kiwi account, so I might have to pull up one of my spare emails and because I don't want to link it to my main account and then like accidentally overwrite some progress that I might care about. I don't know. I'd like to keep my old saves intact. And I don't want to restart what I've done right now, because I got like 15 hours of playtime, so... Yeah, we'll see. Well, Kratos returned today. I don't know. Love the game so much. Good. Good, because I'm going to need you and I... We need to, like, raid each other or whatever. We can contest a territory or something. I, I haven't gotten into the monkey v monkey stuff yet. I'm still early game. I never even did that much in my old playthrough. I hit level 40, so... Yeah, but I've been loving the crap out of it, especially since Bloons Monkey City is... 
based on Bloons Tower Defense 5 mechanics. So all the towers I've been using in Bloons Tower Defense 6 are just different now. Ninja Monkeys are back to being overpowered. Same with Boomerangs. Mob Shredder is insane. I, I've been having a good time. I've been having a good time. Um, yeah. To those who don't know, Bloons Tower Defense 6 is one of my most played games on Steam. I currently have... 483 hours, which is a lot. That's a lot for somebody who doesn't play it that often. Uh, how do I join the Discord? You just click the link. Just just click it, yeah. Got one playthrough to 36, then I recently started doing that on stream. Yeah, it's awesome. It's awesome. And it's fun just restarting, because I wanted a casual game that didn't require too much thinking. You know, I have a lot of end-of-the-night calls with a girlfriend where I want to give her most of my attention, but I don't want to just stare at my wallpaper while we call. So, I, I need something. You Believe it or not, after these longer streams, I am quite tired and incapable of enjoying games like Tears of the Kingdom. So, I needed a game that I can just kind of turn my brain off. And Bloons Monkey City is perfect. There's so much grinding in that game. There is something like... 3,000 tiles, I think, is the map size. Is it 60 by 50? Does somebody want to hop on the on the wiki, Storm God? Oh, you're in-game. Don't do not do that. But does somebody want to wiki this for me? Bloons Monkey City map size. How big is that? Um, and, Hero, do you want to run base in your support? Uh, base MD? Because if she's running Constructor, it'd be super useful to run base MD. He's really... Look at this. This is the look of somebody who Googled it. This fucking guy. I, I told him not to go to the wiki, but he's way too excited about Monkey City right now. Look at him. Look at him getting bullied. Look at that health going down. This fucking guy's more excited about balloons. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He comes back and deletes it because that's what a Huskbuster does. I'll check if I can if I have the hero. Yeah, base MD's super worth it. If you don't have them, then we'll figure it out. Hey, no cool. No, cool. I see that uh, Prime badge. Have you uh, used that this month? Just checking in. Just checking in. 3,000 tiles formed in a 60 by 50. Fucking look at that. I remember things. I remember things. You guys want to hear something? So, I did a thing on my Instagram. Oh, I'm going to link you. This is super fun. I don't want to... Yeah, I'm going to link you guys something. I'm going to link you... All right. All right, Storm God, you like Bloons Monkey City and you want something fun? Here, here, here. I got something for you. I'll, I'll do it in a... Is this the right weapon to be using for this right now? I might just want to use... Triple... Attack Speed Ravager. Okay. I used to do Instagram posts on Bloons Monkey City where I would... Uh, hide a dart monkey under trees and stuff and foliage. And I would ask people to try and find it. And I'll send you guys a link. Mm, okay. I don't think we're going to die if I do this. I see Blood Ears message, but I'm not ready to digest it right now. So I'm just going to let that go for right this second. I'll leave it unopened so I don't forget. God, I talk to this girl a lot. I need to stop texting the girlfriend so much. It makes it hard to find stuff. I don't want to use a search bar. I'm being stubborn. All right, here we go. So this is what I'm talking about. If you guys check out this link, there are six hidden dart monkeys in here. Uh, it could be fun. Is it fun to grind? Voxify, yeah. Save the world is a nice long grind. There are so many different weapons and heroes. There's so many different ways to play save the world. Yeah. If you're ever getting bored of save the world, like just check out my videos. I've got... Tons of different fun loadouts and different ways to play the game. If you ever get stuck in a rut, my videos will surely help you get unstuck and find different ways to enjoy it. I think it's worth it. I'm logged, GG. You're logged? What does that mean? Love mon found a monkey? Yeah, so there are six of them in that one. And I used to do like all sorts of these different puzzles. So, anyway. But my point is, I was showing the girlfriend that and she looked at the date. And I realized this was nine years ago. That made me feel so old. Holy shit. So when I'm talking about all this Bloons Monkey City knowledge, I'm going back nine years. Oh. 
So anyway, these are the effects that a great mobile game can have. Uh, just like uh, Marvel Strike Force. If you guys want to check it out and create some memories that you'll come back to nine years later, just like Jay plays in the chat, you can check it out with the link in chat. If you make it to level 7, 20, and 30, it supports me financially directly, and I really do appreciate it. Got my IP and info, meaning joking way. Oh, nice, I'm locked. Oh, right, yeah, no, I don't. That's an actual Instagram link. I'm not grabbing IPs. I don't need anybody in chat's IP. That's not what I'm after here. One well, of my first few favorite guns. Uh, I started playing when the military weapons came out, actually. Coincidentally, I didn't plan that. So, Bobcat and uh, Silent Spectre were two of my first favorites. Stabsworth X Mission? Yes. Yes, Nicholas, I absolutely can. I will do that. Uh, fix the inventory bug after patch. I don't know. I'm not. I'm not up to date with that. How much health do you normally have without blast in the past? Uh, seven to nine hundred thousand sounds right. I am max power level though. You don't need, but you want. Oh fuck! You don't need, but you want. Damn it, darkness! I just answered like five messages since the thing you're re referring to. What did I say? What did I not need? I'm sorry. Explain your joke. I... I lost my own. Do you help viewers of Adventure? Uh, you don't need IP. Got it. Oh, but you want IP. <laughs> Are you doing like the fingers touching like, but do you, do you want my IP? Is that what you're doing right now? <laughs> Are you being cutesy? Just like, I, I'd love it if you wanted my IP. This is like that dark humor of someone being like, why doesn't anybody ever stalk me? <laughs> like, what? What the fuck? Why, why do the other girls get stalked? Why don't I? <laughs> like, what are we doing here? You found the monkeys? It's kind of hard, right? Like, it takes some time. Hero, do you have uh, base MD? <laughs> Fucking risky. What do you recommend I do first, story or what? Volksify, you should do as much of Ventures as possible. Ventures gives you access to a lot of stuff. It repeats... Um, I want Corrupted Aura. I kind of like him in support. He's not like optimal or anything dramatic, but he's so strong. So nice to have. Uh, where's in the book? Uh, the Culture of What? It would be Warden Kyle. I'll show a picture of him. I'll get his beautiful face on screen here. Warden Kyle, this big guy right here. Holiday. Super useful. That healing is so nice for everybody. Uh, just completed Save the World weeks ago. Uh, how do you complete Save the World? I don't find joy in playing anymore. Just curious. How are you having fun playing Save the World? Booger, I play once a week. I play this game very sparingly. I come in once every once in a while when I have a lot of- Swag dog. <laughs> Thank you for the sub, Jake. I appreciate it. I come in once in a while when I have a lot to do, and it keeps me very interested that way. I'm also like a full-time content creator covering this game. It is- I might, I might as well be at work right now, or as close to it as I get. So, you know, I obviously have that vested interest, but- I do actually like the game. I'm very stuck in ventures right now. I'd love it if anybody could help me. Yeah, Logdog, if you want to play with uh, Volksify in the YouTube chat, you know, do a little cross connect there. In fact, I usually link the Twitch chat in YouTube and I'm being reminded that I. Uh, Llama Show is about to reset in four hours. You gonna make, yeah, video? Yeah, of course, every day. I make my daily video every day. Uh, Hero, I'm gonna find it in collection. Okay, I'm just gonna queue the mission. We don't require him if you don't have him it's whatever but he's nice to have so i am on a rush i want to make my i want to finish this do i have my stabs or all done of course yeah. and then this is built for yeah i, I took out uh white alfiona because there's no critting going on here what are these 12 packs thingy stream loots yeah let me run the full command there's a s on there super fun no cool no cool did you answer my question about that prime sub i just want to make sure you used it on someone there What inspiration made you do content? Oh god, that's a big one. Found him? Sweet hero. Yeah, he's great. He's actually maybe worth about- uh, I don't know. If you've got all the good heroes, hero, then base MD is worth a voucher. He comes out in the holiday season, so not soon. So I set my background on Google here to just be like a randomized ocean theme every day, and it has brought joy to my life. So yeah, if I just do ba no, uh, warden... Oh, is Warden Kyle Holiday Llamas? He must be, so. November 20th is a ways away. 
All right, let's recycle these nearly broken storm blades. Getting lots of resources back. I never, I, I asked this question several times and I'm really busy with chat today, I'm sorry. Um, once again, can I get a, a yes or no? Are weapons recycling for more than they used to? It seems like it, but I don't know. Are we getting, yes? Yeah, I thought so. They are, that's cool. I, I don't, like the traps being bugged, but I, I would like weapons to keep giving us more, yeah. No, you should never solo for 160s. So, if you're even in my stream, then you should never have to solo another game again. Um, alright. Our Discord is awesome. Lots of people to hang out with. Lots of people in the chat. Um, 160s are literally labeled four-player missions for a reason. Yeah, I assume weapons are giving you more on accident, and traps are giving less on accident, so... God, this weapon's so fucking strong. You guys know why I point this out all the damn time in my daily videos? This- this is why. One swing. This is Paleo Luna being awesome, by the way, but the attack speed on this weapon is just awesome. Eight coconuts should be easy. With all these bushes around, they're so quick to check. I cry. Oh, well, then I get five. All I had to do is cry. That big feeds off my tears. God, it's so quick. And then Corrupted Aura, look at this. So I, I kill one enemy and then everything around me just takes all this extra damage. Look at that, look at all that extra damage. I'm not even attacking some of these enemies and they're just dying. Healing Death Burst is kind of a problem there, but if you're in a crowd of enemies, that certainly helps. Well, let me eat a coconut and replace it immediately. Oh, fuck yeah. Dude, this change is not as bad as people make it sound. Double tech speed is also ridiculous. I'm sure it is. Yeah. I'm doing double attack speed right now, though. I'm not open to... Uh, plus, you already subbed to a friend. Okay, good. No, cool. Good. No, you keep me banned for a year. Yeah, that's true. You, you, you deserve the ban. But you still check in. You still check in. And I don't even mean me, necessarily. I just want to know that everybody is using their prime subs. That's all I'm after. If you're subbing to your friend, that's great. That really is great. Some people forget. You know, the amount of times that I'll mention Prime subs in my chat and then somebody will Prime sub to me just encourages me to continue mentioning it because people forget they have it. Myself included. I set a calendar reminder to use my Prime sub, but then it'll go off on a time when I'm not pulling up Twitch right now. Like, I'll be at the girlfriend's place and I'm not thinking about it, and then I just don't use my Prime sub for a week. So, it's always good to spend it, in fact. You were 16? That's true. You were banned like five years ago, but... April 6th. Okay, that's when I get my sub back. 250 power level. Look at that damage, dude! This is the sound of somebody who has not used a stab's worth in a while. What the fuck? What the fuck? This is Sunbeam, too. This would be stronger if it was... Jesus! It would swing faster if it's Bright Core. Most of our damage is coming from Luna here. That's what... Oh my god. And the swing speed I love because... You know, AS is trying to sell me on double crit damage here. But I love just swinging super fast. I love jumping in, attacking, and running away. You know? Like that literal turnaround is so effective. I can just come in, do the damage, and run away. Go back to being annoyed about the hair on my mouse pad. I can feel it crunching under my mouse. It's driving me fucking crazy. Yeah, Stabsworth is amazing melee. Who is trying to play with Volksify from YouTube on Volksify? There you go. Yeah, if you guys are trying to team up for Ventures or 160s, Volksify is a little underleveled for 160s, but Ventures is great. I honestly recommend Ventures for low players, uh, low level players, because Ventures can easily get you to power level 50, 70, 80 missions. If you keep it up, you can get to the 140s in Ventures. And what that means is you can be getting tons of hero XP, weapon XP, survivor XP. You can get access to legendary survivors, different rewards from Ventures. Ventures has great weapons and heroes on a daily basis. Like, Right here, Ventures Awards, Wall Launcher, Seal Electric Fields, available in the 108 zone. Thrasher is one of the, it is the best SMG in the game. And it's power level 70. So you get a lot of really good stuff as a low power level player in Ventures. And Ventures is limited time. You can do your main story quest, and you should. You can do them whenever you want. Ventures is resetting in a week. 
So keeping up on ventures is typically good, especially for low-level players. You ever play Battle Royale? Yes. Uh, how do you get wafers and coconuts? Uh, coconuts from Crossbones Barrett. Wafers are from Main Stage Quinn. From the Rad Hero section. Ventures is so ass. Yeah, Ventures is super, ex super excruciating for endgame players. We miss our good weapons and using the loadouts that we enjoy using. Ventures is not something I enjoy personally much at all. But if you're a new player and you don't have every weapon in your wildest dreams, Ventures gives you access to them without needing the schematic, and you might not be caring about perks anyway. Like, Volksify is making comments about being a Plankerton player. So if you're in Plankerton, you don't have an inventory full of power level 130 gold perked weapons. You have whatever you've gotten from llamas or rewards up to that point. So Ventures weapons aren't going to be much different from your normal inventory at that rate, and Ventures will give you quicker access to better rewards. Queuing a 144 player as a Plankerton player, but doing it in Ventures, and then getting all the perk up associated with that mission just sets you up for a better future, and I think it's worth it to the new level of players. Late game players like myself do not like Ventures. This Stabsworth combo that I'm doing right now, impossible in Ventures unless you get lucky enough to grab a schematic with the right perks. Like, perks are so important to certain configurations that it really sucks to go without them. The amount of fun I'm having right now is not really possible in Ventures without insane luck, and it's just a bummer. Anyway. Is there a 160 Ventures? No, 140 is the peak. You have to do it early, though, because later on it's kind of dry. Um, yep. You actually do? Would you consider... What would you consider Endgame? I was literally thinking about this last night. So... Personally speaking, based on my memories of how good I felt to level up, I think you are out of the early game. This is just my personal opinion. You can disagree or not. It's not a serious question, but I feel like the early game ends as soon as you're done with Canny, actually. Or as soon as you start Canny, I mean. As soon as you are queuing Canny Valley missions, you're not a new player anymore. You've been playing for probably a couple weeks now, maybe a, maybe a month. Once you're in Canny, you're not really an early game player, but you are early mid game, you know? You're by no means an experienced player. You're just out of the very early game. So, I'd say the mid game is huge in Save the World. And it's a lot of RNG based on when you get your survivors, but mid game is like starting in Canny all the way up until, this is all subjective, but maybe power level 116? Storm God said 124, and I kind of agree with that. I, I, I was thinking about that yesterday as well. I feel like... I feel like the... This is so perfect. I have so many late-night personal monologues where I just think about shit, and it so rarely applies to anything that gets asked in stream. But this is exactly what I was just thinking about last night, so I'm happy to be talking about it. Um, I think the end game really starts. Like, the mid-game ends and the end game is there at about 116. Uh, that's when you are absolutely not queuing low-level missions anymore, and you are well and truly playing late game. Um, but the late game also stretches up until the 160 zones, and, yeah. Once you're in the 160s, that's uh, about as late as it gets. Except for Endurance. What load are you using? This is, uh, Paleo Luna. Paleo Luna lead, stabs with a third double attack speed. Just a standard ninja loadout. Like, really standard. Cloak Shadow is actually really good nowadays. I don't know if he's top pick or anything, but he's worth throwing in there. I'll drop the link in chat if you wanted to see the... That video goes over all the different recipes for the best ninja builds. But for a weapon like this, which is super high attack speed and affliction... You can see affliction goes a long way. Look at that affliction damage. I know some traps are involved there, but look. That's Affliction. I technically one-shotted that enemy. This is Affliction damage. I could I could have just walked away. And he dies. So, if you're wondering why I'm always hell-bent on Affliction being awesome, that's why. Man, it's a bummer I only had eight coconuts, you guys. I barely made it through the game. Sorry, I'm being, I'm being sarcastic. The ideal Assassin's Sarah Pale Luna perks are identical for it. Sweet. You know what the actual requirements unlock weapons? Yeah, if you do exclamation point SC. Well, you're in chat as well, Log. Uh, are you? I don't think so. Ah, people keep switching back and forth, but I'll drop the link for the weekly supercharger and that'll play out on Twitch. Um, thoughts on Kratos? I don't know anything about Kratos. Is that a skin? Hey, Squid. Uh, 
Um, remember Sapic? I do. Do I have to use my phone number to verify, or can I use my email? Uh, is that for ventures? I'm not sure. I don't know. Ready, Paul? And gifting a sub to Playboy, uh, Playboy Defeezy. Thank you so much, Playboy Feezy. There we go. I got there. That game makes new season less fun, especially once you've finished the collection book. Yeah. I've always said, I think Save the World has, like, two good years of gameplay. You have the first year of playing every event for the first time, enjoying everything that comes with it. Then you get the next year of using all your best loadouts and filling out your collection book. And once your collection book is full of a copy of every event hero, you've got a copy for yourself to just play with and enjoy. Um, those who play after the two-year mark just really like the game, you know? First year, you get to get everything. Second year, you get to use everything. Third year, you're just chilling. Doing ventures or something. He was texting me trying to get me to... Gotcha, thank you. I'm only comfortable mid-twine. 124 is above for V-Bucks. Yeah. You got gifted a sub. Yeah, enjoy it. And I see that Prime badge. Maybe you can Prime sub to somebody if you haven't yet. Tips for finding better guns and ventures, Leroy. Just do all the things. Kill glowing animals... Vending machines, search containers, do storm chests, do target practice, do every little thing that can drop an item. Target practice, you don't need to use a pistol, you can just use the shotgun. Does anybody ever give tier 2 or 3 subs? They do. It's rare. Tier 2 subs are $10 instead of 5 and tier 3 is $25 instead of 5. But it has happened. Storm chests. Yeah, storm chests are really good for items. Did I say something wrong? You did, Josh? I appreciate it. Are you enjoying the game? Got a war for PlayStation? Oh, I see. Yeah, thank you again, Ready Punch. I appreciate it. That's the reason I still use Gravedigger higher up. If there isn't anything healing... Yeah, Gravedigger is strong. I made a video on that. Uh, here. All right, uh, you know what I want to do just because I can. It shouldn't be significant, but I want to do it anyway. I want to stabs worth bright core. Uh, this one at least has affliction. Oh, you can't change the perks in advance now. I guess that makes sense. Ah, Obsidian, yes. This is why console is better for two seconds. Console gets to be better for one day a year. Uh, actually, it's still better for PC to just do that. What? Yes, thank you. Uh, this is a nature mission, tax speed. Stuff like that. Okay, this is where console is better. I'm just rolling my thumb. Just rolling my thumb. This is so much quicker. Okay, controller goes away. When you guys see a random Windows disconnect sound in a little while, that's my controller disconnecting, it's not you. Uh, Hero, are you running base MD? I assume you are. That was nice. Gotta put floors down though, I need to walk on them. Do you have many tier 3 subs except you? I... don't remember how to check that. Because I know I do, but the number eludes me. I have... two! Tier 3 subscribers right now on Twitch. And one tier 2. And I think some of you are here, because I know Squid was in here rocking that star. You can tell by the star. I'm outing Squid. This is what you get for supporting the channel. You're going to get called out and appreciated. That's right, Squid. I'm, oh, God damn it. Why does it always get so tiny? That's what she said. Okay. Squid, yeah. So if you click on it. Um, tier 2 sub. Squid is my singular tier 2 sub on Twitch right now. Thank you, Squid! <laughs> I really appreciate it. You have to level up to like 20 minutes to change the perks? Or, yeah. Only locked to the base level. It's only locked to the base level. I don't know why, or I don't actually... I don't know. It seems like you need to level it up to change it, which is probably a fine change. So here's the main difference, people. Brightcore will swing faster. So this is 0.28. Uh, Sunbeam and Brightcore is uh, 0.25. Now, 0 0.03 swing speed might not sound like a lot. And you'd be right. But when it comes to Paleo Luna, that's significantly faster. 
Like, that's tens of thousands of damage per second that you get to output more now. Kind of insane, right? Like, we can actually calculate this pretty easily. So, I'm gonna do 1.2 million. Just to get the exact number. 0.25. Looks like it's showing me the right number. Some memes 0.24. Ah! Battle Beat's happening! I threw my drones down and it's activating Battle Beat. Okay, alright. Battle Beat makes your swing speed faster. So if you're doing 0.28, if you're doing uh, that times 0 0.09, this is how much damage Paley Luna is doing, 108,000. If you are doing one second divided by 0 0.28 times 108,000. So Paley Luna is doing this much DPS for 108,000, okay? But point two five, yeah. So it's not going to be a ton, but you can see where this is going. I know that number is four. Yeah, you know, a hundred divided by twenty-five. I know it's four. So if you take four times one hundred eight thousand four hundred and thirty-two, four hundred and thirty-two thousand. We are doing rounding for a dramatic effect here. We are doing fifty thousand more damage per second. Just because this is bright core. And that does make up for the missing damage. Because we're only doing like 37,000 damage compared to 45,000. Which is a little bit. You know, it's a minor difference of like 8,000 damage per second. Which if you take like 100 divided by, you know, 0.28, right? Yeah. Uh, that's the wrong number, but you get the idea. 1 divided by 0.28, there we go times 8,000 damage per second, like, it's... Anyway, Bright Core is better. Slightly. <laughs> it's really slight. I've seen Bright Core differences as, as, of like 7%. It's, it's there. It's not dramatic, but it is just better. And you need to keep your health up. As your health goes down, Sunbeam eventually is just stronger again. But if your health is down, you're probably in a dire situation. How's today? Today is great, Audi. Should I make an app that calculates damage for you automatically? Uh, we have that. We have multiple calculators. AS has a calculator that he sent me, and I don't have it saved somewhere, and I should. And I have my own calculator. I was just demonstrating something simple there, and I don't know how I could have... I don't think a calculator would have helped me much there. I can make a better calculator. Uh... I think you're teasing. You gotta be careful with that. AS put a shit ton of work into his calculator. So, you're, you're, you're bringing him down if, if you make a comment like that. I'm sure he'll be okay, though. He's a big boy. He won't tell me how old he is, but I think not a kid. But I don't know. The Chris Bosch guy that works for and isn't... Well, psh, well, then fucking there you go. If you tell me your calculator isn't perfectly accurate, then she might be right. It'll be faster, and it'll use official game file. Don't fucking go for it. <laughs> Lots of calculators have been made and attempted for Save the World, and most have been fine. What will it take to get unbanned from your Discord server? Uh, exclamation point, ban appeal. No. I did something bad. It was fucking retarded. I'm 16. When I graduate, I'm going to the Air Force. I don't know how that's related. <laughs> what? Wait, I don't know where the Air Force comment comes in. I don't... Yeah, Bandit, there you go. You gonna start working on it after this mission? Sure. We don't need it, though. I want you to make... I, I want that to be known right now. We, we have calculators. We have ways to find the numbers. Perfectly efficient ones. But if you want to go for it, for a project, then I'm obviously not gonna stop you. So I know it's healing Death Burst, so Cloak Shadow's really not doing much here, but it really... It's a lovely feeling. Look at this. Look at all the, all that white damage is Cloak Shadow, just being kind of awesome. So when it's not healing Death Burst, and his damage isn't kind of getting count, countered, you're basically just passively damaging every enemy around you. It's great. Smoke Bomb does something similar. Not like that calculator is different from mine. What? 
Are you talking about the calculator I was just using, like the Windows one? Or are you talking about like an actual... I'm confused now, actually. Because I, I doubt the Windows calculator is the best thing I could be using. Because this is what I use when I'm actually being serious. Uh... I know that this calculator is slightly flawed, but it's also just fine. Yeah, this calculator right here. This is taking the sheet damage, and I understand that that number isn't precisely accurate, but it's good enough. Like, everything I calculate is incorrect by the same amount, so it shouldn't matter. It's whatever. I have uh, been able to get exact values when I need it. It's rarely necessary, though. After this mission, I'll probably make the best, most ac Okay. I love watching the Smashers go down easy. Really enjoying this game, level 33 right now. What level are you? Uh, are you talking about Marvel Strike Force? I think I, I finished the sponsored stream at 16. And I've been personally getting a bug where the game won't... Like, it starts loading, and then it stops at 38%, and I don't know why. So I even tried to play the game outside of the sponsor segment, and I couldn't, and then... And then I left it there. I know. I'm sorry. You hit 33 though, Josh? That's fucking sweet. Uh, if you're talking about Save the World, I'm 145. But Josh had mentioned that he was getting into Marvel Strike Force, so I figured that's what he's talking about. Exclamation point, I am going to die. Well, don't, don't die. Keep living. It's because of different versions of Windows, yeah. Long you've been playing Save the World? Uh, June of 2018 is when I started. And I have 7,300 hours in something like that. Imagine using Google Sheets for calculation. Yeah, I don't know. This is like a weirdly condescending approach to a basic thing. The Sheets calculator works fine. And it makes it easy to share. I don't... <laughs> I think you're over-engineering this. <laughs> I have never seen any problem with a Google Sheets calculator. It gets me the numbers I need. I built my entire channel off of... That fucking calculator. It works fine. <laughs> I don't... I don't know what pro what flaw you're trying to fix here. I don't... She's taking an, an issue that doesn't exist and promising she's going to improve on it. I mean, I, I, you, you can go for it, but... Totally over-engineering. Simple is always best. I, that's not always true, but I, you're right. It, simpler, the better. C plus, faster, and overall better. But it is fast enough. Now, you're right. It doesn't read the game files. No. You do need to input the numbers yourself. But they calculate instantly. It's kind of great. Check this out. Check this out, chat. Look, 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 look. Pulling this back open to demonstrate. So, if I change a value, check this shit out. Look at this, look at this DPS number. If I change a value like swing speed... Look at that number. Breaking itself instantly because I put two decimals. Oh! It's fucking instant. It's beautiful. You know what would be cool, Hero? If you want to put your big brain to actually something genuinely useful. AS might get some inspiration from this. I would love a data table. Oh, my nerdy brain is just. Unremarkable squid wants you to jump off the map. The nerdy part of my brain is just so happy right now. Imagine a calculator. All right, so Hero and AS. Let me tell you both the biggest time sink in comparing two weapons is physically entering in the numbers, all right? So if I could have a list of every weapon in the game and I could just click on it, and when you click on that, literally an icon. I want a UI, hero. Don't give me some command line shit, all right? I need to see the weapon. If I could just click on Stabsworth, and it would fill in all of the base values for a 130 stabs worth. Sunbeam or Brightcore, you can just click the button to switch between them. That would be fucking sweet. 
That would actually save me time and make a real difference. AS says he's already working on that. That would be really useful. Because that's what I wanted to do earlier. I wanted to just plug in a Bright Core Stab's worth and plug in a, sta a Sunbeam and just show the difference in damage. Mine won't be fancy UI stuff, it's just the information. Yeah. I would love that. I would love if you could just click that and it had the saved data for every useful weapon in the game. It wouldn't even need to be every weapon. Literally the top 20% most popular weapons would be fine. After this mission, I'll make it, yeah. And if you wanted to read the game files, you could probably automate that to some degree. Just read the game files and take the, uh... I want 130. I, it's not useful to me to take base values, by the way, because weapons grow and evolve. A 130 version of a weapon compared to another one. Like, for example, the Pop Shot, Ground Pounder, and Husk Buster all have identical DPS if you compare the base values. But once you level them up to 130 and you actually use the relevant perks associated, that's not true anymore. So it's actually useless information. It's more trivia than anything else. Um, yeah, Matteo can get you off to a good start. Yeah, just cut me off at the get you off part. Because matteo has got a good jumping off point here, and... There is some useful information in here. I don't see a lot of number values besides... I don't know. It's at least a comprehensive list of weapons, and that's that's not nothing. I'll make it. Parse the data. Alright. Fucking go crazy. Uh, question for you. So now I'll say the real veteran. Should I use all my lower level crafting materials before I upgrade all schematics to better or... No. No. You'll always get more and more and more. Like I said earlier, 7,000 hours in the game, and I still hold on to, like, just random lower tier parts. You'll always get more. There's no no need to use them all up. Don't save them. Uh, regarding melee weapons, see a lot of broken camera sort of hammer thing. Yeah, so it makes you run faster. Baron has triple movement. It's the only weapon in the game that has triple movement. So when you hold it, you're just like... So I scroll for my weapons. If I scroll down, I'm basically just running 42% faster instantly. It's super useful. Yes, infamous kid, please. That used to be the most annoying thing. I was setting up a Minecraft server, and one of our nerds just wanted us to use command line, bro. And I was like, fuck you, bro. He was telling me all about how it's better, it's better, it's better. I was like, yeah, but I can't use it. I can't, I cannot use this. I am not gonna learn command line commands. Fuck you. <laughs> so if you can help them make this look good, that sounds awesome. If you want to take their good data and make it usable to everyday people, that is perfect. Oh, good. Someone bloodier clarified what he wants to mail me. He said art. Fucking sweet. I told you guys my controller would disconnect. What are you looking at right now, Archer? I'll go check out a Korra style. Korra's dummy thick? Is that what the kids say nowadays? I don't even fucking know. Oh, yeah, I have to actually... Oh, it is her in the Avatar state. Fucking knew it. I suggested it might be. That's like spirit Korra or something. They call it balanced, but I don't know what the fuck that means. Well, I have to... Oh, you get Aang's glider that he gets from the, uh, the mechanist. Oh, I'm sorry, this is Korra's glider, because, you know, fuck me, right? Um, actually, this was designed for Aang during the, the siege of the Fire Kingdom, during the, the, the Day of Black Sun, okay? This is just an improved Avon version. So I guess it might be hers, but... That glider definitely could hold me. Yeah, Matteo? Matteo, I think you would be a sturdy Earthbender. I think that's... that looks really fucking cool. Whoa. All four elements? Holy shit, dude. I need to, like... Oh, that looks so good. God damn it. Do I have to play Battle Royale now? Like, is this what I... What do I do? What do I do, chat? How do I get this? Can you do Ground Pounder now? Yes. 
I think I'm running smoke screen missions. Maybe not. If you play BR, I'll carry you. I don't need that. But thank you. Um, actually, it's Korra's. Um, yeah, Korra's is like an improved upon design beast. What you're referring to is the episode where they siege the Fire Nation. I know this because I watched it yesterday. <laughs> I know this because I was literally watching this yesterday. <laughs> Fucking yesterday. Timaeus, thank you for the sub. I appreciate it. Made a few friends there before I get banned. Yeah, just don't do stupid shit and you won't get banned. So. Your light redeem? Oh, I saw electric. So look, when I see nearly three lines of text, I, my brain fades out thinking like, oh, this is just another loadout he wants me to try. No, no, no. This was just him wanting an electrifying experience of blue, which is never going to happen when my windows open and it's. Oh, yeah. By the way, you guys, by the way, winter's back. Just because, you know, it was spring for like two... Oh, wow, that camera isn't correcting to save its life. Jeez. How do I even fix this? This is how you miss your 160s, by the way. Is it like the white balance, maybe? No, it's not. I, I don't know how to adjust this is it backlight comp no whatever gamma gamma uh gamma's locked all right well whatever suffice it to say it's really fucking bright outside i lurk before i get a seizure i'm sorry i'm i'm done now are you epileptic do i need to like not show super bright lights out there Use code MSF6. So anyway, when it's that bright out, dude, that Cora set looks so fucking good. She's always a cutie too. Cora was uh, an easy to watch show, even muted. I mean, the bonus one, the yeah, uh, don't waste electricity for light. One bonus that you don't have to wait. Yeah, my lights are really dim. I use LEDs actually for most of my lighting. Like I actually have two, three, four, five lights, six light sources in my room. I have a Chiari malformation with seizures. Okay, I don't know what the hell that means, but I will try to be sensitive here. I try not to flashbang my audience. Once I realized uh, from comment, oh fuck, dude, why would you relocate the soldier? Urgh! I after I got a few oh, it's messing me up commenters that said they are light sensitive like that, I try to not. Do that to them. Okay. Fuck. Why would they rearrange that? Oh, we lost people. A hero's off to make her calculator and we're short another one. Uh, we got room for two if anybody wants to hop in. Uh, cat four, evac. Fucking evac. I don't want to do smoke screens, so it's cat four. Alright, what's my purple ground? Not, why is water purple? Ah, damn it. I don't have a supercharged ground pounder doing it. Mm, don't I have 139? I do. Okay. Don't have more than supercharger, it's fine. Okay, I wasn't gonna do a ground pounder then. I'm being texted right now. Yeah. Ah, <sighs> why are professional photographers so fucking expensive? It should not cost six hundred dollars to get five photos. You have what I do, yeah. Beast doesn't help with SATs? I do not. Yeah. People in Discord might though. And Discord isn't just for help, by the way. I highly encourage people to make friends, honestly. Don't just look for help in Discord. Find people that you enjoy playing with and play with them. Sure, Matteo. I'll secure you a spot, Matteo. Get in my games. Record some videos with me. Although that's actually, we'll step on each other's toes. I'll have to mute while I record. That is not Bloons Monkey City. Okay, that's... I'll grab my fucking egg, I guess. This is my profile, in case anybody cares about Bloons 30 Fence 6. Okay. That was the wrong game. Okay, I gotta grab my farms. 
I'll get to talk to you about the this later. A warrior is not too hard with us. Okay, well, a Walry needs to respond to some very long messages I sent her in Discord before she has any chance of hanging out with me. I have unresolved grievances about her personality. And she has made no effort to communicate with me, so... Pass that along, then, because I've given up talking to her. What did I need to upgrade again? Uh, yes. You. Go. All right. Yeah, when you play a time-gated game, this is what happens, alright? You gotta just load that shit up every hour, check in, close it. It loads up so quick, though! I get- oh, shit, I didn't know you were healing me, Shade. That's my bad. Did she leak the modes? I did! Oh no, my loot! It respawns back on the top, you guys. You can't throw stuff off the map. I found this out because I was trying to throw ground pounders. Nope. Uh, grave digger. Nope. Yes, grave diggers off the map. There's a purple one. Why do I keep calling it purple? Why would you tame a glowing raptor? Are you just trying to hurt me? God, the ground pounder's strong, but I am not. I'm weak. You didn't mean to heal me? What is that gun? Ground pounder. This is a cat force. We need blue glow. Shade, do you want to... Uh, I need... Duct tape, crystal. Okay, those three are confirmed. Good. Okay. Wafers! Wafers! Come on down! Come get your wafers! We're giving one every 7%. Go ahead, smack your metallic objects. Hope you get lucky, everybody. Be sure to pop on before the smash and have a good time on the ride. Oh, 14. Fuck yeah. Alright. You want a wafer? I miss Hype Train for resub. Yeah, Shnimbly, I think we might. Okay, that's fucking huge, dude. God damn it. Uh, yeah, it's 49 minutes ago. So, Shnimbly, if you want to set an 11 minute timer, there you go. Shnimbly, I sent you a message because I know you like mobile games, although you might be a little weak to their, uh, their temptations, but. I'm- I'm saying it again. Picked up a mobile game sponsor if you want to check out Marvel Strike Force, Shnamly. I get direct kickback if you make it to level 7. Zero dollars required to play. I'd appreciate it if you give it a look, but if you're not, you know, you let me know. I'm very weak. I know. Shnamly, if they give him an option to spend money on a game, I shouldn't be encouraging these- these things. But you know what? Shnamly's a- Shnamly's a grown. Like- like a whole adult. So... Where that money goes. Okay. You have a 144 ground powder schematic? That gun is crazy. They're not water. Yeah. Yeah, ground powder is insane even at level 130. It does not need to be 144. Uh, little people, let's get the swastikas out of the name or I'm going to have to ban you. What's the loadout for shotguns? It's the basic one. My shotgun loadout video recently posted on the channel is super recommended if you want to build your own loadout, but this is pretty standard for totally rocking out. Um, Ground Ponder is one of the strongest weapons in Fortnite Save the World. Like, I have an unreleased top 10 list that I just keep forgetting to edit, and it... I think the Ground Ponder made it to my number two position. Like, it's that fucking strong. <laughs> like... I'll, I'll work on the top 10 list. Like, I went on break shortly before I finished it, but yeah, it, it made it to, like, my number two position. You can see why. <laughs> it's so strong! God, I love this weapon! 
I'm gonna go get the health pylon. If you guys want to trap quick, I need to get through these 160s quickly today. Please and thank you. We have three hours until shop, but... Mr. Bullseye, thank you for the prime sub! Bullseye, we have a hype train in like 10 minutes. Save it. Take it back. F figure out how to take it back and do that. Um, Blast of the Past Ground Pounder is honestly fine. Blast of the Past Ground Pounder is what I use for years because this weapon clearly doesn't need any help. However, if you give it the help it doesn't need, it deletes everything. Uh, why Ground Pounder instead of Husbuster? Uh, technically, the Ground Pounder has higher DPS. Technically. Um, but I like how fast it shoots. As an everyday carry, it's very, very, very satisfying. Everyday carry. <laughs> As a primary weapon, it's very satisfying. But the Husbuster is also fantastic. When people ask me, should I use Ground Pounder or Husbuster, I say yes. Some of them think I'm being a dick. I honestly just fucking preference, dude. They're both amazing. It's like, should I have six donuts or half a dozen donuts? Like, I don't fucking... Whichever one makes you feel better. I don't care. Cannonade is my favorite weapon for clearing stuff. I believe the reason why is evident. It makes the materials go away. Conceal carry my ground powder. Yeah, right? You know, for some reason, for no reason that we can find, only women can conceal carry ground pounders. Hmm. Or very motivated men. All right, never mind. I don't want to think about this anymore. <laughs> I don't want to think about this anymore. It's hard to say what's the best shotgun. Honestly, I said the Huskbuster is the best shotgun in the game in my top 10 list. And that's heavily factoring in... That's heavily factoring in the cost of it. It's a scavenger weapon. It's super cheap to utilize the weapon because of the, the cost is so much cheaper. Um, but... Then the ground pounder, when you're totally rocking out spamming it, is technically a higher damage per second. And then everything you think you know about shotguns gets thrown out the window once you start looking at the pop shot from the holiday weapon set. I mean, there's just a lot of amazing shotguns in this game. I'm going to put all these floors down that are going to break no matter what, but uh, it's just base MD. She's running base MD, or who? Is anybody running base MD now? Fuck. Why do I? It says two outlanders been lying. Shade, are you running base MD? Surely you are. Um, Shade also, if you want to start it, we're good. Let's see, Storm God. Do you think Kieran's going to actually place broadsides correctly in our game? Which is to say, not any at all. It's exploding death bomb! Whee! My first supercharger, what weapon should I use it on? Uh, Xenon Bow. But I have a whole video on the best weapons to supercharge. Uh, Xenon Bow is not the only answer. There are many good weapons, and my philosophy is shared in that video. Scavenger weapons break faster. They do, Zahaka, but it is still worth it. Like, scavenger weapons break quicker, but it's proportional to how much it costs. So, I'm not gonna lie. I only did the math on one scavenger weapon many years ago, but I think it translates. Like, if it breaks, uh, what is it? 20% faster, but it's 30% cheaper to craft? You know, that's a good deal. The API returns the exact amount of seconds you were in a mission. That's interesting. Room strip with fire rate's incredibly fun. Uh, it actually is usable in the 160s. I made a video on here. Undead. Parody. Should check that video out. Second half of that video features fire rate. Shade, I'm ready when you are. I want to get these missions going. Yeah, he's got it perfect. You're crazy at this game. Yeah, that's awesome weapon. Supercharger. I answered that already on Twitch. Unless two people were asking me about... No, is you. Okay, good. I got the link in chat for you. There's things. Uh, an ice mission with metal corrosion, you want to use metal. So, metal corrosion only triggers from baby zombies, everybody. Which means, as long as you're trapping well enough, as we uh, hopefully are here, it shouldn't even matter. Ground pounder. By the way, affliction means you only need to hit enemies once. Alright, maybe baby targets. And then Chaos Agent makes it even stronger. So look, I'm gonna go in with like six rounds, three, four, five, six, Shockwave, right back into the action. <laughs> you guys like that 270 degree flick? Okay, that was a bad one. <laughs> War Cry to instant reload is my favorite thing. Uh, 
Oh no, a chrome husk. So part of throwing the grenade is so great because the grenade also does damage. So instead of just standing there reloading like, oh gee, I wonder what to do. You get to actually throw a, a grenade that'll do some damage while you're stopping for the reload. That was an accident. Okay, what am I doing? Just... There we go. Oh, I love this weapon so much. What chrome husk? <laughs> yeah, Teddy doesn't trigger Chaos Agent. It should! You play BR? No, but I might, because this chorus set is awesome. Oh hey, a chrome husk. Oh wait, never mind. My mistake. Must have been a must have been a smudge on the screen. What was adding points before it was 10k? Uh I think it was 5,000, but you know. Channel grew, stream grew, too many of peep too many of you people watched my streams. I can't add everybody. See, like, I, I just like to ping them once, because then they die. <laughs> What's better than somebody running Ground Pounder? Two of us running Ground Pounder. This is why I like the Shockwave Reload. It kills all the babies in front of you, and then allows you to just focus on the big targets. Everybody look, a Chrome Husk! Okay, it's gone now. Go back to your Marvel Strike Force. If you want to unlock the set, I recommend doing bot you have to do very specific quests to unlock each cosmetic. I see. Okay. Archer, do you want to set up bot lobbies for me? If I finish my 160s today... Well, how long is the BR season? This does not have to happen today. I want to focus on ventures. I need to get ventures done. <laughs> She's not out yet? Oh, what the fuck am I... Why, why can I look at it if I can't unlock the set yet? What do I get the feeling you're a billion zero build BR player? What is that aim? I am decent at zero build. The one season I played recently, I had like an eight kill death ratio, which I thought was pretty good. We weren't getting bot lobbies anymore either. But I don't like BR. You guys are making me want to find a target practice. I feel like I'm, I'm working today. But we got about a minute until... Mini boss. Mini boss is usually about the two and a half minute mark in Cat 4. God, this weapon's so fucking strong. I don't know why it's visually displaying 7 mag when it should be 12. Love the grenade too. Like, it's actually decent damage. Yeah, so I used to play a lot of Call of Duty, and I got my start on PC during PUBG and Star Wars Battlefront 2, before that went to shit. Massive Avatar Collab? Yes. Want. Um... Oh, interesting AS. So, suppressive fire to those who don't know is right here. Consecutive shots against the same target deals 3% extra damage. So if you hit the same target five times, you'll do 3% extra damage after that. And what AS is mentioning in chat is that because the ground pounder is shooting, like look, if you guys look off of the air. Unremarkable squid wants you to drop that weapon now. It's shooting multiple pellets is kind of what I'm trying to showcase there. Basically giving my teammates a free ground pounder. This fucking guy. Stream looks bullshit. Let's just drop a different weapon. No, that's mine. That looked like a barrel beater. Anyway, it shoots multiple pellets, so you're activating Stay Frosty kind of immediately. So every shot after is just doing 15% more, which is really huge. God, I love this weapon. 
Okay. Random question, but just wondering, who's your favorite avatar? Mine personally is probably Wham. My favorite avatar? You'd have to be a fucking nerd to know anybody outside of the Kyoshi. No. Yeah, I didn't. I didn't like Yanshan. I read the books, <laughs> so I actually know. Um, Kyoshi was cool. Where's our mini boss? Was it trap vulnerable, or is it just not here yet? Wait, what? I'm looking off into the distance, looking for our mini boss, but I'm not looking ahead. Where is our mini boss? Shade said, where is it? So he doesn't know, but I don't know. Are we just gonna have a really late mini boss? I wish I was running a weapon that could kill a mini boss in 10 seconds. Is it gonna be like that? Are we gonna get a mini boss with 10 seconds left? You wouldn't be surprised if it chased an animal. <laughs> Okay. No mini boss? I'm gonna kill a smasher out of anger. That didn't feel like a mini boss at all. Did like a teammate run off the map and I didn't even notice? Whoa. What was that? Never saw one either, yeah. Do you have every founder's weapon, like the sniper and the raptor? Uh, I don't know about the purple ones. No, I don't have all the purple ones. Didn't see one. Okay. Well, what the hell? Blackout AR ground pounder. Blackout AR build kind of got ruined by nerfing Fallen Love Ranger. I'd say ground pounder is more fun now, unfortunately. How do I hit level 124 like today? I'm a sliver away. Uh, survivor XP, level up all of your survivors and all of your squads. Yeah, I liked Kyoshi. She was a fun avatar. And a lesbian, I think. Yeah, she was like impoverished, had like... It was weird. She was like orphaned or something in the books, and then... She was working as, like, a peasant child, but unbeknownst to everybody around her, she was the fucking Avatar. It's an interesting story. Is there an easy way to get Survivor XP? Yeah, just find a four-player mission and just go run it. Yeah, this one right here, 116 four-player gives Survivor XP. I mean, just find a Survivor XP and go crazy. Uh, Yeah, we can do Cat 4. We can do Cat 4 quickly. Two hours, 46, and I still need five, so let's go quick. Uh, what were we talking about? Uh, I'm gonna keep using Ground Pounder, because it's just so satisfying. Kyoshi is one of Yun's servants, and everybody thought he was the Avatar. Right! Yeah. Uh, Ground Pounder is from the military weapon set, so if you don't want to wait for a military llama, which kind of just comes around randomly... I, it's a very easily flexible weapon, like, well worth it to just go and get it. Mini boss in every single 160, it always says chance for it to appear. Hmm. I would expect a mini boss every time. Dude, doing this while the game is loading up is so perfect. Like, you guys can see in the background, say the world's not even open right now. I'm kind of fired up right now. I want to go find a, uh... You know what happened, you guys? So, to those on Discord who have my role, you know that I actually delayed the stream today. I decided I needed food. I, I just, you know, I had burned through my breakfast already, and I didn't want to start the stream kind of hungry, and so I just went to Arby's. Not the healthiest thing I could have chosen, but it was quick and easy, so I did that. And, oh no, a, a smasher. Jesus. It almost died before I figured out what it was. God, this weapon's so good. Like, the Husbuster is amazing, but it doesn't shoot as fast as the Ground Pounder. And the Ground Pounder does... Ooh, I have that gold and black... Mm, I have that wrap I like, too. 
Fuck yeah. Anyway, um, that actually looks really good. Look at this shotgun, you guys. A black and gold shotgun. Oh, the Xeon bow looks... Say the role player realizes he's wearing weapon wraps for the first time. I never noticed them, but that looks really good. Uh, trap anomaly? Uh, no need, thank you. Aphid! Max bench 375, we all know you're lying. It's probably 400, he's too humble. Unremarkable squid says, us buster? More like nut buster. Whoa, whoa. Accurate, but... Y you know this is an 18 plus stream, okay? We can't just talk about... Penis it, wait, actually. Aphid, thank you for the sub! Uh, Shinemli, you were hanging on for a hype train, right? Because we are eligible for a hype train to start now. So, AS, do you know any visual sign that suppressive fire has kicked in? Because that's a really interesting fact. The fact that you could hit five pellets to start and you're immediately doing 15% more. And that's just for every... Like... If you're somebody watching who didn't know that was a thing before, don't worry. Every soldier in the game has that, so you're just accidentally taking advantage of it. We just all forget about it. And Dito, get it going, BRB. Fuck yeah. Well, perks on the ground butter, basic crit build. I'll link my video on it if you want to learn about the perks and why you want to use whatever you want to use. This is very thorough, explains everything. I don't remember if I was up to date in that video. If I recommended reload in that video, then I, I was ill-informed. That's the only thing that might be wrong about the video. Mag size is absolutely better than reload, everybody. When it comes to pellet shotguns. Pellet shotguns means, you can see when I'm reloading, it's one pellet at a time. Reloading makes you reload 75% quicker, and mag size makes you have 75% more ammo. But... It gives you that ammo increase without extending how long it takes to reload. I believe the ground pounder, maybe it'll show you accurate information nowadays or they fix that bug. Yeah, so it says it's a five second reload time. If you're reloading seven pellets in five seconds or 12 pellets in five seconds, you're actually reloading 75% quicker just to have 75% more ammo. And if that sounds wrong, we did the math. It's like within one hundredth of a second, the same speed. So. If reload and mag size are the exact same, reload is negligibly quicker, then you should absolutely be running mag size on your shotguns, because you just get more ammo straight up. That makes Chaos Agent more effective, because you can shoot longer and then just reload instantly with him. It's awesome. Alright, well I lost all my blue glow, but thank god Storm God is here. How much are you going to be live for today? I'm going to go to my normal 10pm time, so about 6 more hours. If you guys want to trap and start without me, that's fine. But I'm gonna circle back after I find a target practice because I want to do it right now. I'm feeling good. The fox is here. Hello, Phoenix. Affid, thank you again for the sub. I don't know if we're gonna be able to kick off a hype train though. That was three minutes ago. It's all on Schnemly. Do you have any videos about the Nocturno? Yes. If you go to my channel and search Nocturno, you'll get several. I compared the Nocturno to the Storm King Scourge. I made a video on the Nocturno best perks. I made a triple crit damage Nocturno video showcase. I have an unreleased Nocturno video sitting on my computer that Aura actually edited and I still haven't taken a look at it. I need to go check that out. Should we go watch his edit together? I wouldn't want to do that to him actually. Woo! Feeling good right now. No! I'm trash! Oh my god. Is this what it's like? You can leave the stream open to get channel points, but you won't automatically collect the little box every half an hour. Avid gifted a sub to no cool. Oh my god, I am so off. This is what I get for playing Bloons Monkey City all the time. Marvel Strike Force might be a fun game, but it does not prepare your aim for BR, that's for sure. How to embarrass yourself in front of a live audience. You know, Chad, I was feeling good. It's <sighs> feeling good. Well, I'm glad the Korra quests aren't going to bring me into a live lobby of actual players, because I would get fucking smoked. Death Bombs actually have some weird quirks. Oh, alright. Hey, for you want both a spot shot, both mag size and reload? Yes, they do, yes.
Stay frosty is a blue glow and red sight in front of the weapon, but suppress the fire. You don't know. Okay. Yeah, because I noticed that, but I, I don't, I didn't think it showed anything. I'm gonna go get the movement speed. It's kind of ironic to backtrack for the movement speed, but it will make everybody go quicker. So, you know. Bloons is great. Yeah. Ancient tower mod. Everybody's playing with. I'm not sure what that is. Is it a good time to grind storm chests with excessive materials from recycling? I guess so. Not the traps, though. The weapons. Oh, okay. I thought I didn't have wafers. God. <laughs> that was an entire encampment. Without much help. I did party hips and did not happen. I'll do I'll do party hips. Can make a loadout save you gun bullets. Um Yes, actually. I have a whole video here that is specifically designed around consuming less ammo. Uh thank you for the prime sub Shnemly. Thank you for the gift sub Aphid. We are now one event of 100 bits or any kind of sub gift sub prime sub from kicking off a hive train 36 months that is almost a year holy shit wow my frame rate's in the 80s is this how it feels to be a console player i've upset console players in the past by making comments like that and to those of you who feel that way, I'm I'm sorry you feel that way. Yeah, it's hard to test right now, AS, because if I did more damage on the second shot, that could just be from affliction damage, so I don't really know how to test that, but it's kind of neat. Do I have to be commander level 30, or is there some other level strike force? Um... If you play Strike Force and make it to level 7, 20, and then 30, all three of those different events will uh, will support me. So if you just make it to 7, that's that's fine. But if you keep going, it supports me even more. Can you make one on saving bullets on AR? Uh, yeah, I kind of did that here as well. The Ranger is a highly efficient weapon that doesn't consume much ammo. And it also uses uh, assault ammo recovery is a really good hero because he'll just use less ammo he just saves you 31.7 percent of your bullets basically well he technically saves you 24 percent you have to shoot him eventually you essentially get a 31.7 percent mag size increase yeah ranger's great I, you can hear it in the background storm god shooting it but that he also is a that hero applies to every ar and smg god one shotting a fatty like, I know you have to be lucky to crit to do that, but... Yeah. Squid, thank you for the gifted sub to dude, uh... Dude lo Doodle... <clears throat> thank you so much! <laughs> I cannot pronounce every name. Thank you for the bit, Space Cowgirl. I appreciate it. I'm trying to set out the propane. The hype train is here. Level one is completed. If anybody wants any hype train emotes, you can cheer 100 bits, gift a sub, prime sub for free. All of those are options to get in. Oh no, a chrome husk. All right, he's dead now. I keep not eating wafers because it's just not necessary. Nothing survives. It's awesome. Perk up, we to say it's an interesting topic. To I suggest you do a perk up guide video. You say it's an interesting topic to talk about. I would say too. Honestly, I bet if I started making best perks videos, I could probably build an entire career off of it. I'd say if I made the best perks for every relevant weapon, I can't find it. If I did that for every relevant weapon in the game, I would imagine millions of people would actually tune into that series, and it might actually grow my channel into something that is rather notable. Oh, actually, I'm gonna link that in chat. There you go. So yes, I, I, I agree. Perk videos would be good. 
Uh, Emerald, thank you so much for the bits. You too, Storm God. I appreciate it. Is Xenobow any good? The Xenobow is one of the best weapons in the entire game. Yeah. The Xenobow Best Perks video is one of my most popular for a reason. It's just an excellent generalist. As some people seem to forget, um, Xenobow is not the only weapon in the game. <laughs> a lot of people make the Xenobow their only weapon, and I don't blame them, but... There are other options, people. Just need to remind everybody. Because a Xenon Bow is like a drug, you know? You can use it in every single game, and it'll be fine 90% of the time. As long as you're not in a smokescreen mission, the Xenon Bow will get the job done. But but it's not the only weapon, guys. Alright? <laughs> Ground Pounder exists too, huh? Anyway. If we can make it to a level 3 hype train, I'll ping in Discord. Um, but yeah. We got two minutes left on the timer before it's too late. If you're thinking about getting in on the hype train, now's your time. God, this weapon's so good. Just to remind everybody, chrome husks have... Oh shit, Archer, are you in chat? How much health does a chrome husk have? 2.8 million in my... is in my head. Leave some for me, eh? Oh shit, a ricochet mini boss. Alright, 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 alright. Here's the plan. We're going to... we're gonna prep for this. We're gonna put... Some of these down. And then not use them. And then do that. Alright, team. If you need healing pads, I got us all taken care of. So that wasn't really a, a short for YouTube kind of thing, but that's how good a ground pounder is. You get two or three people using it and it's just dead. 3.8 million. That mini boss had 27,600,000 health and we killed it like it was not even there. Did I do good at math? I did, you know. What are your PC specs? If you go to my YouTube channel, Nicholas, if you're on PC, you can just middle click my channel, it'll open into a new tab. My about section has every relevant part of my setup, like my chair, monitors, fucking mouse pad. It's sweet. One minute left on the hype train. 100 bits if you guys want to get in. Um, new emotes if you don't have them. The Xenon Bow is not the only weapon to save the world. I say that because the Xenon Bow, like I said, is an excellent generalist. The Xenon Bow could be the only weapon you use. Um, you'll be ineffective in smokescreen missions, but it'll be good enough. Thank you for the bits, good to find! I, it's not gonna be enough to push us to level two, but I definitely appreciate it. Filling up the cup on the right-hand side as well. If anybody wants to make a final push to fill out the hype train, we got it going on right here. Almost level three, just 24, 34% more to go. Thank you so much. I I honestly find it fun when people cheer in the smaller bits than that because it fills up the cup and it's kind of a fun thing. But if anybody wants to get on the hype train, this is your final call. Uh, once it ends, the timer goes to like an hour before we can try again. So if anybody wants to push it along, that's your final call. Final call. Yeah, crosshair bug, what's causing that? Do we know? Affliction, guys. Honestly. Um. God. When you can just crit for a million with no help, it's awesome. Yeah, five seconds left. Thank you so much, Good Define. Your insane support. I really appreciate it. Knock build that can make the knock do almost five million damage in six shots. I do. Yeah. I was getting shown that. It's very cool. I don't have enough power cells to enjoy energy weapons. Yeah. Energy weapons are... Well, actually, Xenon Bow is not even a good example of that. Xenon Bow is the most efficient energy weapon in the game. One cell per shot is crazy. I might, Constellation Lover. I'm on break right now, but that is a big contender for a good video. Yeah. Is the Heartbreaker Crossbow still good? Yes, it is, Maximilian. Heartbreaker is quite good. I should use it next game. Uh, AS, I'm gonna give the points back. I'm- I'm trying to just speed run through my 160s right now. I'm not in a good headspace to be trying out new stuff, sorry. Discharger is awesome, yeah. The Plasmatic Discharger is the best Smasher killer in the game right now. Like, hands down. Uh, it's also the best Storm King end phase killer as well. <laughs> Discharger is not essential. Not at all. We lived without it for years. Discharger does not let us do anything nowadays that we couldn't do before. But, 
That doesn't mean it's not an excellent tool. You know, we got along just fine before the hammer was invented, and then look at us now. Craftsmen use hammers. Um, Rabberator, okay. Oh my god. This is what I get for eating Arby's right before the stream. Red line, not quick fingers, can't use Farah. Reloading's not something we're doing much. Ah, what do I use? Ah, I can't even think right now. A war cry bonus? That'd be funny. What am I trying to think of? What could make any difference? Ah, oh, damn it, I don't even know. Mm. Fuck it, I'll just use fleet. Yeah, that's right, I'm using fleet. Subway for his battle beat, that's fine. What am I forgetting? Mm, something, I'm sure. Alright, what are my crossbows set to right now? I say I'm trying to go quick, and then I just do craziness like this. Uh, fire? Okay, let's do two things. One, I don't want to gamble with critting, and two, we're in nature. Mm, are we? No. No, we're not. Look at me turning my brain on. We're queuing Cat 4. Yes, this is a water weapon. Yeah, alright, okay. Look at me, chat. Look at this guy. Smiling ear to ear. Brought his brain to class today. Mm-hmm. Didn't leave it at home. Remember to pack it. Good shit. Let's go. Speed boost. Yes, indeed. Normal pack. I got you, Maples. Did you guys know that if you redeem stream loots packs, I can just... Oh, I need to log in. I'll gift it to you. Uh, you can get some free packs using channel points. Stream loots is a super fun way to support me as well. They actually were a sponsor's initial initially, but I am just a huge fan of their product, so I kept it on my stream. Do you know that many of your viewers are... Okay, sent, Maples. Okay, and Reverator. Okay, good. He's using his brain? Mm-hmm. Can you make infinite kunai or infinite star throw ninja? Uh... Yes, I actually made a video on the kunai build, actually. I'll link it. The hell are you running right now? Uh, okay. So, Foxy, your wording suggests that you don't know the power of the crossbow. Heartbreaker crossbow is actually insane. Like, really good. Uh, takes a bit of doing. Uh, the hardest part about finding the crossbow, of course, is finding the crossbow. You need to actually see it in your inventory. But once you see the weapon, things get easier after that. I need some wafers, though. Looking to crit out here. Looking to crit out here. Look, looking to. Hmm. Where the hell is the end? All right. Looking to crit out here. All right, I got four of them. That's good. That's that's a start. Barely. God damn it. Where the hell did that go? Bullshit, is my proximity good enough to... Let's go find a smasher we can bully, huh? Ooh, an encampment, that's even better. Even better! <laughs> That's so satisfying! Oh, that's so many! That's so many! Alright, alright, alright. It struggles with crowds. It struggles with crowds, okay? We all knew- we all expected that, right? We all expected to struggle with crowds. It does pierce, though, which is kind of a big deal. So anyway, crossbow is kind of insane. Unlocking perk up? 
I I am not sure what your issue is. Uh, Plankerton Storm Shield Defense 2 unlocks being able to reperk weapons. Perk up is available in regular missions. Do pistol hero boss buff? No, discharger is not a pistol. It is a rocket launcher. So demolitionist penny or basic damage bonuses are the only thing that'll affect it. So yeah, heartbreaker crossbow. Did you guys think I was kidding? Heartbreaker reskin of the other crossbow. It is. They are the same weapon, basically. Also, I went down to 97 shotgun shells on my ground pounder, so I'm kind of looking to loot ammo crates whenever I can. These ore deposits are always good for... Getting metal too. Have they fixed recycling? No. Traps, it, it is set to be fixed, but yeah. In the meantime though, weapons are recycling for kind of a lot right now. So that's kind of nice. The MSK meta changed since you- No, not really. My video will show you an effective strategy to beat MSK. Those loadouts are still what I use, actually. If you wanted to solo it or something, I mean like you could use different builds, totally rocking out included, but it's not necessary. What happened with Love Ranger? Uh, Fallen Love Ranger? They made him generate less energy now. Not sure why. Love the videos, appreciate it. Oh no, Ali, you cannot, you cannot just collection book stuff when you're when you don't know. Um, it's always hard to trap around that. All right, we got ground pounder users, so if Shade wants to just start whenever, that's fine by me. Crossbow is fun, but it's not going to solo the mission or anything. You can just take it out of your clutch book. Streamless packs are really fun. I'm gonna click the link in chat here if you get if you want to check it out. If you uh, look at the stream loots packs, you can see all the different cards you can redeem. They're just really fun cards and challenges that you can redeem for me to do on stream. Okay, is it Pierce Shielders? Oh, I'll never know. Oh yeah, like that. <laughs> Look at that damage, dude. So satisfying. So this is where I can just pop a wafer. Just delete missed monsters in front of me. And it's got that nice perk where you can uh, do extra damage when you're aiming down the sights, which you almost always are. Still running the same Blackout Boom build? Yeah, that nerf really affected the build in not a good way. I think the uh, Dirge Song Sledgehammer build is just stronger now. Water grave best no. New water grave, y'all. No. I wouldn't do the water grave digger for money. That is a challenge to those of you who have money to spend on me running weapons. Donates $100. Oh, really, Beast? And I go, hmm. Maybe not really. I am a whore, Chad. You can pay me to do things like that. Oh! <laughs> yeah! I'm a gamer!
What would you say is the best? There is no best loadout, and there never has been. Love Heart Ranger, best unit with nerve mix. Yeah, yeah, the old loadout really struggles now. So like Dirge Song now with Sledgehammer totally rocking out, or Preemptive Strike. That's good. I hear a big. Where are these flinger? Oh, I see. <laughs> it's just one shotted. Yeah, I see why I love his weapons. I feel like I'm getting really lucky with the crits in this video, or in this game. It's not a video. Okay, so it does not pierce shielders. Dirge Song, Sledgehammer, or Ground Pounder. They're completely different loadouts. Dirge Song would do more damage, but the Ground Pounder is awesome. Gonna need help for that? Yes, Luki. It's a tough mission. It's such a quiet weapon, you don't feel the power. And I'm not eating my wafers right now, so I'm not critting as much. There we go, here we go. Alright, alright, alright. Eat the wafer. Take out the shielder, if possible. Yeah. Millions of damage. So many good weapons they could fix all in one update and send the community to the Dark Ages. Yeah, I don't know enough about programming to make comments like that. Every time there's a long-standing bug, I just have to assume, because I'm not I'm not a programmer. I just have to assume there's like a good reason they haven't done it yet. I do have programmer friends who have broken down like what goes into a certain update. Like, you wouldn't even believe the stuff that gets broken with a random change. Appreciate it, shops! I really do! Yeah, playing with me in Save the World is very achievable. It's just, uh, a little luck dependent. Like, adding me is guaranteed. If you hang out in the streams, you collect channel points, I will add you. And... Whether or not you get my game, though, is pretty just... Who joins first when I have a spot open? That's kind of how that goes. Um... Yeah, spaghetti code. It's all code, I know. Why do you always stream in the middle of the week? Because the shop resets on Wednesday. I don't know why, but, like, the big weekly shop change in Save the World is Wednesday. So that's why I'm here. Wednesday's not good for me either, okay? <laughs> I don't know what the fuck that was. Alright, is Storm God gonna solo this mini boss before I get over there? Oh, it's smoke screen. Boo! Boo! There are no good weapons in this game that could handle a smoke screen mini boss. This is bullshit. Alright, fuck me, I guess. There goes my war cry. And half my team, apparently. Does nobody have an adrenaline rush? Good God. Somebody to heal him? Perfect. Okay. All right. Well, I wasted my war cry, but I have this. Ravager is very strong, by the way. And I'm using a triple crit damage copy, so I have to, like... Keep eating my wafers, but, you know. Yeah, I think a lot of people are afraid of smokescreen mini-bosses, because they don't want to use a melee when they're not running a melee build, but, you know. You can do it. Hey, thank you for the Prime sub. I appreciate it. Complete candy with weak weapons because I forgot to hit square on my controller. Oh my god. A Space Ranger hero loadout. I don't know what Space Ranger is. So probably not. What is Space Ranger? Is that like a, a perk that's not something... 
that I'm familiar with. Is that intergalactic Ken? Hydrate! Yeah, well, I'm in the middle of the game. I'll, I'll hydrate. Yeah, that, that's that's not a thing I appreciate. If you redeem channel points, don't don't be annoying about it. I'll, I'm a human playing a game. It's 29 seconds left. I'll I'll drink some advanced CG in a second here. I see it. Yes, if you're running a melee loadout, then smoke screens are easy. Energy base hero. Okay. Unremarkable squid says intergalactic Karen. Intergalactic Karen is that what I just said? Drinking mango and blood orange today. Typing in all caps is usually annoying. Use survivalist instead of fleet. Um, yeah, it can work. Intergalactic Kieran. It wasn't being a very serious loadout. Dump their megs in the miniboss because they don't have the- Yeah, I just- Honestly, a Ravager with no loadout is gonna be fine versus a miniboss. It's just crazy how people don't know. <laughs> Are you an intergalactic Karen? Intergalactic Karen could actually be a thing if there's like a TV show about intergalactic police. You don't know what to play in Save the Roll this week? Well, have you finished Ventures? We got one week left. Can you hear my song? Yeah, I'll show you guys. I'm not making videos right now. That's that's my thing. Like, I'm on break, so... Man, do I have another Toy Rockin' Out build that's not something I'm changing every fucking game? Alright, so the basic build... Uh, let's just do... Minigun? Yeah, Sledgehammer lead. Then we want uh, reload explodes. Uh, I rearranged my heroes. Okay, we need first shot Rio, Sledgehammer, Saurian Might is fine. I'm going to use Toy Rockin' Out. It might not be absolutely optimal, but it is what I want to do. And just use her in support. Like, it doesn't need that much of a build. Uh, I'm not even going to use Subway first. I'm just going to use Fleet because I'm being lazy. Fumble because I'm being lazy. This might not even be optimal, but you're going to see that it doesn't even matter. You are going to see that it does not even matter. Yeah, you basically just need... Yeah, don't read out the build one line at a time. This is not... Okay, Skull Trooper is barely adding any damage. So is Assault Damage, but... The only thing you need is Sledgehammer and Rio. That's pretty much the build. You can stack all the damage perks you want. There are lots of options. Even, like... Um, preemptive strike might be better than Toy Rockin' Out, but you'll see this is fine. Dire? He only works at nighttime. The fuck are we talking about here? You mean somebody else? That's a movement speed bonus. That's not. How many 160s? I think we're at six or seven. Beast, please update me on it. Also, Beast. Yeah, I'm just saying don't read out the entire build one line at a time. That's, that's what I'm saying. This could have been... This could have been one message. And that's only half the loadout, but I said something, so... The hero damage will add more, it doesn't matter that he's useless. Again, you're doing plenty already. Look at this. So this is not even the right element. We are working against this build so much, just to prove my point. This is in a suboptimal element with a suboptimal loadout. And look, and I have full health. It just doesn't fucking matter. Doesn't fucking matter. Everything dies. <laughs> That's my point, okay? I'm not trying to show this as a perfect example. That's the opposite of what I'm trying to do. Dead, dead, dead. What haircut do you think I should get? I don't know. Whatever you do, though, make sure to get all your hair, all right? Thank you, J plays. I gave you the early update of the shooting here during the last stream. 
of the shooting here. Samp, I'm sorry, I'm not sure what you're referring to. I have a lot to keep up with as a streamer. You gotta hold my hand sometimes. I'm sorry. I care. I just... It's a lot. Been waiting for the... Oh, okay. Kratos must be fucking popular, dude. Somebody said it earlier. That's like a... A... PlayStation game? Some smasher down there. Alright, here's a encampment. So the thing that is better about the Dirge Song, it takes one second to reload. And does just as much damage, you can see. I liked the Blackout for its long range accuracy, the fact that it did really well with a Flash AC build, but now that we can't generate enough energy to keep up with it, this is fine. And this was all we always like a decent build. And you can see with Toy Rocking Out, you don't even need to be reloading constantly. Yeah. It's a one second reload. That's not a bug, like all the weapons in the game saying they have a one second reload. No, 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 no. The Dirge Song actually has a one second reload, as you can see. It's so fast. And it's always been a good alternative. I just preferred Blackout because I loved the way that build worked and how much worked for it. And I'm just using Toy Rocking Out for the last seven bullets. Because the first two are guaranteed crit, and they do a tremendous amount. But, I mean, look at that. <laughs> Black Metal build is even more of a glass cannon during fire missions. Yeah, of course, because... I'm not even running wafers. What am I doing? What am I doing? Third sign is that it melts through ammo. It really does. So you're, sh you're firing nine bullets minimum per burst, which is... Nuts. The Blackout AR was way more efficient, way more precise. I believe it had a longer range. But it can't be fueled fast enough anymore. Uh, fuel for the Fallen just doesn't generate enough energy. It's simple as that. It really is simple as that. And honestly, something to be considered is we only have, what is it now, 13 soon to be 14? Or 12 soon to be 13 hero loadouts. So. This build is way closer to a normal build you would use anyway. This is, other than First Assault, identical to what a standard Totally Rockin' Out AR build looks like. So, instead of having a whole build set aside for it... Man, I really need to make a video on this, but... I'm on break, 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 I'm on break. Alright. Horde might get me back into things, but... I'm on break. Do you like Mandarin oranges? I don't have opinion on Mandarin oranges. Although my girlfriend did get free ones. Yeah, she wanted some tiny Mandarin oranges. And then I, I made the stupid joke because she speaks Mandarin. I got no laughs. <laughs> but, but then we went to check out and they didn't have it in their system. He couldn't ring us up. He was so confused. And I jogged back to the other part of the store to see how much they were labeled for. And I was like, oh shit, it says nothing. Like, there's literally no price tag listed at all. And the cashier, kind of chuckling, was like, what What do you think it should cost? And I was like, I mean, it says zero dollars. And he's like, okay. And then he just put it next to her stuff that she paid for. I was like, okay. <laughs> Fuck yeah. Lady got free oranges. Shade, let's start this one quickly. We don't need tons of traps. Hey, Samir. Hey, do not swear, and then they smash their keyboard. Yeah. I swear in my streams. What to do with my Flux? Albin, I have a whole couple of videos talking about legendary Flux and how to spend them. It's kind of a big topic. Typically, researching weapons you don't have and fluxing up purple ones that need to go higher are good. So this is wrong element, suboptimal loadout. I mean, look at it. Look at this shit. Just sitting down a smasher like it's nothing. Should have put fleet in this build. Oh. Somebody trapped a little too heavily. Now I can't do anything in there. Still can't reach. Yeah, so, Toy Rockin' Out, like I said, is only helping on the... The back seven bullets, and then fire is really struggling here, but... Terror Song is a menacing to hold. Yeah, it looks really cool. Such a weird visual change. Wasting bullets need save bullet. I don't need to save bullets. 
I, I can get more bullets. I don't know about you. The explosion part of this weapon is one of my favorite aspects as well. Yeah, Ben's War Cry indeed, because it's not just one enemy you're shooting at, it's everything in range. You can see it's it's weaker because of the uh, the elemental differences here, but it's working. You, know? you just point at anything that's not a smasher and it's guaranteed dead. Smasher will be dead shortly after, you know. <laughs> so stupid this build. Reload dead. Reload dead. Reload dead. That was a cool explosion too. That flinger picked the wrong place for a casual stroll. Isn't it beautiful? Yeah, so the blackout works. Blackout AR works with a slightly slower reload, as he said. But the Dirty Song's better if you're gonna be reloading just because of that faster reload. It's the explosion that's doing the main damage, and... I don't believe there's damage drop-off on the actual explosion. So you'll, your bullets will be doing less, but it ends up not mattering. That's why you can snipe something from, like, the limit of your range, and it is perfectly effective. That's why some people use preemptive strike, because it's really just the first two bullets you fire that even do anything. That's the guaranteed crit ones, but... I just threw this together as a quick example. I am trying to get my 160s done after it. Look at this, two bursting. That's something the Blackout AR can't easily do. Blackout AR needs to be very close to the target to even hope to two-shot a smasher. But the Dare Song is also firing nine bullets instead of two, so it's kind of cheating. This is so dumb. <gasps> Three smashers while talking like it's nothing. Because it kind of is nothing. And a lot of people prefer the Dirge Song simply because you're not face shifting all over the place. I don't have to constantly be repositioning. I don't have to constantly be uh, keeping on top of where I'm facing and how I'm playing. I can just stand still and murder everything. Kind of nuts. I do need to pay attention, though, because I am very low HP. Mm. Lacking enemies is a good problem, right? Um... Yeah, and it's the wrong element. Like, I'm talking about two-shotting a smasher here like it's just a weapon comparison, like normal. But remember, I'm doing 25% less. Are 33% less to the fire enemies. So this thing's two bursting with the wrong element when the blackout couldn't do it with the right element. But but again, seven more bullets. Seven more bullets. Let's not forget. It it really isn't stronger, guys. The Dirt Song is like it is stronger, but it fires slower. Once per second is way slower than the blackout could dish out. But of course, as we keep talking about, the the blackout can no longer be funded like that. It, it can't shoot that quickly anymore, because... Fall Love Ranger. Why do you lose health so much? Well, that's actually part of the build. Uh, the reload hurts you, and then it does damage based on missing health. So you specifically want to stay in the low health region. Kind of a high risk, high reward. You are very vulnerable. You are very vulnerable. Low health, very often. But... If you can maintain that low health, you'll do great. Hey, Grim. So this is how it does versus a mini boss. Thank you, Storm God. Probably figured I wanted to demonstrate this. Look at the top left. <laughs> <laughs> That's another thing. That's another advantage, I guess, is that the Dirge Song... Um, so the Blackout dashing build will run out of steam. You'll, you'll run out of phase shifts and you can't really, really kill a mini boss. But 
Since this doesn't require energy, you just need to reload once per second. It'll be slower damage output, but it'll be consistent forever. You just reload over and over and over and eventually it dies. And I, uh, I, I believe Tully Rockin' Out comes into play versus these Smashers here, because I keep saying it's the first two bullets that really do the damage, and that's true, but having your next seven nearly guaranteed to crit, uh, it's not hurt neither. It's pretty satisfying. How does one acquire such weapon and loadout? Super easy. Just have a Dirge Song with the right six perk. And then Sledgehammer in the lead. And first shot Rio. First shot Rio's integral because she guarantees you're, you're gonna crit. So this isn't taking advantage of the hero ability damage as much, it's just raw power, basically. This is where healing my teammate is a major nerf because I lose all of my damage bonus from low HP, but. So satisfying. When Gunblazer Southy do good with the Dirt Song? Um, no, actually. So he does 100%. He he does 105% damage bonus. But because we're guaranteed critting, Sledgehammer is doing a 225% crit damage bonus. And since we're guaranteed critting, we're not just doing 225% more damage. It's actually calculating our real damage. Uh, Gunblazer multiple he adds to your base damage, which doesn't play nice. It's kind of complicated, but it's really hard to explain. But like my Dirge song, if I can get the number real quick, yeah. So this fourteen thousand isn't the number that would be one hundred and five percent more. Like it wouldn't do twenty eight thousand because in there I've got battle beats fifty percent or less. I've got Assault Troopers, 17%. I've got 20% from my element. I have 30% from my damage. The real number that Gunblazer, Gunblazer Southie would be doubling is a lot closer to maybe 8,000 instead of 14,000, which is 8,000 extra damage instead of 225 added on a crit, which would be 14,000 times 3.25. It'd be more like, you know, 30,000 extra damage rather than 8. It's just complicated tech shit. I appreciate it, Stanley. Definitely get get your kids. You can you can play the game later. Discord link is in the description of the video in the stream. And suppressive fire and stay frosty, which I, I think is doing less for the dirge song, but it's still there. So yeah, there's, there's a lot of fun math that goes into this. I'm actually curious. Since I got two more 160s and two hours to do them, I do have the time to get nerdy. Let's get nerdy with it. So we've got... Oh, no damage bonus. Okay. So I'm actually curious how much fluff we have here. Uh, so that's... 20%. So it's 37%. Okay. It's actually probably a lot less than I was saying, which is good, but... Uh... Yeah, see, it said I was doing 14,000. I must have had Battle Beat active. Because if you take um, the 11,858.1 that we're looking at here, and then we just divide off the damage bonuses, then that number times uh, 1 point... It'd be fading, so this isn't specifically accurate, but if we add the 50% on, it'd be more like 1.87. So it's closer to like the 16,000. But I imagine it was like faded to half, so it'd probably be... Um, that number times one point, probably 57. Yeah, that gets us a lot closer to the 14,000 that we were seeing. Um, but my point is that this is the number. This is the number that the Dirge Song would be doing. So if we just times this by the 2.05, which is what you'd be getting from him. He's only... the. Gunblazer is only adding 9,000, whereas if we take this final number of 
11,858.1 times the 3.25, we're getting a significantly higher number. So. Like, it's it's like three times stronger. It's not even fun. It's not even close. It's crazy. So, yeah, it's really tempting to use Gunblazer Southie. He's a good hero in theory, but 105% added your base damage. Not as sexy as you think. Not as not as impressive as you think, but... Is Sound Spectre still a viable gun? Absolutely, it's great. Also, what AS407 is saying in the chat is that we're not even like adding that much damage to the explosion itself either. Uh, the big thing that we're exploiting here is that the explosion damage, this 132, is huge. That millions of damage is coming from that explosion, and it can crit. Crit damage makes that number do a lot more damage. It's quite significant. Your damage number is less so. So. Yeah. I'm sorry for those of you who did not want a bunch of numbers thrown at you, but you're welcome to everybody who did. Uh, let's chill out for a game. I also want the 290 Frost up, so I'm going to queue um, a quick tropical mission. What's like a fun... Nature. Can I do Lotus Assassin? No fumble. I'm going to do Dennis Jr. I'm going to run Clax this game. And I don't care if AS407 is wincing because this is suboptimal in some way. I don't really care right now. Yeah, this will be functional. And do I have a. This is a water mission. Do I have a Clax that works? You're running Clax too? This double attack speed. What's my clack situation looking like? Honestly, double attack speed's probably fine, but I am running Toy Rocking out, so let's make the most of it. Just put on a crit damage perk there. Now, this is like the heartbreaker section where somebody watching is probably rolling their eyes like, what? Clax is shit. What is Beast doing right now? Oh, you just wait. Wow. A girlfriend has gotten two perfect Pokemon today, including a Wobbuffet eligible for Great League, and two Shiny Volibee today. What the fuck is her day? See, now, bro, I got you. Let's launch this while I'm sending him his package here. His, uh, his little, little package of Stream Loots cards. Xenon, bro. Uh-huh, send pack. I want a Shiny Volibee. Again. Alright, yeah, see? These farms are full! They add up throughout the day! You gotta stay on top of it, and we gotta grab our little bunnies as well. Uh-huh. Okay. What the fuck is that lock? That's what I'm saying. Is there a way I can use my Strike Force progress to help you? Because I, I've i been playing the game for years. Yeah, Finley, I think it needs to be a new account. I'm sorry, though. I appreciate it. Yeah, a lot of the sponsors are, are geared towards new people playing, which I guess makes sense. Oh, this is a Bright Core Clax. Uh, in a Toy Rock and Owl build, I'd want my Sunbeam Clax. Oh, wait, what the fuck? Why do I have a Brightcore Clax and a Sunbeam with the exact same per- God damn it, dude. How are you today? Welcome, Dr. Payne. Beast, my bad. What's your bad? What's going on? Are you about to break some news to me? What are the best profile upgrades to get early game? Oh, uh, Pickaxe damage. That is your top priority. I said mister. Oh. Oh, that got auto-filtered by Twitch. Yeah. I get enough idiot comments that reference Mr. Beast that I, I had to just ban the term. Well, you can... You can... You can... Apologize. If you haven't used that, that Prime sub yet, I'll... I'll take it. Just, just, you know, kind of an idea. If you have used it, then great. If not, you know, I see that Prime badge. Just, just a little reminder if anybody watching the stream hasn't used their Prime sub. 
Just figured I'd mention it. The usual. <laughs> it's like a normal thing. Anybody who has a Prime badge, like Swergy and Chad, I'm just like, hey. It, I'm not saying it needs to be me, but if you haven't used it, somebody on Twitch should have it. Perks for stop sign? I'll drop the link in chat. So I have a question. Okay, don't ask me a question. If you're... Don't ask a question about asking a question. Now I'm answering two questions. Might be better. I don't know what better means. I didn't even get to participate in that. I, I thought the encampment was just started. Anything that I can't do, anything good game that... What? Is there a way I can use my strike? Any, annoying that I can't do anything? Yeah. Yeah. Well, I'm glad you like the game, at least. That's good. No way you made a video. Of course I did. Finding people to beat the Storm King boss. Yeah, if you're power level 122, just um, let people know in our Discord that you're looking to run Storm King. Never ask for help. Tell people you're looking for a team. You're never looking for help or a carry, okay? You're looking for people to run it with. You're looking for similar power level players to get the Mythic Storm King done with you. If you ask for a carry, people assume you're a power level 30 who just wants the game played for you. That's... I'm hoping not your situation. Imagine if he's just feeling so called out right now. He's like, oh yeah, no, I'm... I'm not... I'm not level 30. <laughs> <laughs> of course not. No, I wouldn't. <laughs> That's not me. No, I'll obviously... <clears throat> uh, wait. I'm obviously 122. So that's what the blue crown is. Yeah! If you click the subscribe button on Twitch, and you have Amazon Prime connected to your Twitch, you'll get a little box you can check. Sub free, or sub subscribe for free with Prime. And then it makes my day. Does anybody want to make my day? Make me feel better? Doesn't need to be me, honestly. You can use that Prime Summon anybody. But I tried my best, too. I was the one running Banshee in her team. Yeah, I don't agree with getting carried in Storm King fights. I feel like that's an endgame mission that you should be proud to have accomplished with the help of a team and all that good stuff. I think if you're a par level 70 getting carried through the fight, it kind of pisses all over the accomplishment that it should be. However... If you are going to get carried, and being proud of something that you accomplish in a video game is unimportant to you, then, yeah, running Banshee is the least you could do. It is the least you could do. I'm only level 81. Well, that's fine. I can run Storm King later. Should I use my voucher on Paley Lunar or Cassie Clippin? Mmm, clip. Founders count that have Rose Team, and I was wondering if I got another version of the Nocturno. Not sure. I don't know. You cannot recycle the Nocturno, so don't worry about that. Hey, yes, I'm not sure what you're talking about. At the percent, so it's at, so it doesn't decay. So if you crit on the first second of Toy Rocking Out... Oh, interesting, yeah. Yeah, Deadly Blade Crash is good. It is known. It shows I have to pay for a sub still. Yeah, if you have Amazon Prime... Connected to your Twitch and you click subscribe, you should have a box you can check. I don't know if there's a mobile difference, but you should be able to subscribe for free with Prime. Or it should tell you you've already used your Prime sub. I don't know if this link helps you at all for Prime usage. I'm not trying to trick you into paying for a sub here. It really should be free, so... I don't know. Ah! Unless somebody wants to just gift five subs, in which case, you know, that takes care of that. Thank you so much! Gifted a Goostism is a name I recognize. Converse. I think I recognize that as well. Tomatech Games. Man, lots of regulars in chat here. Sanity and Sanity and Gooms. Somebody needs some fucking vowels. G-W-N-H-M-Z. What am I supposed to do with that? Is that the sound you make when you're having a conversation and you choke on something? Sorry for caps. If you get five subs, you can type in caps. I <laughs> thank you so much. Splash in my cup on the right as well. I appreciate it. 
Thank you so much. Fall guys, welcome. Fall guys, spider. Yeah, so... Alright, let's see what it looks like. So if you go to Prime Sub, you should be able to, you know, should be a box to check here. I don't know what it looks like on mobile, though. Yeah, this is 160 power level. I have a wolf now. Thank you again, Kane. I really appreciate it. How late am I? You're here on time. I mean, it's a stream. There's, you know, you don't like hop into a river and ask it if you're late, you know? You just prime subbed. Oh, I didn't send an alert. Thank you. I think you need to share the notification or something, but I see that. I appreciate it. All right, raid starts in 30 seconds. Let's go. Let's go get a murder on down here. So satisfying. I should have used uh, Cloak Shadow as well. I like Cloak Shadow. He can crit, actually. Hey, yes, I'd love for you to do some math breakdowns on Cloak Shadow and Toy Rockin' Out, because his ability can crit, which means he would be really useful in a Toy Rockin' Out. Maybe. More useful than he normally would be. Your cat just climbed on top of me, help. I don't think there's anything to help you with. Uh, if you have a cat on you right now, then you're doing better than everybody else without a cat on them. Appreciate all you do for the community. I really appreciate that, Kane. Especially when I'm on a break right now. Like... I have not been nearly posting as much as I... Unremarkable squid says, Cloak Shadow. He doesn't get any bonus damage, just the crit, as far as I know. But the crit is still significant. Like, him critting and doing more is... I don't know. But yeah, I, I've been on break, and I... It feels really good that I can stop posting, like, regular new videos, and... the world doesn't stop spinning. <laughs> It's like, whoa, my audience didn't forget I exist. That's fucking sweet. Yeah, I don't know, I guess. Is what standard ability crit rating is? Standard ability crit rating is? I don't know if there is one. I think minigun is like 5%. I know it's not zero. I think minigun does crit randomly. That can do- yeah, it is. Yeah. There's another one, little uh, little prime badge lurking in the stream. There, are you have you used your prime sub this month? I'm like a prime sub PSA. Honestly, it doesn't need to be me. I just want everybody to make sure they use their prime subs. The grim is shaking. I don't know what that means. Is just like a string of memes. He's got aimbot for prime subs. <laughs> aimbot for prime subs. Noticing somebody has a big blue badge is not aimbot. Yeah, Fallen Love Ranger is kind of irreplaceable. Like, he's nerfed his shit, but... Uh, just... Still the best for what he did. Pretty much. It might even be worth it to use Fossil Southie and just, like, not have shield. Brutal. What happened to Fallen Love Ranger? They fixed him after all these years. He's no longer doing 6 energy per second, it's down to 2. Speaking of which, I see you got a Prime ba- Okay, I can't do this every time. There's so many Prime members joining up in the stream right now. I just gotta make sure they're using their subs. On somebody, at least. Yeah, it's tough. My phone's battery health? I don't even know. Are we just failing to kill, uh, Threat Vulnerable? Is that what's going on here? We'll get him! Boy, he's just standing in the worst spot to get hit by a broadside. This is unfortunate. And then building blockers getting in the way. Oh, there we go. He was in the middle this time. Satisfying. Uh, wait. Prime gets me a free sub? It sure does! If you click subscribe, the big purple button, you should have a box to check that gives you a prime sub for three. Check it out. 
And then I get money from that, so we all win. You get the sub bonuses, you get extra channel points, you get the channel emotes, you get the badge next to your name. More things I'm not thinking of right now. Fossil Southy has been nerfed. Oh yeah, he's bugged as shit right now as well. Like, energy generation in this game is just at an all-time low. It's not good. You play Fortnite. Uh, what is that, actually? It doesn't show up for me. Yeah, I don't know why Twitch is bugging right now. Twitch is just scamming its prime prime viewers. That right there, what you guys just watched, is my least favorite part of running a melee build. When they just slowly walk backwards. The button is hidden. Yeah, I don't like that. Fossil South is bugged right now. He gets money, you get a mo, it's a badge, and like a few yeah, it's good stuff. Yeah, I never talk about that, but the VIP channels in Discord are a real benefit of subscribing. Um I am most active in the VIP channels in our Discord. So if you ever wanted to chat with me or see what we get up to. It's also the best place to find people to play with, honestly. Like, everybody in the VIP channel has, like, supported me in some way, financially, or got gifted a sub, so they're at least a regular viewer, and... It's the least toxic part of our server. It barely needs to be moderated, because everybody just behaves and hangs out, and... If you want to find a quiet place to guarantee meet nice people... The VIP channel in Discord. You do need to be subscribed on Twitch, though. So if you have Prime sub, you can do that for free. Or if you get gifted a sub, you got it. But it filters out a lot of the insanity from the main channels. Hey, guys, thank you for the Prime sub. That's what I'm talking about, you guys. People come in with a Prime badge, might not be using it. Let them know. YouTube counter is at 55 for like three hours now. Yeah, it doesn't update. YouTube is just the worst streaming platform. Twitch just, all the widgets work appropriately every time. Yeah, Kieran. I think one guy after a ton of gifted subs in one stream, one guy was like kind of disrespectful in VIP one time. And I think that was it. I thought I read Twitch got rid of the Prime sub. No, no, no. It didn't go anywhere. They might have removed it for certain countries that you evidently are not in. So there you go. Why not use kick? Yeah. Yeah, Discord's in the description of the YouTube stream. I sent you a screenshot of my current progress in Discord. Soon I'll make an interact. Oh, fuck yeah. And then use... Yeah. Yeah, I think that button's hidden for a lot of people. Oh, it has a 10% crit chance. Commando, going Commando does. Interesting. Ah! Yes! She sent me a page of black and white text with programming on it. Ugh. Or at least a ton of information. Why would you do that to me? I'm not ready. I wasn't ready. Third world moment. I, I don't know which countries. I don't know if it was like... Like that. Now I want to try it. Oh, man, though. Dude. I am already running Toy Rockin' Out. I don't need anatomy lessons. I think she is the first to go. I'm going to try Cloak Shadow. Just to see if it does anything, you know? All good discoveries come from testing. You're going to fall asleep now? Thanks for hanging out. Enjoy your sleep. What is the best hero to cop in the shop? Oh, my God. Okay. Uh... Two answers. One, there is no best hero. Actually, the best hero in this event is not even in the shop. And two, I just made a video breaking down everything you should grab. I even timestamped it, so... Unremarkable Squid says, If Samus Aran ate a sub in Metroid, would she be a Metroid Prime sub? Ugh. <sighs> she would. Gotta grab my farm. My farm money. Dude, this is so great. Just doing something else for a long time. I want to do this right now. I can do it later, though. VIP chats. Uh, if your Twitch is connected to your Discord, it should be in there. One's in the Fortnite crap section. The other one's in the club section. I guess I can just show that. <clears throat> You made another one? 
Oh, Matty already did this. See, people gotta stop going off on their own and... <laughs> Burning hours of the day on work that's already happened. Oh. Storm God. Would Epic ever... Would Epic ever do Save the World 2? No. No. The one that we already have is getting regular updates, so... This is why I wanted to run him, by the way. Look at all this free damage. So satisfying. Wow, that was easy as hell. That was like, how much wood? I got 14 plus 224. Wow, 234. Okay. There's barely any... Barely doing... Yeah, well... We don't get as many updates as anybody wants, but we do get updates, so... There is that. Clax is so strong. I love this weapon. So this will be my last 160, and then I can move on to Ventures, because I have not finished this season, and I intend to. Be using Cloak Shadow all day. There's Cloak Shadow an event here. Yeah, he's available for one week of the year during Frost Night. What the hell is that? Project may take a few. I would expect so. You're talking about a ridiculous amount of data. Back from school, welcome. Yeah, Dimos is the paid version of the same hero perk, but he's not the same. He actually has less hero ability damage, so... That matters barely sometimes. Yeah, you can see he's not, like, a ton of damage, but you can see he crits. It's kind of nice. Look at that, extra damage. So I could be attacking one enemy in front of me, and then everybody behind me is just kind of dying. It's really hard to see how good Cloak Shadow can be, but... When you're in a crowd of enemies and they all just sort of die when you're not even looking at them, that's that's when he's... There. Should I buy my 11th? Yes, you should. You can always get more gold. Once you miss this hero loadout, after a week, that hero loadout is gone forever. You can get more gold later. You can't get this hero loadout later. Like, you can buy this one, then save up the gold, and buy next season's hero loadout. You only get one hero loadout per season. You'll get much more use out of a hero loadout than... And, and it's mostly quality of life. Technically, you don't need a bunch of hero loadouts to play the game, but if you want to play with any amount of variety, you'll appreciate it, I'm sure. Damn. Oh, yeah. Eight bright cords just for killing a glowing animal. I'm digging those right now. I'm digging it. I don't care. Well, I had fun with it. All right. Well, if you had fun, Storm got on there. That's good. <sighs> Zero modules? Yeah, I don't know. I haven't found any in my... Maybe my teammates are sleeping right now. Is he at the base? I swear to God. Don't be building the base, Kieran! It's repair the shelter! We're not fighting any modules! I know I'm distracted by a target practice right now, but I am looping the map! Damn it, Kieran! This fucking guy! He should know better. This fucking guy! No, guys, it's repair the shelter. You can't... Prep a defense in advance. You just build a box around the base and then wait for them to spawn. All the projected spawns that we can see right now change later on. There's no way to know. Finally found some. Yeah, I have not been getting lucky. There's Seabot over there. I should go do that. My favorite hero? Don't have one. Does Wukong unlock? Yes, Wukong gives you man to sleep. You get at least 10 loadouts, there's 5 main game, 5 adventures. Yes. Yeah. 
What's going to be in the new shop? Yeah, if you check out the timeline collator in the description, super useful. What's the max number of loadouts? Right now, if you've collected every loadout from... Ventures, it's... Uh... Uh... 13? No, 12. Next season will be 13, I think. This is what I'm talking about, Cloak Shadow. Like, half that encampment just died by running to me. It's so weird. It's so hard to measure how good he is. Because on a single target, he's pretty useless. But... The helping with the crowd is so convenient. Chaos Agent and Carbide yesterday? Good. Don't want to miss him before the season ends. Chaos Agent is one of the best heroes in the entire game. And he's just leaving right now. And a lot of noobs don't even know it. I mentioned him in my daily video, and people are like, Huh, what? Chaos Agent's available right now? Somebody vouchered him this season. Ugh, oh, man. I try, you guys. I try to spread as much information as I can, but unless you watch the videos, I can't help you. It's, it's so tough. I think I finally got people to click a video because I told them to not recycle traps right now, which isn't even clickbait. And then they accidentally learned about Chaos Agent. You saw that comment? Oh, it's so tough. You saw that comment too? That's brutal. Like, you guys know I'm not just making this up. Like, we all saw that comment of the poor dude just... Vouchered Chaos Agent when Dungeons was out. Can we get an F in chat, please? God damn. Monster Mini is an amazing weapon, yeah. Not getting back into the game for a couple years break. Just vouchered him two days... Okay. Can we get another commenter for Alex in the YouTube chat? Another effing chat for Alex in the YouTube chat, please. Alex just came back after a couple year break and vouchered Chaos Agent when he's currently available right now. You could probably get Chaos Agent in a less than 30 minutes if you wanted. Does what work in dungeons, Skrilly? Two chats, Lamo, yeah. Uh, well, you got a lot of F's in the Twitch chat here, Alex. It's a F to pay respects, you know. They're all feeling you here. Isn't it nice to be felt by a bunch of strangers? Wait, hold on. Phrasing. Phrasing. Emotionally empathized with. There we go. All right. <laughs> Save that one. Oh, Cloak Star, is he good in dungeons? He probably would be, yeah? I thought he wouldn't be back until October. The timeline, Alex! I recommend everybody click the timeline. Description of the YouTube stream, Twitch stream, bookmark it. Save it for later. Use it. You guys, this is unnecessary. <laughs> is it an assassin spawn? Oh, it is too. Well. Try to get back into the game, and it's so annoying. Every mission solo. I know there's Discord, but there's not always someone to help. I mean, you kind of answered your own question, though. Never, ever, ever ask for help or carries. You should be looking for people your power level, your age to play with. And, uh... And once you've got a nice group of people, or even one person to play with, I mean, there you go. I know that public lobbies aren't always the most consistent way to find people to play with, but... It's an option. Gotta utilize online communities if play with others is failing you. My Nerva Discord's got, I don't know how many, we pruned a couple thousand dead accounts, so... 43,000 people? I mean... I'd be shocked if you were looking for people to play with and found nobody. With 44,000 people in the community, at any part of any day, there's probably a couple thousand people online. If you can't find one person to run some games with you, I don't think he tried hard enough, you know. Third weapon, third MSK weapon tonight. Nice. Worth vouching Dennis Jr. because I don't have totally rocking out. Yes, but he comes out. I don't remember when. Timeline. Play together gets more response than help. That's true. And honestly, that's what you should want anyway. Nobody wants help. You don't want somebody to just do it for you. I mean, not really. The best, most consistent way to get through this game and have a great time is to find people to play with. If 
find some genuine friends that you like talking to and tell them you appreciate their time and get a group going. Wow, what the fuck's happening here? Why are there so many enemies all of a sudden? I just trigger something I didn't notice or is this just a cave? Cloak Shadow, am I right? This is where Cloak Shadow shows his worth. Like, I, I want AS to dive into this character and see, like, if there's any real merit, because my experience is telling me yes. Like, look at all that. I don't think I attacked 70% of those enemies. They just sort of died by being next to me. Like, look. Just like this. This will be a great example. Just to illustrate, you kill one enemy, and then you focus on, like, one other guy, and then everything just dies. Unless they spread out, in which case he becomes less useful, but you get the idea. Just standing next to him. They fall over. How much damage does he do? Well, you, that much. You just saw it. I know it just says 16 base damage, but, you yeah. know. Strong guy says, come. What? Is, what? What? What is he? Why? What are we? Oh, I see. The map being weird. Yeah. They spawn in corners now. Top floor, Millie, thank you for the prime sub. I appreciate it. Cup splash on the right hand side of the screen. Oh. Oh. Alright, cup's heavy. Been following for solo long. Can you help me with the Storm King? See, JJ, we were just talking about that. There are other people in the stream right now who are looking to get Storm King done, but don't have a team. You should let them know. Everybody JJ plays on YouTube is looking for people to run the Storm King fight with. If you guys need to get a team going, let them know. Yes, I agree, Falcon. Ventures doesn't have to suck, but it does. And Epic is unmotivated to change it. How do I, yeah, Dennis Jr. gives you totally rocking out. Thank you again for the Prime sub, I appreciate it. Random Save the World players putting more effort into these Excel files than our teachers have been teaching us. Ah, I don't know about your teachers, but... Hey Beast, you got my whisper text. Uh, I don't know what that means. I don't see messages on Twitch or in-game. If you ping me in Discord or comment on my YouTube videos, that's how you get a hold of me. MS can line? Uh, yeah. Especially since that's the way they want us to... Yeah, I don't know. I don't know. I don't know why Ventures is the way it is. Look at this defense. I love it. Cloak Shadow is so satisfying. I'm going to be using him a lot in Ventures later. You guys will see more. See, look. Single target isn't that impressive. But when you're in a crowd, when you're in a crowd. Still convinced Epic doesn't change Ventures for padding. I don't know what padding means. I don't know what they'd be padding. Playtime? Because I'll tell you honest truth, I don't think a lot of people finish Ventures. Like, Ventures is turning people away more than encouraging them to play. Dimos from the free, same as. Yeah, so he has the exact same perk, but slightly worse stats. Yeah, and for the past four seasons. Yeah, and a lot of people hitting max level are just gonna stop playing. Ready punch! Filling up my cup, thank you so much! Right hand side of the screen. I always love to see the bits roll in. <laughs> just filling up the cup. What do you think of taxiing? I don't blame you. Do not forget the requirements to activate the team perks. Yeah, if you're gonna get Dennis Jr. with a voucher, definitely make sure you have rad heroes. What do we got here? Travel, okay, all right. Alright, Archer wants me to use wall darts, but I'm slower than Storm God, so I won't. And that's how you kill a trap one of them. I'll, I'll smoke bomb him, that'll do it. There we go. Alright. You don't play Ventures ever, I need to get at least Voucher. Yeah, Ventures is worth it for low level players, especially Vouchers, but Ventures level 23 is like your maximum if you really don't care about 
endgame stuff. I think you should, but I don't blame you. Adventures is very painful. What's your back bling? It's the blue glow black blue glow back bling. God damn it! From the Vintertech, uh, Doctor Vintiman set. It's like an eighteen dollar pack though. So coal is the most scarce thing in the game. No, you can get coal. You get coal from killing animals, recycling stuff. You get coal from crafting material mini games, which means anomalies, storm chest. No, uh, anomalies. Encampments, you can get coal from the red box. You should always be sending out the red box expeditions if you're low on coal. You can get coal. Unremarkable Squid says, Trap vulnerable mini bosses are weak against guys in tight clothing. What the fuck? Oh, okay. I get it. <laughs> Jesus. Yep, you can tame a, a boar in game and get coal from them. You can get coal, just do all the different things. Yeah, Crackshot's neighborhood is ventures only nowadays, unfortunately. But you don't need it. Recycle bugs still in the game. Yeah, so it's kind of in in two ways. We get less from traps, but more from weapons right now. So killing glowing animals and recycling their weapons is a good idea. Just saying. Is it Jolale or Jolale? Jolale? Thank you for the bits. Filling up my cup on the right hand side. Somebody's gonna come in with a prime sub and splash that, I'm telling you. You got your first Storm King weapon from uh, with people you met from the Discord? That's awesome. That's a story I like to see. Why the pot shots with- uh, it's a visual bug, Blackheart. It seems like, um, non-magazine- I don't know, when it shows how many items you have, it's the wrong number. Like, earlier my ground ponder was displaying seven shots, but it definitely had twelve. Like, I had to shoot five times before the number- like, the visual icon changed, I don't know why. Lois has Sarah get a hood when she's legendary? I think? Let's better 160 water zone, max energy ravager or nature stabs worth? Probably the Ravager, but the Stabsworth isn't really a damage weapon as much as it's more of like a attack speed weapon with Luna. Depends on how you're using it. I did everything in my Nerva. That's fucking sweet. How many more streams will I need to sit through to, get to, to sit through? Sitting through my streams? The insinuation that this broadcast is such a grind that you have to sit through it, eh? <sighs> you can stand too. You don't need to sit there. You don't need to just take it, okay? Oops. Does she have a golden wrap? Jesus. Wow, this is a whole thing. Put Aphrodite in the game, I'd have to not run Lexa. Beast is okay, you'll get through this. I'll get through it! <laughs> Just like you're getting through my stream. <sighs> I can't. So I found out that I was supercharging a bright core ground pounder and then we tried it out on stream and it actually performed really well. I did make a video kind of comparing bright core ground pounder versus sunbeam, but it's so close. I do value sunbeam more, but I think it's funny that I was supercharging a bright core one and didn't notice. I didn't notice. All right, next thing I need to do is d mm, no ventures. Yeah, I'm running ventures team. Anybody in here doesn't want to run ventures, now's your chance. Why are you buying the battle pass just now? I'm confused, Omar. Should I not be 
redeeming my stars. I feel like if I get Battle Pass stars from Save the World, then I should redeem them. Unless you're suggesting that I'm slow to be redeeming them. To which I would say, I, I've been playing real life lately. Or Bloons Monkey City. We're all good on run adventures in this lobby. I'm low level, I'll leave you want a higher level player. I do want a higher level player, but I think we're good. So you're welcome to stay. And you might, I don't care. Lead our quest, but I don't care about that. What do I need to do? Oh my God, I'm not done with this game. I need water enemies and pianos. Do we have a water zone in a city? That'd be fucking sweet. Be fucking sweet. Maybe suburbs. We'll do the no element, retrieve the data. That'll have all of them. Gotta grab my gold. Dude, this is so satisfying. Just loading this game up every hour. Gotta find the Easter bunnies, you guys. Can you believe this game is free? The amount of amazing experiences you can get in this world for zero dollars. And not just Bloons Monkey City, but also Marvel Strike Force, one of the current sponsors for the stream. If you guys check out this link in chat, make it all the way to level seven. I get financial kickback. It supports me directly, and I really do appreciate it. It also ticks right up here. You get a nice little notification with your name when you reach it. Level 20 and 30 also help me out. I uh, definitely recommend checking it out. Marvel Strike Force is free, easy to play alongside uh, save the world as well, so you can just kind of put your phone on your desk while you play, and it's pretty sweet. Smooth ass plug, uh, XTX, I- that means two things. That means two things. And it should be smooth. He said, alright, bro. <laughs> He's like, alright. Alright. This fucking guy. This guy's fucking ass, I swear. This guy is a fucking ass. Get it? <laughs> Storm guy gets it. Oh wow, Blakebeard stash right away. Wow. Wow, okay. Quality of life update. Dude, the battle pass being accessible from Save the World would be so nice. I've been stuck on Chandelier Quest. How do you find him? You find a certain uh, building. So there's a certain building that's like kind of stair stepped. We're not in a city, so I'm not going to be able to show it, but I hope pianos spawn in industrial. I'm pretty sure they don't. I'm just being hopeful. I need water kills, so that's mostly why I'm here. Um, but it's a stair stepped building, and it's actually just a rare spawn. Sometimes you just don't see it. So, it's actually worth it, if you're struggling to get the quest done, to just load in and out of games. What you're basically doing at that point is just filtering your lobby. Just checking, nope, the building's not here, leaving, loading back in, checking, nope, the building's not here. That's obviously best to do solo, so you're not just abandoning a party every time, but, yeah. Unremarkable Squid says, can play Marvel Strike Force while doing Evacuate the Diarrhea. Yes, that's true. If you queue and evacuate the diarrhea mission, you will have- I don't want that to be a thing in my chat, that's so gross. If you do an evacuate the shelter mission, you have 10 minutes to kill before the mission starts, and Marble Strike Force is a great way to kill the time, so... You know, if you've done all your radar towers and ventures, and you're just big chillin', and my stream is still on the- You know, if you're watching my stream, playing ventures, you finish a radar grid, you've got 10 minutes to burn, you got nothing going on. Marble Strike Force. Look at Cloak Shadow, just being great. This is him and the commander. Isn't that fucking sweet, you guys? Just so much extra damage. I didn't even want to use the cry, I just wanted it to die. Why is Carbide the best dungeons hero? He's not. Uh, he's not the best dungeons hero. It's just that dungeons is an enclosed space, and his perk bounces off of walls. <laughs> so... That's a combo made in heaven right there. That's, yeah. I mean, you just can't get better than that. You go to the Labyrinth Dungeon and run Carbide and you will have a great time. His cooldown is like a minute and it doesn't even matter. Punch, thank you again. Fill out my cup. Yeah, so if you go into a city zone and just queue in and out looking for it, there you go. 
likely what I'm gonna have to do for chandeliers. I haven't even gotten the chandelier, I don't think. I'm really behind adventures. Like I said in Discord when I pinged about the stream, I very much might stream a couple times this week instead of just on Wednesdays because I would like to finish ventures before end. What would you recommend for the lab? Uh, just a typical minigun build, honestly. I pretty much exclusively run minigun in dungeons. Unless you're doing that quest where you have to run one of each hero type and do that first. But minigun works. Cloak Shadow, honestly. Pretty decent for enemies. Like, the clubs would be good for the monoliths, uh, coconuts, and everything is fine. And then Cloak Shadow just gives you so many free kills, it's great. <laughs> and then they blow up. Yeah, so they cap you at holding eight at a time, so you might as well use them. Man, I came here for water enemies, and I'm not seeing as many water enemies as I wish. I need 26. Look at Cloak Shadow, everybody. Look how strong he is. I need a coconut, and I do more damage. Isn't this so satisfying? I killed, like, two enemies, and everything just dies. This build is so satisfying. To think that there are people who stopped using Blakebeard Stash after the update. Acting like it was ruined or something. The perk is fine. In all my experience, the perk is fine. Oh my god, I did not realize this was a defense mission. I actually- I thought this was Illuminate and Collect. I shit you not. Huh. Well, I hope the main defense is water, because that's what I need right now. Coconut buffs his damage, then with Holy Rockin' Out might actually be very strong. Yeah. Coconut's plus Holy Rockin' Out might be a weird, good combo for him. Uh, I'll go get the health by one. Oh! Water enemies. Let me just eat a coconut while everything dies. I did not realize the coconut buffed him. That's a good good amount of damage. Just stand there. It's only available for four seconds, but four seconds could go a long way, am I right, ladies? Oh, a boar. Legendary. Yes. 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 Sitting through his streams right now, very difficult. Are you being toxic now? Are they talking about me? Is my stream difficult to sit through? Is that what we're doing? If we finish the sponsor goal and get 100 people to do that, can you go bald? Uh, no. I will go bald for a price, but nobody has offered that price yet, so. No walls, even the mobs, I know. Thanks for hanging out, Xeno, bro. <laughs> Alright, here's the deal. If you need to sit through my stream to add me, go through the chore that is being on my friends list. Uh, storm chest on me, teammates, if you want it. A subscriber gets 264 channel points per hour. If you need 6,000 more points, <laughs> then 22.7 more hours. That is not including... That is not including um, starting the storm chest team, if you guys want it. I'll wait a few more seconds. That is not including cheering 100 bits. Or no, if you cheer one bit in the month, you'll get 300 points right away. If you subscribe, you'll get a bunch of points. If you participate in a raid, you'll get points. If you follow, you'll get points. A lot of those are one-time things or once a month things, but yeah, there are ways to get channel points. Vacuum Tubo also finishes your daily quests, destroying objects. Um, yeah, probably a few ways to do it. It's just that the Xenon bow is... cuts through walls, it's so easy. Yeah, so because you can only hold eight cannonballs, I actually like to just use the cannonballs up. Since you're just gonna leave them on the ground anyway. If you start with eight, you just throw down to one remaining and then you're good to go. Look at all those items, you guys. Storm chests are so useful. Ah! Oh. Upload a beast, channel bit farming, guys. See what perks I need. If you just hang out in the stream and donate once a month, you'll get all the channel points you can use. Honestly, channel points can be a little pay to win. You will get double channel points if you're a tier 3 sub. But that's 25 bucks a month, and that's... 
Oh wow, it's water defense. All this effort and it's been water the whole time. What a waste of time. Look at that, I'm gonna kill a riot husky with never attacking it. <laughs> Dude, I love Cloak Shadow! I don't know... Why? I don't know why. He's just so satisfying. So satisfying. Alright, let me double check this again. So I'm damaging for a lot. I can't even tell. Is that 82,000? Well, earlier it was pretty obvious that the coconut was doing more damage. But that might have been battle beat. AS, do you want to test for me quick? Is that easy for you to do? Because it looks like Battle Beat is doing more damage when you have Cloak Shadow going. Like, let's see, I'm doing... Well, now I have Battle Beat. So it's 81,000, and then it's... There are too many damage numbers. I can't isolate the variable. It is buffing it. Yeah, it looks like Battle Beat is giving it more damage. Because you said it wasn't earlier, but I think it is. Jeez. Both of them died to a crit. Is there enough time to get to level 50 adventures? You can hit level 50 from zero right now. One week is enough time to finish ventures, yes. Won't be easy or, or maybe fun, but you can do it. Uh, Robert, begging to add me is not how you get on my list. If you do exclamation point add me, you'll get them. How do you make him dance with the cannonballs? Okay, so that wasn't the cannonballs. That was the Ventures modifier. Every 30 kills, you get an elemental burst, like that. And one of them is dancing. Favorite US president. Oh, boy. That's a boring subject, and I'm going to swerve it. How often do you stream a week? Lately, it's been on Wednesdays only. I've been on vacation, just taking a break from making videos, getting my brain back. And so I have been streaming on the weekly shop resets pretty much exclusively. But I mentioned earlier, I will likely do another stream this week just to, just to cover. Cover ventures. You lose any sanity when streaming? Oh yeah, absolutely. Not at the rate that I've been streaming, but a little bit. Streaming can be very exhausting, believe it or not. Coco has been made record with 100% shit all buff it. Yeah, it's pretty good. I did play a Cypher PK, yeah. Carried in through the Storm King fight. Kitsune, welcome. You know, it is an exhausting Marvel Strike Force, yeah. You can make it every other sentence if you make it that easy. Uh, not that many enemies spawning. Yeah, streams are definitely fun. I like streaming as well. It's just that Save the World can be a very toxic game. It can be boring if you're in the end game, and it can be toxic if you read what people say, and I just need a little break from all that. And it's gonna be a big break. Like, I'm, I'm looking in the scale of months here, but I'll obviously make update videos. Like, my reminder video that went live today, I'll keep up to date with stuff like that. I'm not gone, I'm just... I'm gonna slow down on the regular uploads. You know, the, the fun loadouts and stuff. Jeez, this is clearly the place to be.
Ran into Stonewood missions with two kids and a grown woman with three kids. They were low-key bullying her and then started calling her Mama Bear and she left. Yeah, that's not cool. Little kids say the worst shit. They don't realize the effects of their actions yet. Wow, this mini boss is going down fast. Grab that cloak shadow damage. That was easy. Holy crap. Can we nego- no. When is Blake Bear coming out again? I don't know. Timeline's in the description. Power level 40? Thanks for the Chaos Agent tip. Only recently started watching. Okay, good. Good. Um, yeah, Dungeons is not, not permanent. Comes and goes throughout the year. My friend is a scam group. No, oh, that's disgusting. Yeah, if you're having struggle powering up, uh, if you do exclamation point PL in the YouTube chat, you'll see the video on how to raise your power level. Probably easier to do that in ventures, honestly. You get so much more survivor XP. Ventures gives you access to higher power level missions than you'd normally have if you're a Plankerton player. And you'll get way more survivor XP from a 108 mission in ventures than you will from a power level 40 in Plankerton. Sick of the lunar season. Yep. Season ends soon. That's why seasons rotate, because people get tired of them. Crossbones Barret in the Pirate Llamas, right? Uh, yeah. Crossbones Barret is in the Pirate Llamas. He's kind of a weird time to flux him right now. Trying to find somebody to help you with ventures. Yeah, so don't use the word help or carry. Look for people to play ventures with you. Because that gives the sound that you're going to be a, a productive teammate doing things with them. If you look for people your power level to play with, then uh, yeah. Hey, level seven, Schnemley, thank you so much. I don't even know if he's in the stream. He was getting his, his kids. Yeah. Blakebeard stash is so fun. Need a new name for the voice chat. Mm, maybe. Being left on scene by 44,000 people is the best. Yeah, that's a bad attitude. So all 44,000 people in the Discord are not looking at the channel when you type it at that moment. In fact, more often than not, uh, only a few thousand people are in the Discord online at any given time at all and maybe, maybe only a few hundred even glancing at that chat, probably less. So it's just good to be patient and friendly. If you talk to people naturally and then say, hey, do you wanna play games? That's the best way to do that. Nobody needs to help anybody. That's a very important thing to remember. Absolutely nobody is obligated to do anything for you. And if people don't jump to your aid immediately, it's very important to not feel entitled and just be patient. See, I got Master Waffle looking for people to play with. I got Christy looking for people to play with. I got Skrilly looking for people to play with. I've got almost a full lobby in my stream right now. Now, that is between YouTube and Twitch. But if you guys just talk to each other, you can get some stuff done. Yeah, we have lots of people that are older in our Discord. We don't, um, we don't have... I guess the only age-restricted channel is Gentleman's Club. Um, but that's not Fortnite. That's mostly just shit posting and porn. But... The Power Level 124 Plus channel is a lot more quiet. And Kane, you having gifted subs and a sub yourself, would have access to the VIP channels. And the VIP channels are far and away the most relaxed channels in our server. This, this is just the coolest people just talking, playing, chatting, lots of regulars in here. And because I only have between YouTube members, patrons, subscribers on Twitch, there's probably only 400 people in there. It's a lot quieter. It's a lot more mature. And if you're looking for people that are <laughs> a little more relaxed, 
you say older, but I imagine on the mature side is hopefully what you're after. You'll, you'll find people that are uh, more mature in there. Okay, so I need pianos. And... Takers, blasters, smashers. This is... I don't like refuel the home base. I might go down. Uh... My name is Taken, thank you for the Prime sub! Yes, both of them. Yeah, yeah, yeah. There are a lot of mature people in those channels, for sure. I don't like evac either, man. Is there a single city zone that's, like, sufferable? Deliver the bomb. Is this a freaking troll right now? Ugh. A 108 Cat 3? Fuck it, we'll just do refuel. How big is the jump from 7 to 20? It took me maybe an hour tops to hit 7. So you can go through the campaign, Schnemly, and you can auto-replay. You can auto-play like 9 or 10 times some of the lower level missions. I think level 20 is kind of like the limit for the daily. If Jay plays is in chat, he can give better tips. But he said he went to the lower campaigns and just replayed them quickly. I played for two and a half hours and didn't even hit 17. So, I think replaying the lower level campaign missions might be the best use of your energy for the day. If you just, like, do the autoplay. Like, autocomplete that ten times. I finished my piano's missions when carrying you in ventures while you played Marvel. Maybe they're not shared then, Kai. Because I did not get all the pianos done. Hmm. How does he add me? I claimed it. Oh, it... Yeah, I need your username. That's that's the most important part. And pianos are done. Well, fuck me, I guess. I guess I'll just go defend some objects. I fucking shot one Xenombo. I fired one shot. Broke a piano. Ooh, yes, yes. I want a pot shot. I want that. Honestly, I'll take it. Double fire rate damage. I'll honestly be happy with that. Alright. Uh, I guess some... Hey, there we go. Listen up. Unremarkable Squid says, The Blue Glow refineries are just Star Wars Blue Milk Extractors. Okay. I think I missed a reference there. I'm sorry. I'm getting a little hungry, too. That's kind of annoying. I ate Arby's right before I went live. I wonder if that just shows how many calories I burn recording these streams for you guys. Like, hanging out with you. Just talking, playing, listening to Nightcore music that's muted for the stream. It's a lot to keep up with. I'd love to know how many calories I burn just talking to you guys. Look at that, chat. Look at that. We just got community going on here. Wanna play? Can I join my users that? Sure, add me back. Easy. Who would have thought, Chad, if you just talk to people within the community, you might get a lobby going. Super easy. Barely an inconvenience. As soon as you guys add each other, I do appreciate it if the conversation moves to Discord DMs or whispers in-game, but... Happy to see it happening. Is it worth doing the mission if I only got two chandelier? Uh, no, honestly. There are certain, uh, buildings that spawn where you get basically all the chandeliers at once. I would say, if you can load in and get half the chandeliers, that's what you should get. So if it's like 10, then I wouldn't stay unless you get at least 5. Maybe somebody in chat can agree or disagree with that. I need to pee. Where's the link for the event timeline? Uh, somebody will probably run it before I... Oh, there, there you go. Yeah, and I'm really big on, like, making friends, you guys. I think that's the key. If you find people that you enjoy playing with, and you tell them you enjoy playing with them, <laughs> let them know that this is a real relationship. It doesn't... Relationship means more than dating, by the way. It's, it's a real friendship. <laughs> if you let people know, hey, I appreciate you, and I like doing things with you. That's great. That's great to just form that, because then you guys can play together. You can have future sessions in the future. You can make that a real thing, and now instead of asking for carries in Discord, you just message your buddy and say, Hey, are you around today? Get a quick yes or no, and if yes, you're gaming. If not, then that's alright. Hopefully you got... You know, there are other people in the world, you can find them. And that's when you find out that you enjoy playing with somebody else more than the first guy, and then there's drama, and then... Well, shoot, at that point, you're just living life. If you don't have drama, I don't know what's going on. 
What is drama but life with the doll bits cut out? Does anybody know that reference? I know it's a quote, but I'm I'm quoting a game. Does anybody know that? If there's anybody in chat that knows what game I'm talking about from that alone, I will be so happy. What is drama but life with the doll bits cut out? Said like that. Anybody? Can somebody point to Discord chat for linking up game? Uh, there's a whole Fortnite section. Ugh, Civilization 5. I don't know what research that sound cue cues from, but it's one of them. You're eating rice wafers right now? Is it gonna be totally rocking out? Uh, I don't know. Are you critting more? What would critting more in real life be? <laughs> it's like, I don't know, man, but the girl I'm talking to just started laughing more. Is that critting? Am I winning? Oh shit. Smasher. Wow. These are tough. Um I made friends from your Discord, still friends with them now. That's awesome. That's what I like to see. Why is this Wait, don't we have one more? I thought we had one more. I love just blowing up the nurse. I actually don't know. Do you need to do all three? Autumn City, uh, a city zone. That's all you're looking for is city. Mission type is irrelevant. Hmm. I ran our cannonballs. You realize browse channels within your Discord? There you go. Got to add Cypher PK today. Now I have two favorite streamers added. How did you add Cypher PK? That's not the easiest friends list to get on. And he didn't delete me for space, did he? I wouldn't even know how to check my friends list. It's such a disorganized mess. Yeah, if you're looking to do the lab for Chaos Agent, you need to run any other dungeon. So, crypts one time. That unlocks the lab, and then you just run it a couple more times. Beast deleting me for space? Yeah. So, whenever I need space on my friends list, I delete based on time played. And if you don't play for a really long time, you risk losing your spot on my list. I also take into account people that actually do play with me once I have them added. Some people I'll add and then they just keep me on their list but never join whenever I have space on stream. It's like, alright, well, 
sometimes I'll see somebody who hasn't played in eight months on my friends list, and I have never, I have no memory of running any games with them. And I think like, what are you doing? It's like a dead spot on my list. If you're gonna add me off the stream and then never interact, like, it's kind of a waste. I keep hearing lobbers, flingers. I love being able to damage them through their shields. Gosh, can't get out of there. So those cones, in theory, protect the walls from the exploding death bomb. Doesn't work every time. I love just going for the weakest enemy and everything dies! Cloak Shadow instantly skyrocketed one of my favorite heroes now. Spent three games of checking. Yep, they're rare. Just keep going. Don't think about it. Anything worth trying is worth trying 17 times. That's the saying, right? That, I thought I was out of his range. Oh, that's from D. Okay. You guys like that little, uh, lobber snipe, huh? I love Cloak Shadow, man. It's perfect for this kind of defense. Getting Cory Perked Adventures? Uh, no, but you do get about five Cory Perk per venture season, so it's. Your effort is well rewarded. Jeez. I always run out to defend. I should just stay back here. Just let him come to me. Let him come to me. I'm like an OnlyFans star right now. That joke's funny, alright? That joke's funny! I know that. I don't always know what's funny, but that was funny. The first playing they felt nice because I got to play with my favorite streamer. Kai uh, KJ, how did you add... He said he was on... PK's... Cypher's list. KJ, did you tell the story on how you added... Cypher? How did you get on his list? Did he abandon my stream? Yeah, I like being able to add people from the stream, honestly. It's it's hard to get on my list because there's so many people that want to add me, but I, I like the fact that I'm not some massive streamer who just ignores their audience. Because some do that, um, and it's it's a good feeling. I'm doing great, Enforcer. I want a challenge. Oh, that's cool. Yeah, see, that, that makes sense to me. Like, I don't think Cypher makes a habit of... Adding a lot of people, because he's got a massive audience. A lot of people to keep happy there. Um, and he kept you added. Yeah. That's cool. What was the challenge? Now I'm curious. How long does it take to get level 20 adventures? Not long. You could probably run all of the power level 15 missions today. Get to level 7 adventures. Then you could... Um, come back tomorrow, do all the 15, or actually, shop is in 40 minutes, so you can do the 15s right now, hit level 7, as you would, and then you could just...
Hold on. Then you could just... Get really distracted while you're playing. Well, that's unlucky. Then you can come back tomorrow, do all the power level 15s, then queue your 23s, and just keep working up from there. It's just the first bit that's hard to get going. And that's working smarter, not harder. Like, you could do all the 15s and then all the power level 5 missions and whatever is necessary to finish, or like, get Venture started now, but... Um... You do have a week, and that means you can utilize that a little bit. I'm just saying, if you play it that way, you'll spend less time running less efficient missions. Always queue the highest power level ventures mission you can. And if you have people playing with you, that's just easier. I'm back and watching your streams. Welcome back. Glad to see you here. This is my loadout. I'm in, also in a game, so there you go. It's a very strong loadout. I highly recommend using it. I didn't make a video on it because, I don't know, I just talked myself out of it, but it is a strong build. I was very close to making a video on this. You have 35 flux. Back in the day, you could buy flux like five at a time or something. I remember I did that, so I have like a weird number of flux. Welcome back, Ali. I have a friend from his chat and he said they both 200 traps, they were 36. Okay. Oh, you explained on YouTube. Oh, okay. I'm confused then. I because I, I saw your original comment on, on Twitch, and then you said it again on YouTube, and then I saw the response on Twitch. Man, cannonballs are good. We must need like one more, because we got the whole team here. Got your 30S modded? Well done. I was gonna trap a mission with them just to spite you. That's really pointless. If you ever trapped a mission in my lobby with flame grills, I'd probably stop playing with you. And if you ever did it in your own game just to troll me, that would make no sense. That's like taking a bucket of paint and like painting your bedspread and being like, ha ha. And I'd be like, all right, well that's, that's a weird thing you did. I'm not sure why that counted as commentary, but there you go. It's like, I don't, I don't think you got me the way you, you thought you would. Just stay on Twitch now? Yeah, if you're watching the stream, communicating with me in one stream chat is the easiest for me to follow. I'm a little slow in uh, responding on YouTube, but yeah. Alright, let's go queue more. Let's go queue these last two, you guys. Or, you guys can do F. That works. I'm gonna go do this one. We need two more, and I wanna do them both. Oh, is it even possible? Because it takes three minutes, right? It takes three minutes? Hey, AK, welcome. You need two. So as long as I defend this in two minutes, I'm good. That's what I'm seeing. Alright, as long as Kieran and I stay on either side of each other, we can lock this down.
Man, those death bombs are crazy. This is why I love Cloak Shadow. Did you guys know that I like Cloak Shadow? I don't know if I've mentioned it enough times yet. Yeah, there's only 11 seconds to wait there. Alright. Okay. You like Cloak Shadow? I do, yeah. He's good now. I said it and got down. That's cool, KJ. Wow, we defended this with basically no defenses. Works for me. Yeah, we got the tanks required. Very cool. Oh, tanks required. I thought that was siphons. Yeah, I don't queue this mission that often. I'm on the point right now. Glad to catch the stream. Well, I'm glad you're here. My shoulders hurt because of the way I'm playing. What do you mean, Dimension? Any advice for getting PK Twine besides trees? Yes, red toolbox expeditions. And any encampment or anomaly with the wood icon can give you PK Twine if it's the right power level. And then if you recycle weapons and traps that come from glowing animals and storm chests and target practice, you can get PK Twine from those items as well. It's G Train. I don't know what G Train is. Your username is G Train? Yeah, we feel on base. I don't know. I, I don't have the strong opinions about it that a lot of people do, but I guess I can kind of get it. It's a busy mission with a lot going on. Oh, yeah, what am I supposed to be doing? Flamingos. Shatter Flamingos! City zones again. Duct tape, uh, smack ducks. Recycle weapons, you guys. Flamingos are city zones. Ugh. I hate evac missions. I could see mystics. Oh, right, 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 right. You're trying to add me. See, I just ignore messages when people say they're epic. Like, I see my epic username is, and then I stop reading. But I fucking forgot that you redeemed an admin. I got you. I was never going to steal your points. I'm just keeping up with a lot here. Yeah, recycling weapons gives more materials than it did before right now. So that's kind of nice. Have you checked the Save the World Reddit recently? No, Enforcer. Is there something I should know about? All right. Yeah, 30 Oxy. Yeah. It's... Glowing animals are very good. Any streamers doing giveaway? Yeah, no. Giveaways are not how you get batteries. That's... You don't need giveaways. You're a better player than that. Giveaways are what noobs need when they don't want to play the game. You can run clip and go punch a bunch of electric parts. You'll get you'll get what you need. All right, what am I doing here? Uh, is my sniper upgrade done? There has to be a better way to do this scrolling. Okay, semi-auto is gonna take forever. Okay. 
Uh, what was I going to do? It wasn't Tax Sprayer. It wasn't one of them. It wasn't Bomb. I don't even like Mortar. I had another upgrade, and I don't remember what it was. I don't think I can get Mob Shutter right now. All right. Never mind. Yes. Okay, I'm glad I was diligent, because I started to doubt that there was anything I wanted to get, and I, I see now. Okay, good. That's Bloons Monkey City. Just a really fun game. Free to play on Steam, too, which is insane. But the farms in that game generate 24-7. So if I just load up my game every hour or so... Then I'll, uh, wow, that was an excellent start. What the fuck? Well, that's a solid start to my game. Instant chest, bunch of kills, two more chests. Stocked up. Blue team, yeah, so honestly, Bloom's Monkey City might as well be something new if you've never played it before. Where do flamingos spawn, you guys? I'm not even sure what I'm supposed to be looking for. Everywhere. Do I have to collect them? I miss getting high and watch Frost Night Street. Jesus. Just gotta look. Okay. They spawn in spas? Hmm. I don't know if that's true. Start playing again. Appreciate your videos. That's awesome, Erica. Glad to see you back. The game has a lot going on. The game definitely has a lot going on. I'm not getting any flamingos. So what do I do? Do I abandon this game? Because I need flamingos. I also need XP, so we can play this one out. Yes, I've been watching it a lot. I just want to say thank you for everything. It starts to go easy. That's awesome. I appreciate it, Callum. Appreciate the kind words. And Forrest, you asked me if I had looked at the Reddit recently, and I'm not sure why. Because I don't, I don't look at the Reddit. That's one of those examples, by the way, chat. Target practice. Super worth it. Even if you don't have good aim, just use a shotgun. It's worth doing. <sighs> I appreciate that hybrid. By the way, have you used that, uh, that Prime sub? I'm looking at that badge right now, hoping you've used it this month. Ugh. I tried finding your Twitch and finally found it because I watch your YouTube videos all the time. Yeah, I link in the description. I've, I've seen comments like that where people have struggled to find my Twitch and it, and it hurts because... Alright, this is my point, chat. Look. Oh, I don't know where that weapon went, but... The weapon I got from the melee side, at least. You can just recycle these things. Where the hell did it go? Okay, if your inventory is not a mess, but, like, these are all things you can get from these. It's so useful. Uh, yeah, like, I've heard people sometimes struggle to find my Twitch, and it crushes me, because I, it's linked below. It's right there. But you're here. You're here. 11 batteries, holy crap. Yeah, it's... Target practice is super useful. Super useful. Um, yeah, founders on one account, progress on another. That's tough. At least, maybe you could just play on your Xbox. Start over a little bit, gift yourself some things. Maybe. I'm planning on subscribing three months when I get paid tomorrow. Oh, shit. Well, you should use your Prime sub on somebody. That's all I'm saying. Make sure it doesn't uh, go unused. You get paid tomorrow. Well, I'm gonna have to stream tomorrow then, huh? If I got three months sub coming in. Oh, you already did? Good, good, good. That's what I'm saying. 
I, I call out every prime badge I see. Just make sure they're using it on someone. Doesn't need to be me. Just make sure you're using that prime sub. I have gotten no pink flamingos. That makes me want to back out of the game. I'm not going to, but I'm, I wanna. Anyone know how I can redeem the code? Yeah, you go to your settings. Uh, you have to make uh, the account. And then you redeem it in there. Sure, Enforcer. Oh, Broadside Spammers are back. Is that what you're talking about? Inventures? Broadside Spammers? Or on, on Reddit? Is that all you're talking about? Or just Broadside Spammers on Reddit? You found yours in Suburban Zone. Yeah. I thought I would need a city, and then I queued it this, and it, I'm not seeing it. Yeah, any founders will give you V-Bucks. Hmm. They're making your eyes hurt. Yeah. I do my best. I talk about the correct way to use broadsides every chance I get. It just doesn't make a difference. Backpack 240s from Founder Stuff. Unavailable. Do you report cheaters in game? Yeah, you should. The publisher's clearinghouse just called me. I won $2.5 million in the Mercedes... What? The publisher's clearinghouse just... I don't understand. Gildas, I don't understand! Is this a joke or are you a millionaire? I need to make a movement. I don't know, dude. I've made multiple videos on how to place broadsides correctly. I just... Ed McMahon is a scam call. Okay. <laughs> I didn't know! Yeah, scam calls... can be a thing. How close are you to 10,000 survivors? I don't know, like a thousand off. Yeah. Hey, millionaire, can you... Help us get to Hype Train 100. <laughs> nice, Electro Giant. Electrical Giant. What, I, what should I spend my weapon voucher on? I got a whole video on that. Link in chat. Hey guys, look. Cloak Shadow. Does that pixel update? Yes. I'm in ventures, Archer. Hey, Abdul, welcome. I'm doing great, actually. Ugh, I'm sitting at like a bad angle because my shoulders hurt and I don't know. I don't know what to do about that. Like, do I need to lean back or something? Traffic light, city. I thought that one would be obvious. I'm not gonna lie. Oh good, I got the crit at the end. Look at that. I can drop for myself. What to aim for grinding ventures as you're almost maxed up? What to aim to grind? I'm not sure what your question is. Best spot for mist monsters in Plankerton? If you just need 50 mist monsters or something, uh, encampments. Encampment missions at the end, they'll consistently spawn enough mist monsters. If you need smashers or whatever, then literally any defense mission. Retrieve the data. You got, um, ride the lightning. Who checked that and didn't pick it up? Story gonna be on April 3rd, like the one is blockbusters. Uh, pirates, I think. Yeah, I don't know, Archer.
I'm a cloak shadow fan. <laughs> this is insane. They're all physical too. Just standing here and everything dies. Why can't I see my crosshair and see the world? I don't know. I don't know what causes that. I keep getting asked and I don't know the answer. Yeah, pirate llamas are really strong. A lot of good stuff in there. How to fix a failed lock profile? I don't know. I think you just wait a couple minutes. I had a guy in my comments, like, reinstall his game or something. That was crazy. No need for that. Just, just be patient. It should fix itself. Any book recommendations after finishing Cradle? Oh god, nothing follows Cradle. I have tried. Have you finished Cradle? Were you reading Cradle and you didn't talk about it with me? Why? You should talk to me about Cradle. Are you excited about the new adventure season? Sure. I am on break for making videos right now, but I might have to come back to cover Horde. That's too exciting. Yeah, you don't need to tell me when shop is. What's your opinion on two blockbuster heroes you get from the story? I cover that in my video I just posted on YouTube. Carbide's really fun for dungeons, and Cloak Shadow's pretty unexciting. Please stream after 5 p.m. Then I'll subscribe. <laughs> uh, tomorrow or today? And I don't know your time zone, so I'm not sure what we're talking about here. Because it's already after 5 p.m. today. If I stream tomorrow, though, it wouldn't even be after 5 p.m. Central Standard. Yeah, it, it would. It would not be. It would actually be up until then. So if you're looking to do a three-month sub, maybe I should just stream on Friday, huh? Maybe that'll be better for everybody, huh? Finishing book every other day, and now I feel empty. Oh my god. Well, don't feel too empty or you become the void space. <laughs> so fucking stupid. <laughs> That's too fast. I... I think you did that to yourself. I don't think you should read any book every other day. That's too fast. Yeah, Austin, a lot of people signing up. Are you gonna be one of them? Oh, wait, no, you, you were 30, weren't you? Jesus, dude. It's fucking crazy. Uh, I play with A1 again. We tried! Oh my god, I texted him every fucking week that Horde season. But his sleep schedule was way off. Like, he was going to bed at shop, and I was that's when I was recording. It's just like, there was no overlap. One of the six goat. That's true. That's true. Instant goat status if you hit level 30 in Marvel Strike Force. Um. Same issue they didn't. Yeah, he's just hard to pin that. Well, he's also in a different country. Got fucking Africa time zones over there. In Africa. Wow. 
An actual mini boss. Here we go. Trap vulnerable. Doesn't look like it. Oh, it is. Okay. <laughs> he got hit by one dart. One good crit from a dart and he just dies. How to get the upgrade of the survivors yellow one efficient. How to get the books to uh open lunar llamas and then recycle those items. Recycle heroes and survivors to get the training manuals. You want a blizzard? Go get one then, Austin. What's holding you back? You got your 30. You did, Gil Nuts! I missed the after Gil. I knew it was Gil something. Your alert came through right when I was prepping a daily video. And that was so perfect. Like, it wasn't on camera. That would have been more perfect. But I saw that one come through. I'll just subscribe six months then. Wait, what? I'm down. Hey, thank you for the other bits. Hard mode isn't harder. I <sighs> yeah, I think it will be. I think it will be. If you want to subscribe six months in advance, I'd obviously greatly appreciate it. What are the best Discord servers? I only acknowledge the minor of a Discord server. <laughs> that speaks to my personality, I guess. I made the server I wanted to be in, and then I don't, I don't really use other servers. Well, I do use one other server that I made for Pokemon Go. Yeah, I think Horde Mode will be tougher this season. There isn't a Dairy Queen anywhere near you. Well, I know there is near Austin. I just home and I don't want to leave again. Honestly, I think the most fun you could have today, Austin, is by just going right back out. You will come home not that long from now and feel so much better that you went. Speaking of going, I need to pee. Oh. Yeah, Archer, I just have a hard time learning about anything that's not in the game yet. I, I don't like digesting information that's not real yet. Yeah, XTX, you need five superchargers to get a 144. It's the Minerva Discord, it's in the description of the stream. That goes to you as well, Christy. Links in the chat, links in the stream. Um, how much time left till Ventures ends? Uh, this time next week, April 3rd. What do you mean I'm not real, Rosa? This is the real beast. You can tell because I'm calling you Rosa. Is this how humans are? Can you text it to me? Absolutely not. It's in the description of the stream. Like, scroll and a click. Um. Okay, I need to pee. I hope I get some flamingos. Ah! Is it flamingo time? Eh. Is it flamingo time? The real beast doesn't call me Rose. Are you claiming I am imposter? 
What is a quest for flamingos? Yeah, you need to- Oop, I just adrenaline rushed. Whoops. I got a flamingo! Alright! Let's get it going, guys! I'm on the board! One out of ten! Woo! Where treasure chest? Oh, they aren't underground. They're up here. There we go. You recommend me to supercharge my ranger. If you enjoy running the ranger, then yes. I supercharged my ranger. No regrets. All right, we need to cue the defense, like, quickly, you guys, so if you want to start it, I would really appreciate it. I need to look for flamingos, though. We're going to be late for shop if we don't start it, like, right away. Ah, this team perk's awesome. It's totally unusable, clearly. I was being serious? Yeah, me too. I mean, you just- you have to destroy ten flamingos. That's it. The hard part, of course, is not destroying flamingos. It's finding the flamingos to destroy. I got one. I got one! Literally one. Karen left the game. What? My internet just went out. Oh, shit. Look at that. Almost walked right by some pink flamingo action. Gotta be diligent out there, you guys. Pink flamingos are hiding from the radar. You gotta get right there, in and deep. You gotta search every nook and cranny if you wanna get them all destroyed in the time before the mission ends. Gotta ride the rails, gotta stay on the edge. Gotta look around, coast around the town, nearly avoid obstacles. Mm-hmm. Ugh. I bumped a tree. Can I get a happy birthday from Beast? Uh, birthday at 10 minutes? Well, happy birthday! Congrats on making another year. Well done! Oh. Tre. Tre. Supercharger is gonna be the... There we go. Man, I need to eat. Wish I'd have decided to do that before my daily video. But I'll just have to suffer through. Wow. Okay. So, Flamingo is gonna be one of those quests, huh? Oh shit, carry me to back. Three, huh? Fuck. Well... Whatever. And it's just a funny gnomes adventures. Basically what I just did. Someone probably asked a post about the trailer board. Well, there you go. They want what they already got. Oh, there you go. Um, should I build my stone wood to be AFK for endurance? Yeah, go for it. Are uh, the weekly shop refresh is random. Uh, weekly, yes. The event side can be predicted and it's kind of on a cycle, but Weekly is pretty random, you know. Well, that guy got fucked up. <laughs> oh, yeah, I do need mist monsters as well, don't I? Uh, taker smashers. Takers like to take forever. Taker, I hardly know her.
I think Cloak Shadow is my favorite hero. Fun game design. This is good. This is how the game should be. <sighs> Kai, I don't need that. That's like a huge pet peeve of mine, chat. Counting down the shop or telling me when it is is highly unnecessary and it just stresses me out. Here and out of the game again. That internet is not behaving. Also, hi, Poplio. What is the 5828 in your name? What does that mean? Unremarkable Squid says, if you see a sea of flamingo floating in water, are they flamboyant? <laughs> They've just been using these cards to tell their own jokes. This is brutal. I'm sorry, chat. If you guys want to buy stream loots packs and then use those packs to also say jokes, then, then you're welcome to. Oh, shit. Or redeem me sharing a joke. I have a whole book of jokes that are awesome. So the joke card is my current favorite stream loots redeem. Eh, I don't want to do the target practice. I'm hungry now. I'm decaying fast. Wow, that is a very burning clax. I feel like that actually makes sense, considering the clax is like a wooden weapon. My old Discord tag. Uh, I don't like it. That looks designed Labyrinth or Lab. Lab. Yeah, I still need to do Tears of the Kingdom. I, I've been getting my fill on that game in a different playthrough, though, so... Yeah. Well, if nothing's going to spawn, maybe I should do the target practice. Uh, stream video with Aiden. He's in America right now for his job. Or his oh, I don't know. Yeah, I don't have a good way to contact Aiden. He just does his own things. I've reached out too many times without, like, a real response. <laughs> I've even had, like, commenters of mine comment on his videos, so... Either he's avoiding me, or he's just inherently uninterested in doing stuff with other people. I don't know what his deal is. I'm at that, like, pride moment where I've I've reached out without a response too many times. Balls in his court. You tell him Beast wants to do videos together and he can do with that information what he will. That's awesome, Hanks. I'm glad to help. Aiden did AI thumbnails. I mean, it's worth trying if it makes your job a little easier. If my thumbnails could be helped with AI, I'd think about it. It's amazing how many... how much damage you can get going with those cannonballs. Ah, uh, this is Ventures right now, yeah. Cannibals are so strong, I love them. Hmm. Is that something I need over there? No, we're not gonna get it though. You could throw him so fast. What's a good... You got a good bow? Yes, I did. I got the Xenon bow. Alright. Shop right now. Let's see what's going on before everybody tells me... Really? Nothing in Save the World? Jeez. Ugh. Ugh. Three upgrade llama tokens. That's all we get. 
God damn, okay. BR is scarce too. Okay. Thanks for playing, Shade. Ah, things are pretty casual right now. Dude, I love how how easy it is to load up this game and check. Look at this. Game loads up. Grab, 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 grab. Alright. Put that away until later. Now the weapons of your charger? Nice. Yeah, you should, Erica. The Ventures rewards are great. Grab them before they go away. As soon as they reset to the next season, you can't get this season's rewards anymore. You either get them... Get them before they're gone. Okay, I need a low-level Ventures player in my party. Archer, do you want to send the Trello again? I figure that might be sh good to show on the daily video. Ryan Reynolds in the item shop? What? That website never updates. Isn't that normal? I thought he had a skin. Like, free guy? Yeah. He was last seen 238 days ago. I'm not sure what the significant significance is of that, Archer. Thank you, Archer. Um. Okay, let me double check pictures. Let's see. All the way down. Thank you. You want to buy the new Hush skin? Well, you should use code mi I, I read the second message he sent. Uh, thank you, Reaper. We're good. I appreciate it. Oh my god, I'm actively hungry right now. It's amazing. When I get hungry, I get hungry. Everything I do, it's like... burning my food away. Like, I can... Everything I do in game that requires any amount of thinking is just... scorching my insides. Ruined the ad, but... <laughs> yeah, I understand if you don't want to spend money on V-Bucks in Fortnite. I've honestly long been blown away. Absolutely shocked at how much money people spend on skins in these games. People ask me, like, why do you use Luxa so much? It's like, I, I, I feel like I aged out of that. When I was a kid, I used to change my usernames in games all the time. I could never decide anything, but... Uh, I got to an age where I just kind of set things and forget it. Like, once I'm good, I'm good. And that includes with, like, skins. Like, Lux is kind of cute. Sure, I'll, that'll be my skin forever. And then I... only talk about it nowadays because people ask me so much. Like, I, I... People... Sometimes they want, like, a nuanced answer as to why do you run Lux all the time? And I'm like, I think you think about this more than I do. <laughs> I think you've put more thought into this than me. I don't know what would lead people to suggest that I'm, like, obsessed with Lexa outside of Fortnite or something. I don't know. It's weird. Yeah, you stop giving a fuck. Like, honestly. Like, honestly, actually, I just unlocked the Battle Pass stuff. And, um, some of those sets look really cool. But are they so much cooler than whatever I got going with Lexa right now to swap out my whole thing? Not, I don't know. Not really. I'm not looking at my character, unless it's party hips, in which case the world stops spinning for a second. Wow, I need to eat as soon as I'm done with this video. Preferably prior, but I don't want to delay the video. Uh, I don't know what people to think of me. <laughs> Should I make my Storm King's Ravager Bright Core or Sunbeam? Uh, yeah. I have three copies supercharged, so when it comes to the Storm King's Ravager, the road is long. 
<laughs> if you want the full breakdown of why you should do whatever you want to do with the Ravager, link here. Uh, Brightcore is kind of better for Luna. Sunbeam's better if you're using it for weapon damage. You do kind of want both in the end game, but that video breaks down all the do's and don'ts. Like, if you wanted to be cheeky and just, like, steal my perks here, you, you could, but this still isn't the full picture. Triple crit damage is worth having, triple attack speed energy is worth having, like, I've got five different copies of the Ravager crafted at all times. It's just that kind of weapon where it is the strongest melee in the game, kind of period. There are instances where other weapons are stronger, but Ravager's insane. I'm going to be recording my daily in a second. And and never ask to play, please. A mod can run the command for that, please. Just to let people know how they get in my game and that it's, it's not super random. I take people who are already on my list and I just let them join first come, first serve. Um, if it's your first time hanging out in a stream, welcome. Hey. But uh, getting in my... Uh, I've already got a full lobby, but my cursor was there anyway, so... Oh, base Kyle. Wow. Okay. Literally, even blue, that's an amazing hero to have. Kind of forgot after three years. Yeah, I know, I know. I appreciate you stopping in the stream, though. Hope you hang out. Because honestly, I don't even filter my lobby. Usually, three people get on my list. Three people from my list get in my lobby, and then I just go. I don't... <sighs> there are a few melees you'd want at least three versions. Okay. I'm sure you could talk forever about that. Let me get my cram session video prepped. Now, would you look at that? It is a known bug that recycling traps does not give you the full resources that they should. Uh, but what's also going on that I did not know about in yesterday's daily video is that recycling weapons is giving you significantly more than they did before. I don't think that's intentional. Don't get used to this. But for the time being, if you're out playing the game, killing glowing animals, now is a really good time to be recycling their loot because if you get a full durability weapon from an animal out in the wild, you are going to get, look at this actually, real weapons that I got from real animals playing this game. Sun, oh, actually I didn't uh, click them all. Yeah, yeah, look at that. Oxy, 24, 24 efficient as well. 10 sunbeam is covered by my face cam. 24 batteries just from killing random animals. So, uh, yeah, you know, I'm not really mad about that. I don't mind, uh, I, I don't like the recycling bug with traps right now, but uh, I'll take some extra loot from weapons. Again, both of these are bugs. I don't expect either of those to stay in the game, but, you know, I'll, I'll take it, I'll take it. Quick PSA to my low-level players, by the way. A blue base Kyle is in Stonewood. That's a really good constructor for making your walls thicker. It's a nice thing to know about, but I'm pretty sure when you start the game, you get a green one for free, whatever. Uh, weekly supercharger going left to right here is the weapon supercharger. If you don't know how to get a weapon supercharger, it's uh, here. Let me just get my copy paste because a lot of people ask and I know this is going to be super small because I'm on 1440p, but that's kind of it. Hopefully you can see that at the highest resolution video. I'm sorry if you can't, but there you go. Uh, Dungeon Daily is also Grotto. So if you want to go ahead and get lost in Grotto, I have an easier time in Labyrinth than Grotto, but you know, wh whatever. There's also the uh, cram session stuff. Definitely do the cram session. The two that you care about are chests and safes, and they are really, really easy to do in dungeons. I'm going to be linking my cram session video in the description every single day until the season ends which is in one week, by the way. I'll get to that in a second. You definitely want to get this done because this gives you a really good guide. I actually timestamped the crap out of this. I was so thorough. Look at this on the right-hand side outside of theater mode. You can see I have every single chest and mimic that I could find in Inferno. We did a lot of research on this, and it, you can get both of those done simultaneously. That's perk up and gold. Over 10,000 gold in less than two hours. Super, super worth doing. And I'm bringing so much emphasis to this because there's one week left in ventures. If you guys want any ventures rewards, uh, anything from the uh, the item shop, any, any last llamas you want to pick up, I actually did just make a video breaking down everything that you should grab before this season goes away. This whole one week left video, I'll link that down below as well. Super good resource. If you don't know anything, definitely want to watch this. Chaos Agent is available. He's going away soon. Same with Carbide and all the other heroes. 
Stoneheart Pharaoh's already gone. But, you know, you still have time for everything else. And if you have not started adventures, I get this question all the time. If you have not started adventures, you still have time to hit level 50. It's going to be a massive grind. You can do it. And if you're a low-level player, it's at least worth it to hit, like, 23 or 22 adventures. Because then you get 200 uh, legendary flux total. You get one hero voucher and one weapon voucher. That's really good for getting stuff out of season. But you should always consult the yearly timeline. This is also linked down below. This gives us the best idea of when stuff comes around. And I also want to say, Survive the Horde, I think Archer gave me uh, updated information on what kind of seasons we should expect. I believe it's going to be normal Survive the Horde, and then everything listed here. And then there's a few more that I have to add on to this. But honestly, none of this has been officially announced yet anyway, so I'm just kind of giving my best guess. But I, I do keep this as updated as possible, this yearly timeline. So this is usually including the uh, the newest information. As mentioned, I did forget to add some of that. But that's also leaks. That's from Archer reading the game files, not Epic's mouth. So I'm not... 100% sure on anything until I see it, but um, yeah. Still going left to right. We got Highland Warrior Wildcat. Not super exciting. Frag Grenade Energy Cost. If she is the last hero that you get from the shop, that would be fitting. But you should still grab every event hero. Put them in the collection book at least. Just to have them, you never, ever know what they're going to update. You guys got to stay on top of that. So, yeah. I think that's pretty much everything for Save the World. Uh, we do not have any V-Bucks today. We do not have any Mythic Leads. No Legendary Survivors. We do have three Llama Tokens and Ventures if you are interested in that. But I'm going to get back to the missions in a second because uh, we're going to head to BR real quick here. Just to talk about what's going on over there which is not much i'm just gonna scroll through the shop real quick basically just got some hockey skins here got the nike stuff coming in we got some uh, some halloween stuff just for the seasonal event you know it is easter by the way so got the brand new midas bundle that just came out yesterday then we've got just a lot of new stuff hush just came out yesterday as well then there's even more if i keep on going because they like to bury stuff at the very 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 bottom of the shop is it not up here or did i already pass it because it was the original it was midas and then the Nike stuff was at the top of the shop this time because, you know, it was at the bottom yesterday. Why? Why have anything be consistent? But as I always like to say, thank you to everybody who has been supporting me in various ways. Honestly, this is more than creator codes now, which is really, really amazing. I appreciate you guys so much. It really goes a long way. People using code Mista in the item shop. You ever want to support me using code Mista? Uh, give Using code Mista when you spend V-Bucks gives me 5% of your purchase in real life dollars. A little hard on that. A little Ben's War cry from the stream. I am live, by the way. Link down below. I'll be live for another four, another three hours. I'm live on YouTube and Twitch. Link down below. So come say hi. But uh, yeah, Hero using my code. Big fan of the stream. And as well, Dragon getting level 20 and 30 in Marvel Strike Force. That's the current sponsor of the channel. I think it's available for like one more day to use my link. If you hit these different levels, uh, it'll show it in a second. That supports me directly financially. It's a great way to support the channel for $0 on your end. And it's it's a fun game to play alongside save the world so if you're queuing a mission like evacuate the shelter for example and that's a 10 minute startup you can run marvel strike force on the side it's kind of a fun way to fill the gaps i think people are like oh yeah there's a moats going on in the background right now let me go back to my main menu here and then pull discord back up thank you again uh, i'm gonna scroll a little quickly here but i appreciate everybody uh using my using my code i thank you all it supports me a lot all right let's go back to save the world talk about the missions going on right now mm-hmm mm -hmm. bro is playing marvel and watching the stream on his phone dang yeah it's a good thing to do wait oh yeah he did have my stream open at the same time didn't he i uh was that what i was yeah look at this guy i did not even notice that i read i just read twitch chat right now the man was watching my stream slash video while doing marvel strife what a great combo what a great combo all right <laughs> missions for real this time starting off in the low levels adventures uh thank you boyd for joining so i can show these could be starting off with a 34 4 player 4x green perk up in the retrieve the data i'm still learning how to say that quickly 1,253 episodes, and I still can't say retrieve the data quickly. Uh, 4X perk up in the 46-4 player. I think I used to be able to, and then I lost it. I don't know. Uh, we got a couple of things here. Clax, amazing melee. I was just running it today. If you guys want a free loadout, by the way, here we go. Assassin Sarah with Corrupted Aura, kind of fun. And then the Clax I was using uh, was this nature one here. Attack speed and crit damage. Actually, was that correct loadout? Because I had Dennis Jr. in support. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Dennis Jr. You get to use him once in a blue moon. But Clax is very strong. I was using that today. Awesome weapon. Llama token number one out of three is available in the 58 zone. And then the 58-4 player has a 4x perk up as well. Then we got the 70 zone. Uh, 
up here, 4X uh, purple perk up in the 70 zone, which is great. Then we got the 82 zones with the Llama token number two out of three available in the Cat 3. Then we've got the 94 four players where we got uh, 94 four player right here. 4X reperk and then deliver the bomb. And then there's one more Llama token if I can find it. You know, they always like to hide from me. I have it in my notes. There we go. Final Llama token available today in the 94 zone. So if you're in that range of Avengers missions, you're uh, having a lot of free llamas today. 4X perk up in the 108 four player. I said it before, but if you're patient with your llama like upgrade tokens there could be a mythic lead someday so you know saves you 50 x-ray tickets something you can save for the uh, military llamas or sci-fi or whatever 4x reperk in the 124 four player i think i showed the 108 four player yeah 4x perk up and then the uh 4x lighting the bottle plus 369 reperk nice in the 140 four player achieve the data how are we already at eight minutes guys there's so much going on and save the world today it's a lot of news a lot of news 4x reperk in the 88 four player in twine then we got the razor blade in the 94 zone amazing ar it's a burst weapon but you just hold it down use it like a full auto great weapon then we got the 4 X I the Storm, the 108 4 player. And then we got the 116 zone with, where is he? Bulletstorm Jonesy. He is an excellent hero. He stacks up damage with every bullet you fire. Pairs really well with Crackshot. Great support hero. Uh, not necessarily in the lead, but great great support. 4X Reperk in the 124 4 player. And then we got 4X I the Storm and 4X Reperk in the 132 4 players. Then we got <laughs> Fleet. Uh, if you're in the end game, you're probably not running Fleet anymore. Your loadouts are probably a lot more refined, but a 12.5% movement speed bonus is nice to have. So, He's there if you want him, and he's there if you want him. Uh, 140s are not so great. 160s are a little lackluster. You know, 5X Eye of the Storm in the Cat 4 is decent. Smoke screen means you're going to be running melees or abilities. But then we got 5X Reperk in the Pair of the Shelter. Same deal with smoke screen. And then we got three pretty poor rewards. And I have not personally finished Ventures yet, so I might be running that on stream today because there's not much going on in the 160s. Um, yeah, Candy Valley, 4X Drop Serene, and 200 Green Perk Up. That's pretty much it. So, uh, yeah. Yeah. People in my chat are reminding me, Fleet is good in dungeons, and that's just true. So if you want to run 12.5% faster in dungeons, use Fleet. If you are specifically running the lab, and only the lab, then it's considered a permanent night zone where Dire is actually better. Dire, if you guys picked him up from the winter event, makes you run 25% faster at night. So in Frost Night and the lab dungeon, you can run 25% quicker. But the other dungeons, for whatever reason, are clearly nighttime, but the game doesn't think they're nighttime. So... I don't want. Anyway, there you go. Quick little info. Going back to my stream now. Come say hi. Check out Marvel Strike Force. Link down below. And uh, check out Factor. That's still going on, by the way. If you guys want to get 50% off your first order, get some yummy meals delivered to your house. Two minutes in the microwave to heat up. Check it out. I wanted to keep that under 10 minutes. I think I did it. Okay, so let me do a million things at once right now. Let me get this uploading, switch that screen, go over here, open up my weekly tab, seven d d days left in season 19. <sighs> Recycling weapons is great. Recycle bad weapons, I guess. Weapon supercharger is usually all caps, but I'm chilling out now. Weapon supercharger, Highland Warrior Wildcat, I guess. I know. You know it's a slow day when I actually mention one of the bad heroes available. And then I want to go over here, over here. Uh huh. Little deer crossing. Whatever. Okay, I said safe cracking guide. I would link, but I don't remember what else I might have said. Is my factor here? Actually, I got a link for it right here. We are. Man, so many ads. I am a sponsored streamer. Look at me being so sponsored. Okay. What am I forgetting? Bro, I was talking two times faster in the video. Yep, yep, yep. Why is including recycle bad weapons? Well, uh, recycling weapons is giving you more loot than it used to right now. So, definitely be doing, taking advantage of that. Uh, Highland, I don't know. I'm forgetting something and I know it. I said I would link, I might as well link the Ventures Awards because that was kind of brought up. I'm going to do the whole command in there. And then Island Warrior 
Safe cracking, free loadout. I said I'd link something. I don't know. Um, no V Bug missions today. Yeah, no. What's the best gun to flux? Flavian, uh, there's kind of, um, or Flavian, I'm not sure which one. There are kind of a lot of really amazing weapons to flux. I made a whole video breaking it down. Some of the best weapons in the game are fluxable and. Uh, this is daily. We don't want that one. I accidentally opened that one. We want weekly. There we go. Might be the last. Oh, this is the last weekly. Uh, Spectre Blade and Storm Blade are both good weapons. Yeah. God, I am so hungry, you guys. I am just getting through it. Getting through it. Wow, no purple survivor. No, man, weapon supercharger is just it. At least we got three upgrade llama tokens, but who cares? You know it's a slow day when I put Highland Warrior in the... God. It's funny, Bulletstorm Jonesy is available in the regular missions, and he's more interesting than she is. How hungry! <laughs> a picture of a horse. Is that saying I'm so hungry I could eat a horse? Wow, that is quite the face she's making. Yeah, that's that's what happens when I click the wrong button. Alright. Dude, I didn't even mention the weekly stuff, did I? Whoops. Nah, that's fine. We need to make the stun run out. Gimp! I just say the same thing every week. I, I would hope that's not going to mess with anybody too much. Because I know I always can forget to grab the flux, but... What can fill this extra space? Razor blade? Sure. I know it. I'm just waiting for it. This video is going to go live and then I'm going to remember something obvious and I don't... I can't think of it. Like, there's nothing new in BR. I think we're good. That's called the razor. Mm, no, it's the razor blade. I put it in my notes as razor, but I know what I mean. Thanks for hanging out, Poply. I'll see you next year. I hope you are well and healthy and happy. Uh, there's a deer walking outside my house right now. Right here. Anybody want some deer butt? That's very cool. Eat it? What? No! No, we do not eat the deer. No. We look at the deer and go, wow, look at that. Oh. Oh, it saw me. It doesn't care. Ugh, am I not threatening enough to scare you? Hmm. This is bullshit. That deer doesn't even care. It's not even threatened by me. I'm not gonna tap the window. I don't want to be threatening. Wait, no! That's what it wants.
Oh, I was going to link the one week left. Okay. One week left. Reminder. I'm so glad I remembered that. Like I said, I'd link it down in, down in the description immediately, and then I just forgot. Careful, they bite. I've never been bit by a deer. I think they are 100% more likely to run off than to bite. Trying to not cut myself off with an end. And then I mentioned Marvel Strike Force, so... It's kind of cool! You guys know a real thing that's happened? Enough of you have interacted with the Marvel Strike Force, you know, uh, sponsor, that I have actually put less ads in my daily videos. Like, enough people have been engaging with that, where I'm like, shit, I'll just... not put that second ad I usually put. I don't know if anybody noticed less ads, Would but that's why. Look at that. It is a known I am 24. That recycling traps does not give you the full resources that they should. Uh, but what's also going on that I did not know about in yesterday's daily video is that recycling... You are going to... Oh, 10 Sunbeam is covered by my... By the way, a blue base Kyle... Quick... Both of these are bugs. Oh, I'll take it. I'll take it. Quick PSA to my low-level players, by the way. A blue base Kyle is in Stonewood. That's a really good constructor for making your walls thicker. It's a nice thing to know about. But I'm pretty sure when you start the game, you get a green one for free. Whatever. Uh, weekly supercharger going left to right here is the weapon supercharger. If you don't know how to get a weapon supercharger, it's... Uh, here, let me just get my copy. Real quick here. Just to talk about what's going on over there. Which is not much. I'm just going to scroll through the shop real quick, basically. Just got some hockey skins here. Got the Nike stuff coming in. We got... This yeah, yeah, yeah. Dan's still learning how to say it. Great combo. What a great combo. All right. <laughs> Missions for real this time. Starting off in the low levels adventures. Uh, thank you, Void, for joining so I can show these. Could be starting off with a 34 4 player. 4x green per. Okay. All right. I think I got it all. What version of Gim? I don't know. You hate the silence in this stream? What? What silence? Any daily V-Bug mission? No. No. Boss 9000 is really good early game. I... Maybe. Oh, the deer's walking back again. It's really expensive early game. Like, Pulse 9000 is going to cost you a lot of energy cells that a new player might not have. Yeah, I'll be doing Avengers today. The 160s did not impress me, and I'll just do them next stream. Dude, she is right outside my window. That's pretty cool. Uh... Okay. All right. Give us some advanced CG, yeah, right? Wish I was in the Discord to ask for help. Uh, why are you not in the Discord? Purple? Sure. Thanks for the Trap Cycle bug video to know us and appreciate the heads up. Yeah, I'm glad to spread the word, because, you know, I don't want people recycling for hundreds of materials less. I think the positive point, though, is that getting resources in this game is super easy. Barely an inconvenience. So, it's not life or death. If you If you lose a few hundred crafting resources you'll you'll be fine uh we got room for one adventures if you want to hop in preferably high level players but i guess all right got zach in here oh you're banned from the yeah that happens sometimes yeah alex man cool here's the thing i am simultaneously a workaholic and on break right now so i've put together this much of an updated video it is not nothing isn't it so annoying? Like, I have the description layout typed out. I have this video as scripted as they get. But I just haven't recorded it yet. My new Every Items video is gonna blow the socks off my old one. Like, I'll fucking unlist the old video when I launch the new one, because I'm just... 
that far ahead of myself. God damn it. I need to eat, but I want to still check for flamingos. All right. So I'm going to double check the flamingos and then, and then go heat up some, I don't know, chili. Video on how to get sunbeam crystal. Barely got into my beat. Yeah. So I, as I was just saying... <laughs> I need to update my old video, but my old video is still like 90% accurate. I watched through the whole thing in preparation for the new one, and it will get you the information you need. Uh, best way to get Sunbeam? Honestly. <laughs> oh, yeah. your, your questions like that just encourage me to... Literally, this section right here, you guys, this section will get you 99% of items in this game. Do mini games, anomalies, encampments, storm chests, target practice. These will all give you sunbeam if they have the little sunbeam like, like the quartz crystal on them. Recycling weapons gives you so much shit, you guys. It's so worth it. Look at this. One second. One second. This is how many items recycling gives you. It doesn't give you builds, resin, or power cells, but it gives you literally every other crafting resource in the entire game. Right now, recycling traps doesn't give you as much as they should, so don't do that. But right now, recycling weapons gives you more. So if you want Sunbeam, Gino, go kill glowing animals. Go do storm chests, go do target practices, recycle those items, it will be- What the fuck, my first kill got me Blake Bridge. okay. It's so worth it. Recycling does give you wood, brick, and metal. Uh, where? No, 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 recycling items, recycling items. See, look, look, look what I just did. You kill a chicken, you get a, you get a sunbeam weapon, Look how easy this was! Four sunbeam! I shot a chicken! I shot a chicken! Four sunbeam, just like that. I think that was the right weapon. It might have been this one. I mean, still, it would have been four sunbeam. Like, that's so many resources for no effort. Almost halfway, nicely done. All right, so I'm just speeding through. Has anyone ever been this desperate? Uh, no, it's kind of annoying, actually. It actually worries me, because when someone makes this big of a deal about getting on my list, it concerns me that they might not be a good person to have on my list. So, something to consider. I'm gonna do the, uh, the storm chest if anybody on the team wants to play with me here. Also, this right here, the copper encampments will give you um, bright core in the end game. In the 94 plus zones. If you can kill everything, oh my gosh. What am I waiting on? There we go. So look, Brycor and Obsidian, just for killing some easy enemies. Join live when you're live, and I, I understand that, but I, I can't speed up how fast channel points get generated on my channel. I can only go live and Making the live stream experience good for me and everybody watching is an excellent way to encourage me to stream more. And mentioning adding me in every fifth message is perhaps not a successful strategy for that. I want to buy something to shop with your code. What should I get? Whatever you enjoy. Whatever looks good to you. I actually discourage spending V-Bucks just because you have them. So, you know, find something you like. If you don't see anything you like, wait. There's no time limit on V-Bucks, you can wait to spend them. Look at this, gold item. Boom. Easy sniper. What was that, a one-shot? 
Right here, 121. All I did was shoot a chicken. Eight sunbeam and 24 efficient. Ten quartz. That's so fucking much. That's so much for shooting one chicken. That is damn near a full weapon. By the way, that's the quickest way to check chests if they're a mimic or not. Just smack it. You're never gonna one-shot a three-star chest, so just smack it. 10 oxy and 252 energy cells. You guys, this is why I honestly... This is why I honestly... recommend, like... learning all the best ways to farm, because just smacking animals and... mimics is just so effective. Nope. I'm at six flamingos. I'm starving, but I got six flamingos. I think it's counting when my teammates get them. I appreciate your help. Never knew Recycle could give that much. Well, right now they are giving more than they did before, and traps are giving less. I don't know why, but take it while you get it. Yeah, if anybody's looking to run 82 power level to deliver the bomb, we got somebody, uh, Cal, on the YouTube chat looking for gamers. Sean, if you're looking to spend your voucher, I'm going to link my video. Uh, you said hero. All right, I'll link my hero video because it's a big topic. There are many heroes that can be vouchered, and this video breaks down all your options. All right. I think that's as good as I'm going to do for flamingos. By the way, if anybody ever wants duct tape, ducks. Ducks. <laughs> yes, it's a pun. Hi, streamer. Hello, viewer. Look at this fucking guy. Running away. Greet everybody in chat. Hi, Broken. Hi, Scotland. Alright, I greeted everybody in chat. You know, when somebody redeems, greet everybody in chat, and then they don't all start saying hi, it's- it's so disappointing every time. Every time. Oh, now they say it. Yeah, hi, Audi. All the afterthoughts coming through here. Parks with Xenombo, this weapon? Yeah. Right here, here we go. Now, if you perhaps want some better perks, I'll link them in the chat. There you go. Hi Zahaka, hi Nitro, hi Bob, bro, 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 bro Bob, bro. <clears throat> hi 99, Akula, hello, Corp, hello, Av, 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 hello, Crypto, hello, there you go, if I can't pronounce the name, I'll just, I'll try twice, well, I got some flamingos, six, out of ten, I'm hungry, I'm gonna join my voice channel, finally, I'm gonna regret that, you really just been sitting in here? Yes. Jesus. What happened to your mic? Um, I'm away. I... I'm not at home. Yeah, Jesus. Why are you doing this to us? Sorry. It's always disappointing. It's like, wow, I got so many comments on my video, and then all of them are just oiled up ass cheeks, which I guess I can't complain, but... They're all trying to steal money <laughs> from my viewers, so... Yo, mama, no. hello. Alright, Oh my god damn it. I... Okay. Shay, hello! First time chatter! I had 5,000 spend, we'll spend it all this stream. Uh, honestly, your best value if you got 5,000 channel points might be stream loots, but... Yeah, burning emotes or burning works too. I'm already I'm already doing party hips, and he's just no fuck it. I'm giving all those points back. No hydration, no party hips. Free Ben's War Cry. I'm keeping the chatter one though. Okay. Uh, hello. Oh, there's a mic was... that works. Oh, there you go. Mic that works. Oh, speaking of mic that works, I think my solution to the weird audio thing where it just the where it just goes in and out actually working i just turned my noise suppression down by one percent welcome my Sarah. and that that fixed it huh i i don't know i haven't flaxes I think, 
I think it did. I, I don't know. You you might be able to hear like a very incredibly faint sound sound fan sound in the background, but probably not. All right, I need to go eat. I'll be back in a second, Chad. I'm hungry. Put up. Put up with my mic, chat. I was messing around with stuff I probably shouldn't have earlier. Yeah? How so? Uh, like, enabling things and save the world. On a private server, if Epic is watching, it was a private, private server, not live board. game. <laughs> it, was, it was a private server client. <sighs> I should try to figure out what the hell these tiers do, because there's 12 tiers in the in Survive the Horde and the difficulty selector menu that's going to pop up whenever you start Survive the Horde. Uh, mm -hmm. There's 12 tier options. Oh. And Zylik and I can't exactly <laughs> figure out what the tiers do. We think, right. the tiers, we think the tiers just increase the power level of the husk that they start out at. <laughs> Well, it'll at least have a little bit more difficulty, so that'll be nice. The tier selector, that's funny, that's what it's called. Say the road word. And there's quests too, so I'm like, like if I go to the quest, I get a horde v3, which is survive the horde. There's, uh, quest to complete uh different tiers of horde uh, every week so there's uh mm. horde tiers week two challenge and he horde tiers 12 challenge so like after after week six so week six is called horde week tier the horde tiers week six challenge and in week seven right. it's just called horde tiers hmm. and then Interesting. Week and then you know there's week nine which is the space rocks, week ten which is storm surge, week eleven which is windswept, and week twelve which is smog of war. We know what um, a few of them do. So week nine is just space rocks like endurance. Yeah, it's games. like endurance. So that's pretty simple. Uh, and storm surge, we, we haven't figured out exactly what it is, but it looks like it's going to be like you you can get struck by lightning. Hey, you get, like you get like movement speed. It's weird. We're still trying to figure that one out. Windswept, which is week eleven, is a complete mystery. We have absolutely no idea what what week eleven is. There is nothing in the po there's nothing in the files programming or anything. We have no idea what what windswept is. I was uh, gonna say, I have a I I have guesses, but they're all literally just like here's what it sounds like based on a name, like. And then week twelve, which is smog of war, it's just fog. It's just the say, entire. It's, super foggy. it's just the the rolling fog modifier from uh, from uh, whatever uh, you know. Yeah, I know what you mean. I'm trying to remember where these things are stored at. Because, like, week Chat. 9 is the only one with a description. Because if I go into week 9s, it says, uh, defend your base and keep your eyes, uh, keep your eyes in the skies for falling debris. Mm -hmm. That sounds about right. Will they ever start updating Save the World or no? Well, we what just technically we just technically we just got, got a few. Well, we got an update, but we won't see it for a while because uh, yeah. the updates are for uh, week nine, eleven, and ten of Horde of Survive the Horde, so we won't see those for a while. But I mean, we we that. will see Survive the Horde's a new difficulty option whenever that. Uh, whenever Which is comes does, does, yeah. next week. Hopefully, it comes next week. Yeah, it, it does come um, next week. Sweet. Looking I could pull the that. API right. I could pull the API right now and see what it says. It'll be great. It'll be right as my new quarter starts for school, so I'll have to do that. Oh come on! Oh, 
I wish we could see what power level they start at, but that's all server side, so we can't see if they they made it 144 player or something. Yeah, I mean, hopefully it's harder than it, it goes. It can be harder than last time. Oh, it definitely like, will. Uh, if sweet. You can... That's that's what I want to hear. It might. I I I part of me thinks tier uh, 12 might start them at like 160 power level. So they start at like 250. We, we, we're, mm. we don't know yet. Yeah, team, we're getting beat up on the on the east side. Keep an eye on that. I can manage the other side. Because uh, like there's horde. This is so weird because there's like there's challenges to get to do to do the different tiers of board, but mm -hmm. they're like so the basic one is just called horde tiers, and then there's weekly for horde tiers two through six, Five, and then seven, but... seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, and twelve are just not weekly. Horde tiers. Hmm. I wonder if that those quests will require you to do a certain level or if any, it's like to this level or higher because if we have to do certain tiers especially ones that are easier per se just so we can get rewards i think that's gonna annoy some people i don't know i mean i, I think those. i think i think the main part about it is is they're just trying to make a horde more enticing to play yeah. and if like it's just something that's still fresh enough to me. Like, I only played it a couple times last season, so it was like... I, to me, I was looking forward to it already, and they had to go... And they went ahead and made it better. And so it's like, great. Wow. The... <laughs> the, the, the Week 9 programming is so simple. It just calls for space rocks. That's about yeah. it. I was going to say, that's a pretty easy one to pull from. They should do the Frost Knight Tree more to give us heroes and weapons. I think that'd be cool, but right now, this is what we're doing. And maybe maybe down the line, that'll be a plan. I'm just looking at more stuff. It's weird. It's it's weird because they put Save the World stuff in different folders. So they have... Uh... Actually, wait a minute. I didn't notice this file got updated. Oh what, what shit! Uh, what? Any anyone in okay, never mind. Uh, anyone in Beast's game on the on the end screen? Can you do the the burning crown emote, the victory crown emote? Uh, let me see if I hop it. Because I I'm looking at the I'm looking at the root thing where it tells what plugins for say the word to call, and they added uh, victory crowns to it. Victory crowns. It's called burning crown or whatever. Anyone on beach in beast lobby can use it. I'm trying. Everyone, everyone has it. If you have at least one win in VR. Oh, currently no. Well, no. You, if you have any wins since chapter three started. Okay. I sh weird. I I don't have it. Kieran. But I've definitely won games since then. Kieran, have you got any crown victory royales? This season at all. Okay, well that no, doesn't I, help. <laughs> I, I don't I don't have. Uh you can't do the dead space emote because it won't let you crouch. I'm so close to being finished with this frickin' mode. Fucking what? <laughs> hey chat, here's a fun reminder. Do your side quests. For example, I just got Swordmaster Ken from once. You can get Mythic Heroes. That's fun. And hey, that's my last one. Well, that's very cool. I'll take those wings. 
It works, Ice. Did you did you try it? Yeah, because I'm I'm looking at um I'm looking at Save the Worlds. So Save the World has a as a core plugin thing where it where uh it it tells the game what it needs to function, and at the mm. very bottom they added the Victory Crowns reader. So that means right. the Victory Crowns should work. Hmm. Interesting. Strong God sounds so educated. <laughs> And entertain. I've been very informed. I'm I'm really tired, I'll tell you. I will be home early this week though. I'll be Hydro. back on Friday, so okay. Hydro, is that an iron? Pretty nice it does work. I, I don't I don't know anyone who has any victory Roy, victory crown wins to test this, so no. Well look no further, I'm the best there was. Iron, I was thinking about you yesterday. I was gonna... What the hell was I gonna do? <laughs> there was like something right. sarcastic. I thought, oh, this would be funny to send Iron. And then I was like, oh shit, I haven't spoken to him regularly in like four years. Yeah. Damn. And then it felt weird to do that, oh. so I didn't. Oh, that reminds me, my tire needs new treads. Oh, okay, that's related to me talking to an old friend. Let's talk about that. <laughs> Oh, oh wait, no, it's not. All right, oh, we got room for one. We lost someone. Is Kieran just? Kieran. Yeah, is he just giving up on his internet, or is he just going to bed? I think Kieran's finally going to bed. Oh, I was watching a CS:GO video. <laughs> I was thinking of, I was thinking of pinging Iron and being like, "Oh, there's there's three at Banana heading to B or something." I thought that'd be really funny to just ping him out of fucking nowhere. Giving him a CSGO call out. Like we were in game. <laughs> Iron, you were great. I never had any grievances. Your interesting personality was a virtue. We got room for one if anybody wants to play. High level preferably. My is fine, she's going to bed. Well, I appreciate you playing, Kieran, helping out. Good night, Kieran. It's a good rest. I love how... I love how I'll say the world's programming. It just says, "Is hot fixable?" False. Oh god! <laughs> it's just like known that they might need to do that. So I'm very different now. Ping me anytime. Well, you already heard it. Now that was my thing. Figured I'd just ping him out of the blue and be like, "There's three heading to B." <laughs> There's a guy along. <laughs> oh shit! Nobody's joining. Are my ventures players just gone now? We're all just uh, we're done. You're in the game. So You're in get, the I'm, no, I'm looking I'm more at the programming. Week 10 might be crazy. <laughs> I'm still bored. Alright, KJ, I see like, you. It looks like lightning strikes and movement speed bonuses. I'm still trying to figure out exactly what it does. But it, it looks crazy. Join the call, Iron. Get in here. I still have to call you Iron because I, I just can't. You can't call somebody one thing for how many years? Iron blocks. One, two, three. You know what, Beast? Here you go. Here I go. I am 130. Oh, you're joining to join Adventures. Oh, I see you. I got you. I got you. The dots as well. Oh, there's zero results. I assume the colons are not in the name then. That's my next guess. I see I 46, but in chat, you're I 56. What do I, what do I, what can I believe? I don't know what I can believe. Anybody join the Gentleman's Club? Yeah. If you are over 18, I need to say that nowadays, apparently. Oh, uh, did you guys know I have my Nerva merch? Yeah. Check out this sweet shirt. Yeah, I wear this in public. <laughs> People keep asking me that for some reason. Um, yeah. This whole thing, if you just react to different stuff, you can get, you know... It's it's an eggplant, because, you know, penis. It's an 18 plus channel, so... It's a lot more relaxed. Get, 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 get. That's the only reason. That channel is the lone reason we don't have, like, a partnered Discord server. I refuse to give mm -hmm. up that channel. That's it.
I just have this like adult stubbornness where like I, I, I don't want to be told what I can have in my own server, you know, like I just I spent all that time being a kid, which sucked. Don't recommend it. Zero out of ten. And then... Now I'm old enough for this stuff, I can't even have it in my own community. Fuck that. At least I can mark at 18 plus, so now we can weed out all the kids. See, they have they have to click a box. That's impossible to fake, so it's safe. Yeah. Safe for them. Actually, I don't know. I don't, I don't really think it's... It's- it ties it to your Discord profile. Oh, does it? I yeah, I really so. don't encourage miners in there. That's not where they should be, so... The extreme security that you need to have to, like, enforce age restrictions is wild. Like, they tried to ban Pornhub in, like, North Carolina, and, Cor and Pornhub... They tried to make it, like, verification only, but the amount of information they needed to comply with the law was enough for them to just shut down Pornhub and that state. Was it north or south? I don't even know. You'll forever have my respect for that beat. Thank you, Valaz. Man, only two dog houses in the south. Good luck. It's banned in Texas now? Hey! What the fuck? Been up for a few years, my B. Fifty dollar donation? Well, what you must be hell? doing well for yourself. Iron, I need a life update if you're just gonna be throwing 50 bucks around. I imagine he's a full-time pug for somebody. Thank you so much! And I'm always confused because I never saw the harm. I found porn when I was a young kid, and I don't think it did anything bad to me. You're a water network manager at a water company. Wow. Please tell me that's more interesting than it sounds. <laughs> Thank you, by the way. You didn't have to do that. 12th right core back from recycling two weapons, GPs. I'm in charge of water supply to a large portion of England. That's a huge deal. That's like a big boy job. Like actual responsibility. That's fucking sweet. Yeah, it is a little bit. Oh, hey mate, how you doing? How is your mom doing, by the way? She's all right. She's all right. Has she heard me in a while? Does she tune in? Oh, all the time, man. <laughs> Judging by his Twitch, it's his dream job. <laughs> <laughs> is it Iron? Were you just born to work with water? I, it is annoying how many people think I make myself hydro after my job. I know the name I came first. Yeah. I did. His aspirations for the career were first. I, I knew what I was destined to do. <laughs> I know, gotta get in there early. Well, I know you've talked about it before. Like, you've drank water your whole life. I know, right? Just, and you thought, you just need I to manage pretty, it. I think I'm pretty qualified. Because, you know, I am a nurse. Can see. It did to me. It ruined most of my childhood and kind of messed up my faith in my religion. Oh, shit. What, drinking water? No! <laughs> <laughs> no! He's talking about uh, porn. Uh, <laughs> I mean, it's weird. I've heard the first one too. Though. My bad, <laughs> What a what a twist! It messed up most of my childhood and my faith in my religion. What water? That, I'm sorry, <laughs> that was perfect. That was... It was fucking good. It was on topic, too. Like, that's not a bad guess, but... No. I mean, yeah, porn is pretty destructive, but, you know, it's like... In moderation. In small doses. In small... I know some people get porn addictions, but that's not everybody. I don't know. Yeah. 
Yeah, I got over that like a few years ago, it's fine. I just think banning it in an entire state is so fucked up, because then you become an adult and it's like, wait, still? No? What the fuck? Never heard of a VPN? Or... I mean... Can't you, just, can't you just get around it? Porn is not alright in any way of consumption. Well, neither is alcohol. Here we are. Fucking yeah. Dude, alcohol's pretty lit, I'll be honest. Yeah, the lady was telling me about, like, studies where they, they try to find, like, what amount of alcohol is perfectly safe to consume, and it's fucking zero. <laughs> There's literally yeah. no amount of alcohol that will do nothing to you. I mean, it, it is literally poison. It's literally poison. That sounds about right. It's, yeah. But it tastes so good. I don't... Okay, I don't I'm think anybody drinks about the flavor. I do. I like the bitterness. No, I'm joking. It's alright. What's the best shotgun in Save the World? Sorry. Oh boy. I'll just yes. link my top 10 list, and there are a lot of great answers. It's all these things that give you temporary happiness that can also cause permanent damage. Okay. Well, moderation's key for everything. Water makes me happy. I don't, I don't, I don't, I, what that won't cause damage is fine. Water makes you happy? Yeah. Yeah. That'll keep you feeling good. It's just good. By the way, I'm it's seeing good, freaking man. Falcons and Hydro here both have Prime badges. You guys have used your Prime subs this month, right? I've used it already, man. I'm sorry. Nope, that's good. You should always use it on yeah. someone. That's all I'm looking for. Are you English? 50 bones. <laughs> He's British. I am English. I am unfortunately are, English. Are you English or Canadian? <laughs> unfortunately English, man. Uh... I just heard you say sorry, and I was like, oh. Sorry, sorry. To be fair, I've been saying sorry like that a lot more recently, but I'm not Canadian whatsoever. No. Uh, no, I have one. Wait, how's Jaffy doing? Speaking of Canadian. <laughs> I think I had a dream about Jaffy. Ah, oh, dude, I miss Jaffy. Like, now that you mention it. Well, I met Jaffy. We were in the same room together. It happened. That's so cute. He drove down and like stayed here for a week. That's adorable. Is he as cute as he sounds? Cricket, cricket, cricket. Mm -hmm. I'm not liking it, this response. Is Jaffy as cute as he sounds? Mm -hmm. Let's mm -hmm. get Jaffy in the car real oh, quick. Oh, yep. I, he was here. <laughs> I already know what he looks like. Wait, what am I on about? I'm eating food. That's one. <laughs> My brother found out that I was watching for him, and I'm gonna slip my shit. Yeah, I don't see the... Yeah, XTX has said some weird stuff in the stream, so I can't tell who's being serious, but... Uh... I don't... I don't know. Not just weird stuff in the stream. Porn was never... So bad. Mm. Now, religion was mentioned. And that's its own thing. I don't know if that's porn being bad, or... Religion putting a lot of importance on something that's not that big of a deal. You know. The only reason anybody gives a fuck if anybody's gay is because of religion. Is it not? Mm, yeah. 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 I mean, there's, there's the odd few bad apples that just don't like it. Just things. because, yeah. Alright, you gotta speak up. Use that mic. Put it in front of your mouth. It's one, it's one in the morning, buddy. We'll Shoot wake everybody up. up. <laughs> no. I will not. Stream at a different time. Dude, Epic. Okay. I got you, I'm, I said, I'll add you. So they still track this in here. You can, you can still see your total days logged in. I see that. Where do you see that? I, I'm looking. I'm using. I'm doing API calls to look at my raw profile this data. Fucking guy. It's incredible nerd shit. I thought that was cool. Linked to the days logged in page. That's what they told me. Yeah, that's uh, that's that's. So in your say the world profile data, your public profile data, um, there's you can see matches played, the amount of money you've spent, a little V bucks spent on slotting things, your daily login. Um, the, la the last time you claimed a daily login, mm -hmm. your, your rewards claimed and stuff. June 28th, 2020, or 2023. Too many friends on my last time. Okay. Last claim date, uh, 
June nineteenth. Uh, June nineteenth, twenty twenty three was the last claim date. Oh, it was it was the freaking founders packs going away on the 29th, I remember. I might be able to uh if I can get if I can get people's account IDs, which is not private data, it's public data. I can uh I can see what <clears throat> this stuff is. You can look mine up, I'll learn. Yeah, your account ID is not private. It's not hidden or anything. It's it, yeah. it's publicly in the top left corner of the game the whole time you're playing. I I also just don't care either way because like I I trust you with that information anyway. Yeah, Phase Rug. Like, if you're power if level one twenty two, lots of people play with you. <clears throat> the only problem hey. I got is I'm dating one of them porn is cheating chicks. Oh. Oh. That's fucking stupid. Hmm. If porn can, is cheating, uh, then watching a movie with a hot girl in it is cheating. That's the other. Yeah. What's their favorite movie? Brokeback Mountain. <laughs> Absolute banger, dude. Uh, I was gonna say the Notebook, but sure. Uh, the Notebook. I never seen it. I have an idea, but I know a little bit about it. Ooh, hey. I Oppenheimer. Oh. Yeah, How but it's it? a girlfriend at the end of the day. Ah. Uh, so I am cool. so sorry. See, I feel like I I get a, a dose of sanity because I, I found a female who's level-headed and rational, and I like that about her a lot. Only power level 83. Oh, phase rug, you shouldn't bother anybody about MSK until you're 122. You don't need more like, Storm King it, weapons right now. You can wait. Earn yeah. it, man. Don't don't have somebody play the game for you. Beating the Mythic Storm King is one of the biggest accom Beating the Beating the Mythic Storm King is one of the biggest accomplishments in the game. Sorry. You bunching on that, buddy. My mom made chili. And I buttered two pieces of toast to go with it. Dude, that's fucking... that's rad. Look at this burning clack. So, did you go to college for the job you're in? Nope. No? I, no, I just worked, just started from the bottom and worked my way up. Started from the bottom, yeah. now you're here. Yeah. That's pretty cool. I like stuff like that. Because I feel like a lot of jobs are merit and experience based and college doesn't necessarily nah, yeah come a in. lot of people in my job are there for like 10 plus years if you work the way up. yeah you can't do this with a degree you don't you need to do the job first are they paying you well oh yeah that's good to hear are you saving then oh yeah are you investing in your future trying to do you have a financial advisor uh, no. You have, have a... My dad. You have a what? I have my dad. You have a dad, okay. Because <laughs> it's usually good to invest Same. your money somewhere. I don't know what the options are outside of America, but... We have yeah. different money market accounts that are available and... I have a... Social security, 401k savings. bullshit. I mean, we have, like, investment options. The bank can offer you and stuff. It's good to be putting your money somewhere where it can work for you. Yeah, it's just just yeah. gathering interest rate. Thirty percent of my work paycheck goes to a savings and investment account. So usually mutual funds are pretty safe. But these are good mm. things to work out. Because if you can invest in these one of these long term plans when you're young, you'll be a millionaire by forty probably. I think I I I caught on to that a bit too late. What? Mm. Well I mean I only started saving two years ago. You don't you know, you should have been saving Way long, like long, long ago. Good. Yeah. Started saving about two years ago as well, three years ago. Mm, me too. Twenty three, bro. Mm -hmm. I'm still in. I'm still in. I'm still in college. Because my dad did a lot of investing in his thirties, and he showed me where the accounts are at and where they could have been if he did it in his twenties, and I was like, wow. Um. Yeah. Want to start that as soon as possible. Usually. 
Uh, you should talk to a financial advisor, everybody, before doing anything with your money. But usually 10 to 20% of your income within your comfort level should be investing somewhere. Obviously, pay your bills, take care of your shit, don't be in debt, but it's good to plan for the future. Because if you uh, if you if you live your life right, you should be old someday. That's you know, fingers crossed. Yeah, that's the aim. That is the aim to be old. Mhm. Mm mm -hmm. You got the DoorDash flowers ad while they were talking about girlfriends. Oh my god. Joshua, welcome. You got gifted a sub today. Deep? Um, not deep. Just basic financial tips. <laughs> Things they don't fucking teach you in school for some reason. Yeah. It is insane how many people my age don't know anything about investing and are doing nothing with their money. It's like, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. Uh, I'm gonna queue a 144 player, so... If somebody wants to run Constructor, if you got BaseMD in support, that'd be sweet. I can toss that on. Oh yeah, we're PC players, KJ. Are we all PC players? Oh. Half of us are yeah. PC players, KJ. Why is everybody using open broadsides? I don't know, Ali. I just wish everybody would watch my videos. That's all I can hope for. <laughs> what is Red Baron? I'm not sure what that is. <sighs> How do you get a windscreen? I think it's PC and later consoles. Is this your first stream? Yeah, it is. 12? Okay. Wow. 1.2. Yeah, you get a lot of uh, channel points. Really quickly, if you gift a subscription or cheer, even like, if you guys cheer one bit, it's like 300 channel points a month. It's kind of nice. What age should I start investing? Literally as soon as possible. Because it compounds yes. over, like every seven years it doubles is usually the rule of thumb. So if you're doing like $5,000 a year, um, it'll take seven years before that turns into 10000 but then that'll be 20 and then 40 and then 80 and then... 160 and then 320 and then 640 and then you're a millionaire Takes like 56 years for a lot of that to happen, but that's why you start early Hey, your base. Can you hydrate please? Uh, yeah, yeah, of course. Should I use water or no? I'm not advancing. Gee, that's got caffeine. It's late Tequila, please mm -hmm. man. Come on. I Don't know what I'm gonna be streaming again electric giant or electrical giant I need to finish ventures and I am not on pace to do that today. So there might be a Friday stream. There might be a oh. Sunday stream. I don't know, but I'll I'll ping on Discord when I go live. Everybody who oh. does not have the Beast fans role in Discord should have it. I ping it every time I go live. Happy I'm back. Got bored. Welcome. Welcome back. Red Baron Pizza is solid, by the way. I got a stack of those in the freezer. Oh yeah, the French bread they make is also very very good. Mm. Highly recommend. I don't know, they're like, stop the train from Polar Express. Think that we find funny for <laughs> movies, the new generation will not know what they are. Like, stop the train from Polar Express. I watched Polar Express several times, and I don't know what that means. Is that like a reference? Yeah, maybe, when they slide across the ice? Maps, when the kid is, when the kid says no to the ticket, but then changes his mind and he starts screaming, stop the train. I don't know why I remember that. That wasn't that memorable of a moment for me. Speaking of Polar Express. <laughs> oh, I'm sorry about that, I guess. Is 120 enough to start? Yeah, well, uh, if you mean dollars, probably not. Um, I'm referring to people who have income. If you're working a job and you're making, I don't know, two or three thousand dollars a month, a couple hundred of that should probably be going somewhere. I put 30% of my paychecks into savings. So not savings, I mean investing, but savings is good too, having... Well, yeah, it's it's, it's a savings and investment uh, good. account. Good, yeah. So, that's what I mean. Like, do what Storm God did. Talk to... The thing yeah. about a financial advisor is they're kind of free. Like, my guy basically took 5% of my initial investment, and that was his payment. That was it. So, they're not going to take anything extra, it's just going to come out of whatever you're putting in, and... Then, from there, just talk to an investor, they'll give you more educated advice based on your situation and your 
country. Twitch's changes about body part. They did that again. What what's new on that? Did they do it again? <laughs> so they changed it where if someone is like intentionally spending a majority of the stream focusing on a body part for like obvious sexual intent, then they then they, you'll get banned for it. Be the reason why is because some streamers started doing trying to do a new meta where they put green uh green short shorts on and green screen out there the short shorts and put the gameplay on their ass oh my god that's i mean pretty, honestly that's, that's just clever hard. that's pretty hard to be fair. i i couldn't imagine somebody would do that i would need to see such a thing to believe it <laughs> yeah, i want to need proof i'm i'm gonna need evidence for such an outrageous there was, story there was the clip of a of a girl streaming fortnite and the gameplay was just on her ass and it was so stupid. That sounds it was, it uncomfortable. Was, it was funny. How? What position had, like, would make that? She was just standing up at her desk. Like, standing. standing. Okay. Up. You might start a business instead. I mean, if you can, do it. I guess I did that. Hey, Noah, welcome. My tax guy wants to turn me into a business. Or my tax guy <laughs> went in a roll last month. He what? Tax went. The tax man went in raw last month. In raw. Oh, yeah. Did you get hit with them? It was, it was rough. I paid two years of taxes yesterday at the same time. Oh. Or last last year, because I I didn't. Ugh, as a independent, what am I? I'm in independent. What the fuck do they call me? Self-employed. That's what I am. Because I'm independently employed or something. I'm supposed to pay like quarterly. And I taxes and I didn't do that. Okay, and then I <laughs> had to catch up on that in 2023. But then they set me to pay quarterly based on last year's revenue, which was more. I made more in 2022 than 2023, like significantly more for a lot of the year. And then so I was paying way more in taxes than I probably should have been at the time. And I, I just got absolutely boned. I'm glad that I kept savings because that was brutal. It's it's a weird feeling to look at your bank account and then you scroll back in your bank account history and then 12 months prior you had the same amount of money. It's like, oh my god. <sighs> I'm saving nothing. Fuck you. But now, because I already paid so much in taxes, it should be a gentle boning this year. I actually don't know what I... Ooh. A little bit of new. I should go check my email because he sent me something. This is a really dumb thing to check on stream. Let me turn off dis display capture in case I <laughs> somehow yeah. fuck this up. Because he sent me... He just sent me... Fox, Fox, Fox. Right. How much do I owe? Oh! Oh! That's uh -oh. good shit. Not enough. I got... I don't know if I should share the amount. People get weird about that. But I have money coming back. Yeah. Nice. They owe me. Fuck yeah. I see. I knew it'd be a gentle boning. They're taking me out to dinner. Like 40 fucking times. The, the, Jesus Christ. The tax rebate or something? Yeah, well, like I said, I was paying more than I should have last year. Oh. And I kind of knew that. And I just got proof of that. It seems like they owe me money. So this oh, year, okay. the IRS is going to be paying me. That feels so good. Did you want to? Can you just check that my profile picture? Just rate it. All right. If it's a saying? pug with a party hat, then it's ten out of ten. I'm afraid it's not. This looks like a depressed Mr. Krabs with fish swirling. With yes, it is. But it's very water themed, so I approve. I think that's a good one. Thank you, Thank you very much. Got to stay with the theme. I never even thought to check that. You know what? My tax guy is like a real human. So he sent that shit at like 12, 13 a.m. I had just gotten home. This is midnight. And I'm like, what the fuck? That might have been 11 p.m. actually. One of those two. It was late at a really weird time. Not business hours. So I didn't check it until just now. I'm getting money back from the state and federal. Fuck yeah. IRS owes me money. Uh-huh. I, I might have just figured out how to pull my... Frost Knight inventory mid-match. Wow. The fuck? <laughs> you know, while we're talking about taxes, let's get into Frost Knight. 
What the fuck? <laughs> I'm doing crazy stuff. Archer's right now. ADHD just never fails. As soon as you hear his voice, it's like, oh god, what, what are we? Is it Fallout seventy six or is it <laughs> Fortnite back end? Why are you talking about Frost Knight? It's March. I, I just, I'm figuring out things. Oh, oh shit! I figured I, I pulled my ventures inventory. That's cool. The, re the reality is they took too much of your money, so they are thieves. Um. No, no. The reality is I gave them too much of my money, and they're giving me that extra back. And I live in a state where I actually really appreciate how my tax dollars are spent. Like, in Minnesota, we just had a surprise snowstorm. Literally, it was 50, 60 degrees outside. I'm taking walks with a short sleeve shirt, shorts, the sun's out, and then we get like eight inches of snow. And our roads in Minnesota, get plowed and salted so fucking fast. Tax dollars well spent. I appreciate that a lot. Potholes get fixed. Bridges get built. The lights stay on. At least some of my tax dollars go to good stuff. So. Well. Anyway, you guys are having fun with your quotes. I just overpaid in taxes. That's all that happened there. Which is a really good feeling, because, you know, like I said, to go a year without my bank account going up, just higher, like every time I made any amount of money, seriously, this is how it happened. This is literally how it happened. I was like, damn, I'm doing all right. I squirreled away some cash. And then the day would hit where X amount goes to federal, X amount goes to state, and I'm like, ugh. Oh. It's like, two steps forward, two steps back, every fucking time. <laughs> but, I've been smart with my money, don't worry about me. You guys supporting me has gone a really long way. If you guys want to help me pay more in taxes, check out Marvel Strike Force. Because the more I make, the more I have to spend in taxes. So, that's how that works. Okay, I'll be right back. I gotta get rid of this food. Wash my buttery hands from that delicious toast. Chat, should I see if there's anything in my Frost Knight inventory, even though Frost Knight is not around? Cause like, I could afford it. that. It might be, it might be empty. It's probably empty. It'll be funny if it's not, though. Thanks, Kay. Absolutely. The profile of oh, the... there's a stupid ass flinger down here. Theater one. Who's... Right. Fuck, I gotta get a new token. Give me a second. How um how did we manage to play this game for four years straight? Uh I've been playing it for six years. That's fucking ridiculous. Uh I'll tell you, I don't play it all the time. Uh yeah, I've been, yeah, I've been playing I've been playing Save the World for almost seven years. I I'm not, I'm just gonna say this. Oh, I was the one that introduced Save the World to be, so you're welcome. Just uh just a little flex there. Oh yeah, my 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 Frost Knight inventory is in. I love the new headset I got so comfy. Oh, you got a HyperX headset? I don't... I have a HyperX headset. I don't know what it kind of... Uh, I genuinely forgot. 
Dude, Epic, Epic has like individual endpoints for like everything in State of the World. I can see, I, I'm looking at who has build access in my He has my division. Endurances. His mind is being opened. Is Ethan still in chat? <laughs> Ethan, are you here? Ethan? There's, I need somebody to understand the reference of Akura... Oh fuck, what was his name? It was the guy who is... Married to Mercy before she broke it off because she was better at him in a duel. It wasn't Malice, that's the monarch. Such a minor character. Norse Strider just, just egoed him. It was so fucking harsh. This man is dying in a collapsing pocket world and, and, and Norse Strider's there. Could save him and he's just, just doesn't. Just locks out Akura Charity and makes her watch her. She's making his grave before he's even dead. Sorry, spoiler alert. Um, what the hell was his name? I think you're alright. Why am I called Puglet again? I forgot. Uh, cause you were the pug. You were the therapy pug for a long time too. Oh, that's what it was. Well, I haven't talked to her in forever. But that stuck! Why were you pug? You know that. Cause I just really like pugs. Well, I mean, that's just... I think that's, that's just about as good of a reason a, as you need, huh? My skin was a pug? Ethan, are you here? I think he left the stream. God damn it. Yo, what's up? Love the content. Appreciate you here. I hope you get some vowels in your name so I can talk to you, but I am I see you. I mean, what am I supposed to do? A CDB f f full. I... I need... <laughs> Sig, are you here? Sig, you've read Cradle. God, I need everybody to read these books. I love them. <clears throat> Dude, well, Epic keeps... <laughs> what the fuck? Epic keeps a four-month-long archive a log of everything you've recycled. I can see the last thing I've recycled. Oh, was, that's really uh, good. That's that's absolutely for support. That's crazy. I'm that's looking so at, I can good. See the exact perks, the you the unique ID, and the uh, schematic name of the last. And yet they I still give recycled. you the wrong schematic back. What what what? I don't know what. Assault semi-auto R is. I think that might be the siege break. Hey, Robin! Oh, damn. 32 months! That's almost a year! Oh, and Taka, thank you for the Prime sub! I totally missed that! Thank you for the bit, getting the channel points for the year. The month, I mean. Yeah, if anybody wants to kick off the hype train, looks like we got about 30 seconds on the timer. If anybody cheers 100 bits or subscribes, prime subs for free, or makes my right arm stop hurting and stinging in that one location for some random reason, then the hype trade will kick off. Fuck. Dude, my right arm just hurts. Oh, iron, oh, yeah, just getting it going. Getting it going. It didn't even charge me. What the fuck? Oh, does it automatically do it? Oh, shit. What the you might have already had 100 bits. Oh, I think I might have. Actually. If you buy any bits, like, again or ever, use. make sure you got the... The non-mobile link there. Are you on PC? Yeah. Okay, good. Yeah, no, mobile people get charged more. Uh, King Mini, welcome, by the way. I know I'm six minutes late, which is an eternity for a streamer, but, you know. You know. Braj, Broj, Broj, welcome. Let's go. Oh, damn, you. A that screenshot of this piece, because it's just... It's just so bizarre looking. Where do flamingos spawn, Archer? Uh, suburbs. Suburban. Is it really just suburbs? That's the best chance for them to spawn. Hey, spawn Iron. Are you going to fill up the cup at all, or are we just going 100 at a time? I think that's all I have. Oh, I appreciate it. Chat, what you do I super charge next? Sorry. Ground you Pounder! Know how, um, you Trap know how Minecraft has UUIDs for, like, everything? Okay. Fortnite does the same thing. I bet you could, like, freak out a support agent if you'd be like, Hey, my weapon with this unique ID got... A race, can I have it back? And they're like, what the fuck? That would be really funny. Hey! Uh, is it runes? Thank you for the prime sub! Splash in my very heavy cup on the right. Oh, I was burping. Um, uh, I guess Lakeside is close enough to suburbs. Yeah, Lakeside doesn't too. Thank you guys so much! Quickly chat. 
Just watch what your Inferno you safe cracking guide in Damn Beast. You are a legend for that. Easiest 9,000 gold of my life, especially since I don't grind this game that much. I fucking love these comments. Somebody's telling me that it's not hockey, even though they were clearly hockey skins. Sweet. What happens when the cup fills up? I forgot. Uh, it roll it it splashes over. But then if somebody uh, subscribes or cheers like 100 bits after that, it splashes it. So you can cheer like 100 bits, but one at a time each. It's so fun to watch that happen. When is the new venture season? You know, I do get this a lot. Even when I... Even when I make a daily video mentioning it, and a reminder video saying there's one week left, and a daily video saying there's one week left, and direct people to the timeline every time I can, I do still get asked that, yeah. Uh, April 3rd, next shop reset. Or not next shop, but next weekly shop changeover is the uh, end of the season. Storm guy with 100 bits. Doesn't give a fuck about a cup. Hey. I'm basically just begging my chat now. Please fill the cup. You can stretch out one... <laughs> the hype train's long active. Iron! You're supposed to do these one bit at a time! I wanna sew it. Oh shit. You can't, there's nothing to splash! <laughs> you gotta fill, you gotta fill it up first! <laughs> Thank you, by the way. Oh shit, my bad, Pim. I'll, I'll go base. Can we get an F in chat? There you are. There you go. And you could do like 50 of those in one message. I'm just teaching him how to do hype train. Or not hype, I'm teaching him how to do tip jars here. There we go. Yeah, now Hydro's a hawk is getting on it. See the cup on the right? Oh, just filling up. See. Yeah, yeah. And then you splash see. it with a thousand. Don't worry. We could fill it up and then you can try again with like 10,000. And and you'll oh, see shit. it. <laughs> just fuck with you. Thank you so much. Oh, I fucking scammed myself. Fuck, man. No. I really appreciate it. It's just a fun splash. It's not the biggest deal in the world. I, I really thank you. It is a big deal. Thank you, Zahaka. You ever play? No, I don't. I Good to dip out of the stream. Thanks for hanging out, Acero. I got you on my list, right? That worked finally. Um. Okay. There's a random event on you. Uh. I don't know what that means. What it means? It's the yeah. What, what is that? Oh, you guys are filling up the cup now. You got it figured out. Well, if you could do more in one message, I think you can get like seventy of them in one message. Is the cap? How many? Like seventy or so. Oh, you shit. you can just do cheer one, cheer one. You can just copy like Control C, just spam it all. I it's miss. About a fucking, it's about to blow. What? It's about to blow up. Cup. Now that that's the big key. If you want the biggest splash possible, you usually have to like wait half an hour because the bits will be heavier the sooner they've been. But you'll get what you're going for if you do it right away. And we got a hype train active. One minute left on the timer, by the way. All ping in Discord because I I don't think sounds like Iron's not gonna let this one die. Huh? Um. He's obviously planning something, getting me all excited here. <sighs> there we- now he's got it moving. 40 seconds left on the hype train, if anybody wants to- to save it. Uh, any prime sub will save it, gift sub, normal sub, probably a couple hundred bits, I'm not really sure. If you send that, like, five more times, I think you'll save it. <laughs> there we go. Oh, Gifting a sub, thank you so much! Oh, there we go, cup on the right. Everybody watch, here we go! Big splash coming in! Oh, that was so satisfying. <laughs> One of the old follows kicked up and launched even more out. God, I love that. That animation is always so satisfying. Am I a mod? Oh, I am a mod. Uh, you probably aren't on Twitch, because I got hacked and it reset everything, but you probably should be. Let me fix it. Wait, no, I did They said I had mod logs for a second. Uh, that might have been on <laughs> YouTube. Oh. No, I have them. Oh, no, go. I don't have them, I lied. Yeah, well, I got hacked on Twitch and it reset all my mods, so you probably just haven't been in the stream in four years, so just had to get you back on the list there. All right, thank you for the other bits. Get in on the hype train. Kane, thank you for the gifted sub to Nose Picker. Splash in the cup again, although I missed it personally. 
Yeah, so that's like the most fun way to donate, is you just do like... A, a, a message of bits over and over and over and then... And then you win. Damn, and you got the badge. Was this your first time sharing bits in the chat? Uh, yes. I guess the iron I knew was such a... just a broke young boy, you know? Just out here making it in the world. And that was totally <laughs> fine. I'm a big boy now. Potty trained and everything. Have you ever gotten the glitch where you can't move your camera? No! I got the glitch in Tears of the Kingdom, where I accidentally did free cam. That was fun. That's a different game, though. Damn, why are you still going? I want to blow it up again. Oh, I see. Well, I'm down. Oh, thanks for making out, Audi. I know I'm late to that, but there's a lot going on. A lot going on, I'm sorry. Oh, what the fuck was that sound? I still need two flamingos. Okay, what are these guys referring to over here? <laughs> it was the freaking porta potty. Is this worth visiting? No. Okay, I'll turn around then. So close. <laughs> it's, it's the survivor stuck in the freaking toilet. Oh, I see. Iron, this is you. You can be doing so much more at once. I'm probably be efficient. Because if you like copy paste, I think you can get cheer one in there like 50 times per message or something. Yeah. I know that because when Ninjast was going crazy with his bits cheering, after I told him this, he cheered like. 20,000 bits, 50 at a time. And so the alert was going for like two hours straight. It might have been 10,000. Yeah, he basically cheered 50 bits like 200 times, and it was insane. Wow, back-to-back -back Blakebeard's stash. What the hell? Oh, now you got it. Now you got it. Look at that, chat. I'm just, I'm just training in ch uh, bits cheering. This is great. This is my favorite type of training. <laughs> there it is, overflow. Yeah, it's full now. You did it. And honestly, if people are ever, like, donating on a on a smaller budget, like, this is a great way to maximize your bits. You can get, like... What's 10,000? You can get, like, 20 fun little messages out of, like, a thousand bits. It's, it's kind of fun. Is this a nature oh, mission? I actually don't know. It's- it's no element. Well, I know, but it tells you and I never pay attention. This, I didn't see it. This does look like the nature part of the map. I don't know if that matters. <laughs> I mean, there was just a water smash right behind us, so I don't think it does. Hmm. Alright, we'll see. Let's find out what's happy to you twine. Yeah, there have been a lot of weird bugs. Some people can't cue their twine. Some people can't move their camera. Their re- their- their curse- their crosshair is going away, like... What is going on? I have a metal encampment on me if anybody in the team needs metal. I'm doing a, a chest one. Right by the defense. I'll come get in on the metal one. Just shoot something over here. Oh, we got 20 seconds left on the hype train, by the way, everybody. I completely forgot about that. But if anybody wants to get in on it before it's too late, now's your chance to get some hype train emotes. 100 bits, prime sub if you got it. Any kind of gift sub will push it along. I don't know if we're going to make it to level 4, though. I kind of forgot about it, but... Oh, no! Regardless, thank you to everybody who... Who, who, who oh, donated the hype train. Yeah, there it goes. Thank you guys so much! Choo-choo! Why? There is an open endpoint that I, if you call, will just skip the tutorial on your account. That's oh, funny. fuck yeah. Whoa! Level 7? Thank you so much! Appreciate you checking out Marvel Strike Force. If anybody wants to support me directly for free, you can check out this game for free. Link in chat, and uh, you can install it on your mobile device. If you make it to level seven, I get a kickback. It supports me directly, and I, I really appreciate it. Sounds like a dev endpoint, probably. Mm. Runes, welcome. Enjoy your emote. Why is it not exploding? Mm. Uh. You have to cheer. I think it's 100 bits minimum to make it splash, and then. A gift sub, primes, any kind of subscription will make it splash as well. Direct donations on Streamlabs also work. 
Which is more efficient, because then Twitch doesn't take 20%. Because, you know, you have to pay more for bits than they donate, so... And I turns over anyway, so it doesn't matter. Wow, I have a lot of traps to recycle. But I don't want to... Recycle them for okay. less. Oh, damn it. It's ventures. But I still need that shit. Man, I never got my flamingos from this game. It's half the reason I queued it. Hey! Come on. No ballas. Definitely regular viewer. The splash coming in on the top right of the screen, everybody. Check it out. Boom! That's always yeah, so wow. That never gets old. That was pretty damn. That never That's gets old. Mean. Nicely done, Iron. Nicely done. Thanks, Thanks mate. A successful splash. And Val has got a sub. He's one of those retired donors. He's got that 10,000 bits badge, but <laughs> doesn't have the sub. I only tease. I really appreciate it. Whenever anybody donates, like, I never expect donations ever. Like, especially from, like, the high roller donors who have cheered a lot because I feel like that's, you know, the end of it. So, I never, uh, I never expect anything. Oh, I got maxed out metal just from an anomaly and a survivor. Okay. Hydra, give me some water. <laughs> That's oddly, oddly, oddly fitting. You want some water? Some water. Um. Wow, I'm caught up on chat. That never happens. Yeah, Ollie, you're welcome. For making that possible to kill. Archer and I hounded the community manager. And Epic finally made it so that building blocker doesn't block traps from working. We can just start this mission, you guys. I didn't get my flamingos. I cry. Uh, well, we do the alert anyway. <laughs> I mean, I guess I need Ventures XP regardless. So it's not yeah. that big of a deal, but it, eh, whatever. Do gifted subs give the subscriber role Minerva? They do not. You need to be subscribed. Well, actually, no. If you were gifted, then yes. Yes, it does. I was looking at it backwards. Yeah, if you gift subs, it doesn't give you the role. But if you are enjoying a gifted sub, it will count, yes. Yeah, and you don't get a role for gifting anything. Huh? Like, no, there's no separate role. If I could, I would, but it doesn't track that, so... This is why I you like Blake Reese Dash. Or this is why I like uh, Cloak Shadow. So satisfying. Have you watched How I Met Your Mother? No, I have not. Everything I've heard about it suggests it won't be a show I enjoy. And that's fine. I cry when flamingos deserve to die. Yeah, I don't understand why they're hiding from me. I just want to kill them all. Iron, you snuck Hunter in there! I just got the rest out the You're gonna make it splash! Damn, where are you on the leaderboard now? Yeah, you went straight to fourth place. That doesn't surprise me. Just straight up there. Just figured out how to run. I really appreciate it, by the way. I have watched Friends. That's funny. But I watched a lot of it when I was young, and a lot of it leaves my brain. See, chat. Okay, it is off top. Well, that's what I've Has anything do, I you've said been on topic? See, chat, this is why you get bored and set up your own IDE instance and do the funny API stuff on your own and not give it to some weird bot. And why is that? But it's like, it's like infinitely more difficult though. It's so, it's so you're in control. You, you're not giving it. You're not giving your account access to a bot. Have you watched Friends? Yeah, yeah. Oh, if I've watched it, I'll know I don't like it. Mm. Iron, gifted another sub! Are you making a splash again? Here we go! Yeah. <laughs> it's so satisfying good. every time. And it's great to play off of, too. Like, if you're somebody who only has, like, 100 bits per hype train, cheering that 50 at a time and filling up the cup so other people can splash is always such a cool combo. Like, it's amazing that even if you only have, like, a dollar to donate, you can still have just as much fun. Cool. I was confused and I got the wrong. Yeah. yeah, you should have the role. Access to the VIP channels and all that. I 
I always think it's cool, too, because if somebody gets gifted a sub and enjoys all those perks, it might encourage them to come back next time on their own, you know? Yes, it's fake. Sorry. Yeah, KJ, you don't actually have a sub. You know what I just realized? Okay, so he's not going to talk. Yeah, I don't think he actually believed that iron... <laughs> what? What did you realize? I forgot to put my base down. <laughs> We've been Oopsies. okay. Oh, apparently not. They've been breaking in. Yeah, they broke in on one side. L constructor. Gotta put floors down if you're running base MD. Get with the meta, man. Are you See, running base I, MD? He, yes, he is okay. in the support. All right. That's where he should be. Always now. Yep. Uh, no, let's I'm just start, lead, Zeku. Boy. Yeah, 490 bullies in your gun. Bullies? Bullets. <laughs> <laughs> Is the new one. Damn, I, you gifted him a sub. He was so surprised, didn't even realize. He was like, wait, what? Did that just happen? <laughs> you did what? To... <laughs> you did something so nice, they didn't even believe it happened. This is where September is always awesome, where they discount gifting subs for a month. Well, I appreciate it, Iron. That's been very generous. You might be on the gifted leaderboard as well, now that I think about it. Yep, number nine. The gifted leaderboard is not super competitive this month, but... Leaderboard's leaderboard. Last time I had an ad, I didn't get a sub, even though someone said... Let's keep with the ads. Hmm. Yeah, some months are, are more... People generously gifting subs, some months not. It comes and goes. Oh, that mini boss is all the way up here. And then it came right back down. Okay, okay he stopped on the... Get him down here. Got the plasma pulse right on him. Jesus Christ. Jeez. <laughs> you know, that health started going down with the... Was a discharger in there? I put a plasma pulse down. There's no discharger adventures. So I think it might have been the cannonballs, too. I started throwing them. Yep. And then they started blowing up in his face, so he got all the projectiles. Somebody clipped that, chat. Yeah, that was Blakebeard Stash being viable right there. Yeah, too bad it's pretty bad now that you don't have any more cannonballs. This is so random though, just iron checking in, because I was literally watching a two clicks fill up video, like three clicks, and just was just thinking about you too. <laughs> I summoned you, that's what must have happened. It's just fake, man. I was just thinking about the old Minecraft videos earlier. I was like binge watching them. <laughs> I need to watch them. I haven't looked really at Minecraft stuff. It's nostalgic, bro. I sound so different. It sounded a bit more stupid. <laughs> yeah, it was weird watching some of those. It felt like a different person. Myself, yeah. I mean. It's like, wow. A very different version of myself made these videos. I feel like I sound... Every time I hear myself in one of the videos, I like, damn, I sound so freaking weird. Like... This just sounds off. Yeah, that can be a strange sensation. <laughs> Put it as a short? I don't know. I'd, I'd have to see it. Discharge was Halloween Ventures, yes. Timeline is always there. Timeline always. I don't remember, is there... Is there a button in the menus to clear all your survivors? I believe so. Okay, because there's an endpoint to do it, too. It's supposed to be quality of life, I imagine, but it's a very dangerous button. There's a... There's also an endpoint to bulk upgrade items. What? Got a link to LB. I don't know what LB is. Left bumper. That can't be what he means. I mean, that's all I know what LB means, but... 
I guess, if it's someone else. You had no right sounding that young at 17, 18. It's weird that was so fucking six years ago, bro. That's so weird. Leaderboard. Uh, the only leaderboard I was talking about was in the Twitch chat, which is right up here. Yeah, good to find is just taking that number one spot and ran with it. Holy shit. Why? What? What? I, what is Epic cooking? What? What were they cooking? <laughs> Why? What do you got now? Methamphetamine? Why, why is there an API endpoint to remotely change what is currently equipped in your quick bar? What? Thank you for the Prime <laughs> sub, I appreciate it. it. But it only works in ventures, uh, event modes, and uh, whatever Theater Zero is. I don't know what Theater Zero is. I don't know what Theater ventures Zero. level I am. About to check how though. Do you, how do you start the hype train again? Ah, uh, there's a one hour cooldown. Let's just start an hour. Fuck. Yeah. They're just fun emotes though. Not totally necessary. I wanna make I wanna make the funny thing happen. What funny thing? The the, the train thing. <laughs> yeah, it's definitely fun when the hype trains happen. I wish I could make the cooldown less than an hour, but when I shave I have a baby face, my voice is higher than side parts of my mind or stuck in the teen years. <laughs> Yeah, old aging can do that for you. Like I was talking about earlier, Bloons Monkey City, now that I remind myself. I have to check in and grab my farms. I mean, I last played this game nine years ago. That fucked me up. I was like, oh, I remember that game. I kind of want to play that. And then I checked my Instagram and saw a post nine years ago talking about this. <laughs> I can remote send XP boost to people. That's funny. I should just, like, send... 800 XP boost to beast real quick. Oh <laughs> fuck, can you just do that quickly? I'm done with all my cram session. I might be- I'm looking at it. I don't think there's a way I can bulk. I think it's just one at a time. Oh my god. Just send me one, see if it works. Yeah. What game, wait, what game is this? Bloons Monkey it, City. Uh, Bloons Monkey City. Oh my god, that looks so cool. It is so fucking never... cool. Oh my god. So this is like- so check this out. Each one of these <laughs> tiles out here is a different- track with favored monkeys restricted ones you get gold and stars and these little bloom stones for completing them oh my god and when you clear the tile you can build on them you can put another dart monkey house and how many of these little houses you have you see i got 10 dart monkeys dictates how many dart monkeys you get in game Oh, that's so cool. It is so well, you know, fucking fun. This game is free on Steam. There is literally no it's, reason not to play it. It's so good, chat. Play it. And when you upgrade, when you get like the little upgrade buildings like this Monkey Academy, you can just research different upgrades to your Dart Monkeys and your Boomerangs. I'm, I'm waiting on the Bionic Boomer because that's really strong. And the map is fucking huge. It's 60 by 50. There are 3,000 tiles. And they've got also free on mobile. They got little crashed Moabs out here, crashed treasure chests, and Ninja Kiwi is sweet. It's linked, so you can get this free on mobile and on Steam, and your accounts will save their data together if you do a Ninja Kiwi account. This game is also so some addicting. That you have to unlock, like beating maps. Yeah, like right here, you got the crashed heli and the submarine. So I don't have those. Oh, yet. heli pilot's so good in this game. And it's, it's just, so good and these farms, they generate in real time. So I've been loading up this game, just grabbing my farms and then closing. It is exactly as fun as it sounds, but it's, I should open my but it's, it's, it's a little grindy and monotonous. So it's kind of like a play it for an hour or two a day kind of game. But yeah, I've been having a ton of fun. My highest I've gotten to is level 37 before the account got reset because I wasn't playing it. And now my current account is level 23. Yeah, like reset because you weren't playing it. That's weird. It had been like oh, well over a year. So no. basically it just... When it I loaded up, it said, mind. hey, we got some save data from when you were level 34. Uh, oh, no, I do remember that. But then I was doing it on stream. So I was like, eh, I'll restart. And okay. now I'm back. You restarted it because you hadn't been playing. Yeah. Yeah, because they wouldn't they just reset your account. That's not what they do. Yeah, a bunch of the people were like, wait, this is a thing? I was like, yes, this is a thing. It's so fun. There's it's also... such a different take on the normal balloon mm -hmm. stuff. And I find it really, 
really enjoyable. And it's got such pleasant music. Right now there's a little Easter event, so I'm grabbing these bunnies. Somebody pointed out to me, because someone ta was talking one time, was like, is there ever going to be a second one? And then someone linked the wiki, and apparently Ninja Kiwi wants to do one, but no. they aren't able to yet. Okay, maybe. I heard them talk about it on a stream, then say that they said they had no plans to. Yeah, they said they would like to, but they don't have it on their timeline currently. Because... And this is like a really complete game. They haven't updated it in years because it's finished, basically. Yeah. And that's not a perfect game, but it's cool that there's like this whole fucking game here that a lot of people didn't even know existed. And it's uh, yeah. BTD5. So all the towers are so different that it, it feels <laughs> like a new game, even though it's an old game. And Iron! Yo. If you do play this game, we need to talk because... Yeah. There's same. there's this stuff like monkey v monkey stuff you can get going and I uh I don't have people to play with. So I'm going to be talking to Storm God too. I need to raid someone. That's this thing. It it wants me to raid someone, but I don't have an account linked to this yet. I might use a burner email and just make another Ninja Kiwi account cuz I need to get that going. This is $0. It's fucking crazy, right? They're gonna try and get you to buy stuff, but you don't have to. Bloomstones are easily farmable. If you get no lives lost, every tile will give you two. And sometimes there's a thing called monkey teams, where if you use very specific monkeys... I was noticing this, Bountiful Harvest. I was curious, because every fucking time these farms are full before I would even realize it. There's a double speed thing going on with farms. That makes yeah. sense. There's also a capture land for supply crates thing going on. Yeah. Mini land My favorite grab. is the your extra your attacks are extra strong for free and you get more money from them. Sweet. Well, I'm gonna have to load this game back up in half an hour then. Anyway, um, I was gonna say yeah, monkey teams where you get depending on your level five, but I hit fourteen, so now it's eight balloon stones on top of no lives lost when there's monkey teams, which is. Mm -hmm. A great time to farm. So these 492, I've spent zero dollars. It's awesome. So anyway, Bloons Monkey City, fun game. Get Iron to read Cradle. God, I'd love that. Was cradle. cradle is my favorite book <laughs> series ever. Hmm. Oh my god, Iron. <laughs> I wonder how much of this was me, because I back off, I eat a coconut. I threw down the plasma pulse and the Yeah, I don't know how much of that was me or the plasma pulse, but it, it started dying quick. What's my second favorite book series ever? Okay, I don't read that many book series, but... Wait, I don't know how you had it on Steam anymore, what the fuck? Uh, should I just I be I saying you, you, I forgot, you Selena Gomez, I forgot. Okay. I don't have you had it on Steam. Yeah, because I would not have deleted you. Like, I might delete a name I don't recognize, but I don't think you did that, so... I just forgot your name was Selena Gomez. It's a great name, right? <laughs> okay, so apparently it needs to be suburbs. That's what I'm gathering. Suburbs, most likely, you can get them in cities and in Lakeside, but it's not guaranteed. I'll try this city, then. God damn. Yeah. Thanks for hanging out, Bob Rom. I can't pronounce your name, but I appreciate you. That's yeah. awesome, Payne. I'm glad you've been uh, leveling up. So, yeah, I keep getting spammed by PK fans. Well, did you get featured in a video there, KJ? Going to the gym and bulking up helped me look older. Oh, yeah? How's the dating life? Are you using that bulk to, uh... Monkey City is free, yes. Um, I can't hear you, one sec. Uh-huh, convenient time. Can't hear me now. The game is so loud. Oh, yeah, I had to turn that <laughs> down. Blue Monkey City is so loud. So loud. <laughs> oh, what the fuck? I have to turn it down. Look at it. Look at my sound settings. Everything's nice and balanced. Oh, it's... God oh, damn it. Let me load up the game. I'll show you. I have Bloons Monkey City at one. It boots in like two seconds. I love it. Yeah, look at Bloons. It's all the way down here. You know what, though? I would much rather a game be too loud than too quiet. Dude, these yeah. farms are insane right now. Bountiful Harvest is no joke. It's very good. That's going to take like 30 minutes to go back to full. I need to just be checking in. Oh, wow. That game is set 60 and Fortnite is not. That was so fucking loud. So Holy much smoother. Shit. I love it. Oh, what is? Yeah. I could have turned it down. Oh. 
I'm having a hard time sticking to save the world. I want to keep playing. So I'm going to keep playing. I can't stop. Okay, you should play the game that you enjoy playing first and foremost. Save the world is not going anywhere. And you you know the seasons. Just play whenever you're feeling it. I always enjoy save the world more when I check in with a lot to do. Like, these streams are not random. I'm not just sitting here fucking around. I don't, I don't do, like, help streams or whatever because I am here to get my 160s done. I'm here to get ventures worked on. I'm getting challenges completed. I got shit to do. He does. I got people to check out Bloons Monkey City and Marvel Strike Force, by the way. Hey, Gotta check yeah. out the sponsored game. Help me out. Yeah, and Monkey City is free, by the way. I saw that question on, on YouTube. That's the craziest thing. I got so excited the other day because I was looking for a chill game. I wanted a game for... The end of the night, when I wanted to turn my brain off, or if I'm talking to the girlfriend and I want something to do with my hands that's not terribly difficult, and I was like, oh man, I miss Monkey City. That game's so fun. The pleasant music, the bright sunlight, the way that you build the different buildings to get your monkeys set up. Like, it's just a really fun game. It's slow. It's slow. Certain upgrades for certain towers can take over a day just waiting. Some of some of the Monkey City soundtrack is in Bloom's T6 in the trophy store. And it's it's so good. It's a fun game. Like, it's it's worth it, though. It's I like great. queuing an upgrade and being like, ooh, tomorrow I get triple darts. What they really want you to do is spend money on blue cells to speed it up, but uh, I'm... Joke's on you, I can wait. I'm, yeah, joke's on you. I'm trying to be casual here. <laughs> I've played Clash of Clans enough to be patient for long upgrades. I can handle this stuff. Yeah, Boon's Monkey City is not as bad as Clash of Clans. I think the longest no. in the game is like three days. I'm gaming. Yeah. Yeah, he's already popping tiles or popping balloons. Because the first levels are brain dead easy. It's just reds and blues. It's a really addicting yeah. game. And then it doesn't ramp. Even like the early, like hard stuff with like yeah, greens and yellows is still very easy in the early stages. It's probably a great game for new people because I spent so long with tier two towers that you really learn. What a tier two tower can do. Like they, I just got double shot on my ninja monkeys and it felt amazing. Like oh, wow, this is so good. way stronger. And I never knew why, but it makes sense now that I thought about it. Like double shot is the strength of another two ninja ninjas. monkey at a lot less of the cost. And positioning is huge, so in your ninja monkey that's in the best position, it can just shoot two now for a lot less than it would cost to get a new one. But anything past Town Hall 10 is more than four days for most upgrades. Really? Yep. I so, thought it was capped at like three City days. Is a lot. Oh, it's, is that Clash they've of been ex Yeah, they've been extending the... They've been decreasing upgrade timers relative to Town Halls because they keep making new ones. But still, upgrades take a pretty long time the higher you go up. Enough that Bloons is not nearly as... Yeah, Bloons is fine. Um, ever since EA bought Plants for Zombies, they ruined it? Yeah, that's not cool. That's not... You've been uh, scared to start a tower defense game? Bloons is really, really well done. Like, even Monkey City, that was pretty clearly meant to be, like, a mobile cash grab. It's actually not that bad. They're not selling you anything you can't just grind for in a reasonable amount of time. Plus, it's so fun. I love the city building. Like, I love this idea that I want to arrange my city in a nice way. I want to get all the... Uh, there's going to be hardcore segregation in my city. All right? I want all the ninjas in their own little neighborhood. I'm going to get all my dart monkeys in their own neighborhood. And then if, yeah. they, if they cross in the street, they can... Hey, I got my flingo! Flamingos! Woo! Fuck yeah! Yeah, I told you. Can I got a fuck yeah in my chat? Fuck yeah. Yeah, we we'll send the F. <laughs> I'm gonna get FK in chat. Fuck yeah! I'm fucking shit up. Fuck yeah! Stopped right before Town Hall 10 just because of... Yeah, I don't know the game, but... I'll talk about Monkey City all day. I'm glad! You say you love Monkey City too? Like... Travis, how much do you love Monkey City? Like, are you... Loving it from somebody who actually still plays it and there are more of us? Or as somebody who... Played that game a long time ago and it just has fond memories? Because that was me a week ago, but now I'm oh. actually like... So, what happened was I was looking for a nice casual game and thinking about how much I missed Monkey City. And I remember checking Steam and it wasn't there uh, many years ago. But, I don't know when they added it, but it's there now and it's fucking free! <laughs> it's been there for a few years. Yeah, I, I, I imagine. I haven't checked in. Like, 2021. 
And look at what I've been doing. I just have Steam open now. I clicked, and we're talking like not even 30 seconds here. You get the little swish. It loads for a second. I have a fast computer, so it doesn't take much time at all. And we're in game. Like, it's so easy to just pull up this game, collect my farms, close it. <laughs> Yeah. And I keep it windowed because it's not one of those games that likes to be clicked away from. It gets a little glitchy, but no matter. The one thing I actually need to be careful about is playing it too much. It is a monotonous <laughs> game. It is really not hard once you know what you're doing. And it was really easy for me to just play like 20 tiles in a row. And my brain shut the fuck off. I was... That was not good for me. This is a game that's fun for like an hour at a time. Maybe two. <laughs> End of the night when you're really tired kind of game. But in those moments, it's awesome. But yeah, you can see I got like 15 hours played already just because it's, it's addicting. In a good way. Not addicting like, oh my god, my wallet's bleeding. No. No. Uh, Chrissy, you don't need giveaways. You can craft traps and farm really efficiently. If you just kill glowing animals, recycle what they give you, you can get all sorts of stuff. You don't need other people. I wonder, I wonder if this is public AK I wonder if I can just search Beast's uh, ID. Now! And see how long he spent in the last mission. Oh, great. Yeah. That's really important information. Everybody listen up. Archer's gonna find out how long I spent in the last mission, down to the second. I'm sure you're on the edge of your seat waiting to find out. I, I just had to grab your account ID. I have ADD, what do you mean? Of course I am. I'm gonna be super fucking interested for one second. Um, yeah, you know what else is a free and fun game that you can play right now on your phone? Marvel Strike Force! And if you make it to level 7, 20, and 30, I get a special kickback, real-life dollars in my pocket, so you get to support me in the process of checking out a fun game. Are you, are you on the game now? What? Oh, you're not on the game. Fuck, I just I tried to request shit from you, but it didn't work. Uh, speak up. I can launch the game if you need me to check something. I don't know, I'm just fine. Falcon, I don't know why you're using a Nova Launcher, but... You guys are exciting me, by the way, like you two. I need to visit a friend in game or whatever, and the fact that you two actually are gonna, like, play the game, I need- perfect. I need oh, friends right now to actually do some I, of the challenges. Shoot me at- DM me later, yeah. And we could do contested territory? Oh, fuck yeah. Wow. Love me a good contested territory. I don't know how much I'm gonna be into this game, but you're inspiring me. It's, uh, I love it so much. <laughs> Friends make everything more fun. That, that counts for Save the World too, you guys. Yeah. You're still banned Don't from the Discord? Solo. Oh, that's alright. For everybody who didn't get themselves banned. See, like, I'm really, like, on the mod side. I've investigated a lot of bands, and uh, the mods do a good job 95% of the time, so... <laughs> I... And if you say me. you're banned, I'm usually <laughs> like, oh, you probably deserved it. Well, for the rest of us, um... And I'm not being a dick, chat. We have a ban appeal. You can plead your case. We read all of them. And we read all of them. Ban you. But every ban yeah. is noted, discussed, time stamped. We can reference it and we get lied to a lot. <laughs> yeah. Beast, I only did blah blah blah. And then I'm like, alright, we'll see you here. Uh yeah, well you being left out the part where you appeal. screamed the N-word at my mods. Maybe that would have been an interesting yeah. thing to mention. <laughs> yeah. I see that shit a lot. If you if you're filling out an appeal, be honest. Yeah, we, we know. That is way better than hiding the truth. We're very thorough. Like, yeah. That's not a threat, that's a plea. It's like, please, just be honest. We we do our homework. We carefully track everybody who gets banned and why they got banned. I'm always watching. Just beat Storm <laughs> King? Yeah. Pistol's a really strong weapon, though. I said the front door and... Emojis. I don't know what the fuck that means. I don't know what that means. Shut the front door just means shut up. I said shut the front door and... Is that... Like, are those emojis meant to be go fuck yourself? Because if you said that to what a mod, that's a re really easy man. What? The fucking vacuum tube bro is just shredding these fire husks. Um, yeah. 
We've said it on stream, I know, but... Yeah. To those who don't know, the Vecan Dubo is actually that strong where it does... I mean, not well, but better than it should versus fire enemies. Like Damn, you guys got me excited. Like, guys. this game has a special spot in my heart. Like I said, I was making those Instagram posts like Find the Dart Monkey nine years ago. And... Like, I just, I still have such fond memories of Bloons Monkey City. The only reason I stopped playing is because I kind of beat it. I did every special tile yeah. in the entire game. I had something like 1,500 tiles cleared. I had every monkey building. Everything you can build was built. My farms and everything were maxed. I, they, there was nothing left for me. Oh, jeez. What? you go shredding this mini boss. Jeez. And the Rosie as well. Wow. Okay, well, glad I could help. Fuck. Fucking ran over here just in time to get the loot. <laughs> we deleted the minis. But yeah, I did everything in Bloons Monkey City. But then, you know what makes me feel so glad? Like, but then they added monkey knowledge packs, which is after my time. You know how annoying it was to be level 40 and then packs were just getting introduced? I was like, well, this is supposed to be like a slow grind where you slowly earn packs throughout your playing. I, I didn't need any of that. That was a bummer. I love those though, those monkey knowledge packs, because you get like global buffs. Yeah. You get like a universal, you know, like base, like the tycoon is an awesome one because yeah. it's a global buff where every single tower becomes two percent cheaper. Like what? Two percent might not sound like a lot, Chad, but that is. It's a lot. Because there's other buffs individually, like uh, my dart monkeys and my uh, ninja monkeys are. I think the dart monkeys are 2%, but ninjas go from 500 gold to 490 gold each, and that's a big deal. Uh, yeah. Dart monkeys... I was gonna say... My dart sorry. monkeys had a 3%, and the tycoons 2%, so now they're 190 instead of 200. Like, that adds up a lot. Sorry, I keep... I was gonna say, one of my favorites is... There's one for the engineer that buffs its turrets where yeah. the first upgrade it allows them to see camo and then the last one for the turrets it lets them pop light balloons every couple shots. I've been so putting like, I've been putting that wait, you said the last one, like level fifteen? The thirteen, because it's level okay. three whatever. I, the, do you reasonably hit level thirteen on anything? Because it's I really have. slow. I've gotten one of my towers in the past to the third card, and it was the Buccaneer. Yeah. I got a crazy... Okay, chat. So these monkey knowledge, <laughs> these cards level up your monkeys. It's not that complicated. If you don't play the game, that's it. You use these cards, and they just give you XP towards your monkeys, and it unlocks bonuses like seeing camo. I got a card from my pack that gave me wild cards, where you can spend them wherever you want. Mm -hmm. So... I opened two of those wild card packs. It gave me two packs. One of them gave me four more packs, <laughs> or, or two more packs. <laughs> and then I opened a, a pack, and then I opened a pack, and then, or it was like the second pack gave me another two packs. And when it was all said and done, I had like 24 wild cards. And I yeah. put them all on like sabotaging Moabs and... The engineer for camo is actually a really insane bonus, and it's I so want it bad. Clash Royale wild engineer card. No, it's still balloons. Still balloons. No. What music do you recommend for the Storm King Fury of City or Shadow Shard? The music is so good in this Shadow game. Shard Normandy for normal gameplay, oh, and then uh, City and, say, uh, and I can't Bright Core for I Storm King's Link's fight. There's also cards that'll give you. There's legendary cards as well, but there's one card that's super rare where it gives you. A legendary's worth of points for every single card. I believe that's the ancient pack. Yes, I've gotten it a few times in the past. It's always a pleasant surprise. But yeah, there's wild cards that give you like 50 bloomstones or like four wild card packs and stuff. It's nuts. If anybody wants to collect cards in a different way, stream loots, link in chat. You guys can buy those for cheap and it makes different things happen <laughs> on stream. Honestly, stream loots is one of my favorite ways for people to donate. It's like, I obviously love it when you guys engage with sponsors, and, um, Stream Loots isn't even a sponsor anymore. They're just a good service. God, this game, honestly, I just love the aesthetic as well. It's so, it's totally subjective, but this bright, sunny map is just infinitely at high noon, and it is so happy. This game just makes me smile when I launch it. It reminds me of summer.
Sig said to the guy who got banned, he said, you, you said plenty more. Nothing useful or contributing in any way. You joined a troll not to be a part of our community. Oh, shit. Sig yep. did his homework. Yeah, I and just then it, saw that. And then Slimber said, that's my whole thing, crying emoji, crying emoji. If your whole thing is to troll the community, then, yeah, that was a good ban. You guys see why I blindly yeah. side with the mods? <laughs> yeah, TTTV Pain. Uh, Clax is very strong. I was literally using it today. Like, this I was using it in Ventures just now. It's a good weapon. I always, I always buy things time. with Archer's Code. See, here's the deal. I... I support using anybody's code, especially Archer, but, like, I have to question why they're telling me. <laughs> they're being so open about it. Yeah. See, I never know. I and never know. So you know. Are you just here to share that you support Archer, or are you here to tell me that you... Or are you here to tell me that you don't use my code? I, what is your motivation? What am I supposed to feel? At least there's a 4X mission in the suburbs, so I can get doghouses and decent XP. All right. The doghouses I did in three and i could have easily done it in two if the spawns were good the first mission i got it ruckus boy thank you for the prime sub by the so, way i appreciate it i'm glad they've been we helpful can that one done so fast. hydrate i can do that i was gonna say hydro what's what was your question uh, i figured it out okay yeah if you got like any you know bloons it. monkey city questions i'm on it same <laughs> I, I think I used yours two or three times. Much. Okay, so this is a positive comment. I never know. For, I never know. I'm glad you're using somebody's code. I know Archer appreciates it just as I do. Because it's like somebody's yeah. definitely come in with that. So. It's like real life dollars. It it really helps. It doesn't say you're online for some reason. I don't know why. Uh, who? Hey, what's your name in game? Is this Steam? Yeah. No, in 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 game, but on Bloons. Bloons. I don't know. I don't actually well, have a Ninja Kiwi late. account connected to the game I'm playing. That might be why, yeah. Yeah, I'm kind of I'm kind of in dark mode right now. If I click any contested territory or anything, it prompts me to make my account. So I I might connect that after the stream. I see. Ah, hammer crush. I was just using. Earlier, in, when I was doing Ventures Alone, I had an Armageddon, and it was actually, like, shredding. I was like, oh, damn. And so I decided to make a copy in my regular inventory, and now I finally finished making it. It seems very strong. Okay. I've had six unanswered comments replies all day it's been driving me crazy ain't no way shadow kyogre showed up in my gbl match <laughs> <laughs> shadow kyogre is cool and all but it's not a great league pokemon i am as confused as he is <laughs> i need takers by the way if you see any um, i've actually needed takers oh, for a while i just keep forgetting i need 13 i hear more. one Find a shadow or I got one on me. Yes. I did not hit it. I need to get chaos agent take because I didn't even know he was that. Oh my god, yeah. This is why I make these reminder videos. You know, I felt like a silly scummy YouTuber just baiting free content or something. But then people actually didn't know chaos agent was available, and I think, holy crap. This went from like a silly free video to like a video I actually need to make. These reminder videos are like a, a seasonal thing for me. I don't skip them anymore. Cause I, I'm always harder on myself than anybody. I always make these videos and I think, oh gee, look at that. YouTuber makes an easy video, just farming ad revenue. But then people comment all these thank you messages cause they, they didn't know and I feel good. So anyway. Hell, I watched it and I knew everything that was happening. So I was like, <laughs> you didn't need to do that. I didn't, but I was like, hey, peace video. Oh, I appreciate that. It's good to hear me talk. Now, there have not been a lot of those recently, so. No, so I might as well get some content where I can. And honestly, even an endgame player might be like, oh shit, I forgot about that. I know I did. I went to prep the video and was like, oh yeah, oh yeah. I had at least three moments where I thought, oh shit, right. Oh shit, right. <laughs> Yesterday, Beast. 
It was like, wait, next week? It doesn't come out next season? Yeah. Talking about uh, Survive the Horde, and we were, Piper and I was like, you and Piper, um, next literally. week is next season. Yeah. Piper telling me next season is, like, next week is next... Wow. <laughs> I was one sixth perk from a perfect room... I'm so pissed. Uh-oh. What do we get? One six perk off of a... This is how I would run it normally. Minus energy. That's... I'm mad. Yeah. Uh -oh. She said it was, like, next week is next season, and I was like, oh! 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 oh. I made that video right then. It was 1 a.m., and I was so hungry, and I thought, nope, mm -mm, I need to record this right now. <laughs> Perfect timing. Yep. People we might not realize... Well, it wasn't my cleanest recording, so it's not a hard guess, but people might not realize that video was rushed that was just thrown together all of a sudden like oh my god i cannot believe i didn't i did not have that prepped are you any good at chess uh if i put my brain to it i have accomplished some success but i'm not a very i'm not an extremely patient person and stress no uh, and, and chess stress chess tugs at that i don't know i i can't bring myself to be good at chess but i understand it I've watched more Agamator than you might guess. Way... Way more Agamator than you might guess. I'm fucking shit up, dude. <laughs> How's the city going? Dude, it's fucking expanding, dude. I'm so excited yeah. for Iron, because I just did all that early you... game stuff a couple days ago. The, the first few levels right? go by quick. Yeah. Well... Yeah. The first few levels go quickly, and then it slows down the further you go, but it's still very quick for those first, like, even the first ten levels are just super fast. I have all these ambitions to, like, do every tile on the map, but 3,000 tiles is so fucking much, and your game will be completely done by a thousand tiles. So it's hard to motivate, but I think it might just be, like, a casual end-of-the-day thing, because, you know, I talk to the girlfriend every night, and I... It, I don't get fully stimulated from a conversation with anybody, so I'm one of those people. I, I need to be doing something, but I do. Poppy will be so happy I haven't abandoned him fully, but I'll, I'll put on, like, uh, Pokemon PvP videos. I'll just watch it muted, and I'll just have that in the background while we're on a call. But for me now, uh, Bloons Monkey City, or Mar Marvel Strike Force, might be that game I play while, I, while I'm hanging out chatting with her. It's gotten to the point where, like, we do this thing where I'll lie to her and she knows I'm lying. When Whenever she wants my full attention, I'm just like, oh, of course you have my full attention. But the reality is, nothing ever has my full attention. It's very rare. <laughs> it's, you know. With Henry! I have. That's so cool! I have hung out with Henry. He and I were hotel buddies in New York. Skipper, thank you for the prime sub! 27 months, too. Almost a year. 27 months, bro. What the fuck? That's a crazy long sub, too. Skipper must be a lurker, because I don't see them chat month, but 27 is no joke. I appreciate you, Skipper. I really do. I always feel so cool in moments like that. Like, wow, I... Like, Henry's, like, an actual friend of mine, too. Like, we didn't just meet in New York. Like, I basically convinced him to go to New York. Because he was thinking about it, thinking about it, and then he had to raise some money, and then he did. He hosted a fundraising stream, and he made, like, 1100 And that funded his trip, and his wedding. And, um... And it was... Very cool, actually. I was very honored that he took me up on that. Because not only did I, like, motivate him to go to New York, but I told him the hotel I was in. I was like, yeah, it's a great deal. And he agreed, and... So we just met up every morning. <laughs> Pretty fun, actually. That's what happens when you get like a check mark next to your YouTube name. You get to just make friends. Like, hey, look, I'm not some random guy. And he's like, oh, wow, you aren't some random guy. And I was like, yeah. Flexing your, your status. It happens. I'm on like House Stark's friends list just because I'm Twitch partner. That actually made me think. I had a horrified thought. I don't know if I'm still on his list. I'm gonna go check. I'm checking right now. I oh, yeah, just so... forget if you're on someone's. Oh, we're lucky. That's why I don't get gifts from him. Well, next time I meet him. So I'm looking. Uh, I'm at... sure this is related to Pokemon Go. No, but it's, <laughs> no, but it's related not even close. To survive the horde. I think I figured it out. All right, what do we and got? 
So it looks like tier one, uh, tier two through five, one is just the basic, changes the modifiers that occur during waves. Uh, and six through 12 just change the power level of the husk. So it looks like tier five will give you the highest difficulty modifiers, and then tier 12 will give you the highest power level starting at. So I don't think I've figured out the calculations for the power level yet, but it it might be like starting at like tier 12 starts at like 160s, so like 250 power level hus. Okay, that's but pretty good. I I think they want to balance it out a little bit because you can't harvest anything, so they don't want to make it too crazy. Hey, platinum! So, I, I don't know. play a lot of PC games. So you doing on dog houses? I'm at four. Okay. I I. I Thought I Xenon mode pretty thoroughly, so I gave up for now. But if you want to keep checking, uh, I'd appreciate it. I'll, I'll toss a few every now and then. I, I finished all my quests, thank you, so. Yeah, next week really woke me up, because I was like, Ventures 45, and thought, Oh, we need to put the pedal to the metal here. You guys might get an extra stream, by the way. I just honestly thought I'd get Ventures done playing once a week, but... Ventures snuck up on me, so... I love being like a... Reminder youtuber where I'm like hey everybody seasons ending soon. I might have just found out ten minutes ago, but seasons ending don't forget <laughs> <laughs> It was so funny watching that video cuz I knew that in the back of your mind you just thinking fuck I only learned this I now just found out like 20 minutes ago <laughs> And you can tell by the lighting I that was recorded right after the daily video which was recorded at midnight Nearly 4 a.m. Hello from Germany. Hello master waffle welcome all right, so you asked me if I play any PC games. You guys want to see... Does everybody want to see my most played Steam games? I'm fishing. I won't show you if you don't ask. Does, any, does everybody want to see my most played Steam games? I mean, I would be down, but I don't have this. I have the stream open on my phone because of my current position. Gotta make sure Nekopara is not very high on here. I don't need people knowing I play that. All right. <laughs> oh, but you guys you actually care? Say. I think this might surprise you. Does anybody here? All right. Let's let's just be this this cutesy little compliment fisher. Does anybody? Does anybody watching the streams know what might be on there? Hmm? Does anybody have an idea? Any idea? Bloons is an easy uh, one. Bloons. That's that's bloons not a surprise anymore. I've been talking about it all stream. Well, I was thinking Bloons TV6 as well. He said, bruh, Nekopara. Nekopara is art, okay? Man, Lego Star Wars? Lego Star Wars was a treat. Skywalker Saga is one of the only games I've ever 100%ed. 100%ed. Civ 5? Okay, that's... That's a good, that's a good guess. Fortnite is not a Steam game. Fortnite has more time played than my entire Steam games combined. <laughs> my highest Steam game yeah. is 552 hours. Fortnite's like 7,300. <laughs> it's not even close. It's not even close. Oh shit, I have cannonballs. Cannonballs is way higher DPS. I don't know why I don't just use that right away. Um, who triggered this? Who asked me? Who asked about... Yeah, Platinum is the one who asked on YouTube if I have any PC games. My former friend used to play that shit. That shit? Echo Para is beautiful, okay? Iron, have you heard of Neko Para? No. Oh, yeah, I asked about your dating life, and then you got all suddenly busy on me. No, because I couldn't hear you because the sound of the game, bro. It was opening. Yeah, because of the... <laughs> Alright, I'm gonna have to Four pause this. Chat. Monkey said he was loud. Uh, walk away from me. Alright. Most played Steam games. Here we go. Drum roll, please. Civ 5 at the top. 552 hours. We got Bloom Star Defense 6. Last played today because I launched it on accident. Modern Warfare 2. Easy 472 hours. Hmm? That does not surprise me. Yeah. Bloons Tower Defense Battles surprised me. I had no idea really? 
Yeah, it was my most played for a long time. Uh, I have both the Battles games. I I have not touched either. Um, does anybody have any spare Storm King weapons? Oh, Master Waffle, I got some bad news for you. Uh, <laughs> uh, of all the weapons in the game, ooh. Storm King weapons are the only ones that cannot be dropped to another player. So, yeah. There's no way to get schematics, so... You can absolutely get schematics. Once you hit power level 122, you can start getting Storm King weapons going. I, I meant, like, you can't give schematics. I know, I'm just sharing that if you want to get schematics, you yeah. can... Shellshock Live is so fun. Yeah, um, I, I think 200 of those hours have to be with friends. Shellshock, we had a whole group for it for a long time. Iron was part of that. I need to get a. I need to get that because I don't actually have it, but I played it before with a friend. Skywalker Saga, one of my only 100%ed games. A lot more PUBG. It's been a long time since I played that. All with friends, let's go. Rainbow Six, Borderlands, Borderlands, South Park. Love with dude. love golf with friends so much. Golf with, golf with friends goes hard, bro. It's yeah, I was. Hey, that's a good game a right wild there. Wild guess what the number one game on my. Fallout seventy six. Oh, yeah, it's Fallout seventy six, and then Team Fortress two, and then Terraria, and then Borderlands two. Hundred percent of life is strange too. I should, yeah, I, I should look play. at mine. I don't even play TF2 anymore. Oh yeah, learn to fly. My 7.2 hours of Terraria. Archer gets all excited. I have, I have, I have a thousand three hundred hours of Rust. You gonna say Rainbow Six? Yeah, I went through a phase there. Still a role in the server, yeah. I haven't played Shellshock with people in a long time. But after 200 hours, you know, you get your fill. Um... <laughs> Valis said my former friend used to play that shit. Is what is Nekopara what brought you guys apart? <laughs> How much longer are you gonna stream for today? Oh my god. Apparently half an hour more. I might keep going actually, I'm having a good time today. Yeah, I saw you got a pending message. Is this gonna be fun? It has begun. <laughs> it's just a picture of your baby city. Yeah, man. I'm actually so. Did you make a Ninja Kiwi account? Uh, not yet. All right. I'll do it. We'll have to both do that. I'll have to find Ooh. an email that's not associated because I don't want to link it to an old account and then either overwrite my old save or accidentally fuck up my current save. I, I need to make a new account. Can I add you? So no, I'm sorry. Holy shit, you're so many traps. Tempster, that's a great idea. I'm actually... If, if you're somebody who... travels for work or goes to school or something, I'm kind of on board nowadays with high-powered laptops. Laptops are really good nowadays. And I have, like, a, a really nice ROG Strix laptop in it. Going to the bathroom real quick. It could replace my main PC if if I was just starting out, you know. Encampments? I'm trying to get suburbs done. And I think it needs to be 140s at this point for the dog houses. Uh, we got room for one if anybody wants to hop in. I'm going to collect my farms real quick here. I've been starting my days by just... By just loading up balloons. Oh, How much so longer I... are these double farms? Let me see this real quick. I thought my base was big, and I just see yours again. My base is not big. Bro, your base is huge. I know it feels that way, but it's. I only feel you feel huge. It's it doesn't look that big. Uh, it only looks that big. It's not actually that big. Not the size that matters. Like, look how far it lets you scroll out. Like, you can see- I can't even see the edge of the map yet, dude. These are- they, they get huge. That's overkill as fuck. But what didn't exist when I played a long time ago was the editor mode. Look at this. You can edit your whole farm. You can just put away all your buildings. And then you can just, like, put it all back wherever you want. I'm totally going to do this when I have space. 
Totally gonna do that. Chromebooks in your school give us can only run 1080p and below as well. No, I'm not talking about that. No, no, no. I mean, like, if you are saving up for a PC, if traveling is something you do, is all I'm saying. Uh, did anybody request to join? We got room for one if anybody on my list wants to hop in. Um, I'm just saying, if you travel for school or something, a couple thousand dollars will get you a really, really strong machine. It's just, uh, like, really capable. Although that Borderlands 2, the time played, a lot of that is on my laptop. I've been playing that from bed. Playing Borderlands 2 from bed at 1440p, 200 FPS, 165 hertz monitor. Like, that's, that's good shit. Like, it's a genuinely excellent gaming experience from bed. I love that. Should you play Boons? If you think it's fun. Boons Monkey City is fucking free, dude. Anyway. Um, thanks for hanging out, KJ. Enjoy your new sub. I'll try to stream a little more. I think, uh, I think Survive the Horde will get me back on if they, if they fixed it. If they fixed, fixed it. it. You mean just made it more fun? Yeah, that's what I mean. It looks like they did. Zylik and I are doing some, like, looking in the files. I know you, you two are doing looking. And it looks like Horde is going to be... Is going to offer... Like, it looks like Tier 12, the highest level difficulty, is going to be, like, fuck your shit up Good. level. Need a real challenge. You should stream pogo battles. Oh, but I don't enjoy them. Oh. And for people wondering, there is no... It does not look like there's any reward at the moment for doing tier... For doing t level 12 in Survivor the Horde. I don't and know that's, if that's they And that's why I'm, I'm always hesitant to accept your leaks, because, I mean... Surely there's gonna be something. I couldn't imagine. I don't know. They might. They might have made it a mode that's so difficult that they don't want to alienate lower skilled players. I don't care. Alienate them. Be a higher power level. Have something to look forward to. I punched my Chromebook and broke the screen over winter break because of Geometry Dash. I have not played the game since. Yeah, that's that's not good. I just came back to you saying that. <laughs> Once I became an adult, I stopped breaking stuff. Is your Chromebook yours or was it the day. school's? Because yeah. fucking up school property is no good. I don't like that. I never broke shit as a kid either because, like, I, I, I realized if I. What? Because I, I grew up very poor, so if I broke something, I, that shit was. Yeah, was gone. Yeah. A harsh but good parenting tip is to. Say, if you ever break anything, like, intentionally, then you need to replace it yourself. It's like, you get like, one phone. If you break that, it's yours to replace. One of my, uh, my Xbox 360 controllers died, and I, 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 shit, I sent that shit to, to the ER, aka my closet with a bag of tools, and I fixed that thing. That's good stuff. I was not stuff. about to stop playing Minecraft. Emotional damage. It's a... It's a to come sooner. We still got room for one if anybody wants to hop in. Calgo, welcome back. I got a... I got a dog house! I got a dog house! I got a dog house! I'm at six. Bye. We got one coming in. Please stop asking to play, Master Waffle. That's not how I do things. Never ever ask to play. If you do exclamation point, can I play, you'll see the command on YouTube. It's very annoying, it's very spammy. I never let anybody in my lobby when they ask. That's not how I do it. There are special exceptions, but they know who they are. The two-step's actually a decent shotgun. It's nothing super exceptional, but it's okay. Better than you might think. Jeez. Wow, 
Wow, I really only got one or two chests I could open from that. What a joke. Mad about it. If you break it, remember you just wasted money. Yeah, yeah. Like, I, I broke stuff when I was a kid. Controllers and shit, but... It's amazing. Once you've purchased the item that you're using, you suddenly realize that that is not where your anger should go. Yeah. Because I, I grew I, up I in a... Not, not rich, but a well enough to do family where controllers just felt like a thing you have multiple of. That's just what you have. If you break one, you got more. Whatever. But, yeah. That is not how you should handle your anger. <laughs> it's a funny perspective that breaking stuff like that is kind of disrespectful to your parents as well. It's like, hey, I care so little about this thing you got me that it's just something I break when I'm mad. But that's not entirely fair, because that's not the kind of emotion I had when I was... Angry. I used to get really angry at Call of Duty. I'm a highly competitive person. Shocking, I know. And... When I was very young dealing with those... Very intense emotions, I... Yeah, get angry. What is a finish point to save the world? Uh, a highly debated topic. Nobody seems to. <laughs> the finish point for casual players is probably just the candy. Candy? The, oh, maybe. No. The candy getting line. MSK weapons. That's the one I see the most, is getting MSK nah, weapons. Okay, the so the, I see the end point for casual players is probably just the candy plus line. I'm saying like casual people, ca like casual, casual people, not dedicated to say the world players. The end point for like people who really care about Save the World is getting uh getting the MSK weapons and then But the I hate that point... because a power level eighty could just get carried and then they're like, Oh look I beat the game. And yeah, I've heard that the before. End point, the end point for like dedicated Save the World players is there is no end point. Maybe one forty five, yep. <laughs> but like if you're if you're a really dedicated player for Save the World, there is no end point. That's where I'm at, kind of. You just gotta keep playing. You know, there are concrete ends, you know. Maxed out collection book is kind of impossible nowadays, because superchargers will just push that gold post further and further. But, but maxed out collection book, some people want to 130 a copy of every weapon, some people want to be max power level. I don't know. Everybody's got their own goals. My long-term goal is 145 at least, and then at least one of every item in the book minus starter packs. Those are my goals. And everybody's got a different set of those goals, so... Yep. Yeah, what's the point to say the world? Hotly debated. I guess there are platinum trophies if you're console, and you can go for that, but... You've also got the challenges, like, uh, Guardian Angel. That's platinum. Or play with others. That's what platinum is. Oh, right. Is. Yeah, they're just not listed as black on PC. Yeah, not on PC. On PC, it's just free. Free-ended. Just no achievements at all. Those are your achievements. Yep, that's it. Cool. Some people have physical goals. They want to solo MSK, because that's really impressive nowadays. They want to AFK Endurance, or I don't know. You ever play RuneScape? Uh, no. No, I'm not. And never World of Warcraft. Never got into any of that. I'm kind of glad, because those are some crazy grindy games. I did find out what my most played Steam game is, and it didn't surprise me once I thought about it. Nekopara, huh? But when I... <laughs> no. Um, it's GTA. Actually. Wow. Yeah, that's a game you can spend some long hours in without thinking about it. At least, like, a fifth of that is me AFK. Ah, boo. Because you can... There's a couple ways to AFK it, but they're not conventional. A lot of it is just me playing, but I've, I've taken a big break from that game because I haven't enjoyed it as much. It's a good reason to take a break. Yeah. People ask me, like, what do I do if I'm not enjoying Save the World? I'm like, well, stop playing it. Take a break. I do that. 
I do it pretty, all the time. Pretty often enough. <laughs> Hell, it's I literally didn't finish um, the Fortnite Mirror's Venture season last season last time it happened because I just didn't want to. I find Save the World really fun to come back to. Whenever I stop playing, it's yeah. like, oh shit, I got 160s, I got adventures, I got this quest line I'm not doing, I got dungeon challenges, and it's just more and more and more. Yeah. And it's not like we're not getting anything either. You just cool down by relaxing bed, yeah. There you go. Level five, and I have no idea what to do. Looking to get level twenty. Ryan, are we talking about uh, Marvel Strike Force or Ventures. Fortnite or Ventures? Level five too. Are you level five in Fortnite? So new. Base game on power level 90. Are we talking about ventures? Because if you guys are both level 5, you should play together. Yeah, you should add each other. Just do do all the mission alerts and do all the quests. And it'll get you close enough that one or two more missions will get you over level 10. This is the most I've used the pot shot in like a year. Man, this loadout is perfect for just being in the thick of it. Wish I'd get a taker rather than all these flingers. Should do storm chests. That's what I should be doing. Or your dailies, I'm glad. Orders. I'll keep them up. We're at three and a half years, no sign of stopping. I think the daily series is probably one of the smartest series I ever made on my channel. Best perks is probably up there too. I took so much encouragement to start that series too. I thought it was so pointless to cover the missions every day. But also like really not pointless. I don't know. I didn't think people would watch. I'm still surprised people do, actually. Now the tier lists. The tier lists have been genuinely amazing. I've gotten I love them. millions of views from those videos, and I did not expect that much success. I've... You've gotten me to make my own for all the weapons and stuff, because it's fun. the ones that I feel most informed upon. And I remember posting them into Save the World chat, and people just read my stuff and like, really? This is my gear? Like, I don't care. These are my thoughts, and... I enjoyed making these. It doesn't matter if people disagree, because that's kind of the point. People are gonna. Yeah, there's no tier list where everybody agrees. My favorite was when we did the community tier list for the rocket launchers, and then the trash can and ranked lower than the bazooka. Yeah, that one was fun. <laughs> that was a good example of how everybody is not always informed. It happened uh, from me with the husk cleaver and the pressure cutter. Same fucking weapon. And I did not know that. Now I know it. But... What's, at the, uh... oh, boss. What's my favorite weapon? Uh, Ranger. Least favorite? Don't have one. I, my, my heart doesn't have room for a least favorite weapon, but I will say my favorite right now is the Ranger. My favorite right now is the Klax. Yeah, that's a good one. My favorite hero right now is Cloak Shadow. I'm using him right now. You guys can see I'm just smacking one here, one character, and then everything around me just dies. I love it so much. I don't even really need to attack Riot Huskies. They just die around me. I love taking that smash and just stumbling it. I just killed a riot husky without attacking it. I'm gonna do it again soon. Oh, I ran out of coconuts. Yeah. 
Yeah, the beehives make it really hard to open the chests. Let's drop a plasma pulse on that dude. Oh. I love the nerd shit. When you figure out some obscure loadouts insanely powerful, yeah, it's so satisfying. Take your time for starting on the green. Mm hmm. I mean, leaves a pot shot for smoke. Ah! On smoke screen and loot. Ah! Ah! Why? Why do you use a pot shot on smoke screen mini bosses? It'll be doing That's like 75% to... less damage. Don't do that. Smoke screen is melee and ability damage. Range weapons reduced. And I'm pretty sure many bosses just have like a universal uh, resistance to traps. Otherwise, we'd never With have to kill exception. any bosses anyway. Yeah, trap vulnerable is specifically trap vulnerable, right there in the name, actually. Well, you guys, I keep checking out Blakebeard's stash, and I keep coming to the same conclusion: it is not ruined. <laughs> It's a little more active when you can't just save up all your cannonballs, but that's not a bad thing. Oh no, the game's making me play more. Travis, thanks for hanging out. Cloaked no damage bug? Yeah, I don't... I've never experienced him doing no damage. And they buffed him recently specifically, so he's quite viable now. Where do you get Save the World uh, batteries? I got a whole video on batteries, actually. It's a little long. So, it almost, almost hits the 30 second mark, but... Definitely oh, a good watch. Zylik and I have just done a bunch of digging, or mostly Zylik, because I'm trying to figure stuff out. Trying to get that body uh, gone. What what Survive the Horde looks like now is you you when you start in, you get to select from five different tiers, and the and the tiers work like boosting difficulties in missions. So it looks like tier five will start the husk out at 160 levels. So like. 250. It'll start them at like 250, 220 or something like that. Uh, and then if you, and then um, the the game will give you a randomized like bad debuff throughout the entire thing, depending on the difficulty of the mission you choose or the modifier you choose. So there's only five tiers, and five is the hardest tier, and it's like it's like boosting a mission. So like tier five. We'll start him at like one, like 200 or something. What? No, he hit level 30 in Marvel Strike Force? Yeah, I have a hard time digesting this information before it actually comes out. Look forward to that, though. Yeah. I'll have to hear all I this again, I'm sure. I, sh I should be around for that, I hope, at least. This could just shouldn't be in the way. What am I saving up for right now? Oh, and balloons. I thought you were going to say, I'll tell you what I'm saving up for and say the world. A loadout. Radar scanner would, would be good. Ugh. All right, I'll do that. I'm, I love these farms. Away. It's so good for Bloons Monkey City to just play Fortnite all day. Because I get to just load up the game every 20 minutes. And the farms are full. Yeah, I didn't know about that. I think Cloak Shadow has been functioning since his update. I'm not sure, though. I was going to say my favorite is when the, um, you can attack faster and then you get more money for attacks because then you just, every time you log in, you're like, oh, that's cool. And then you get big bursts of like 5,000 cash every now and then. If I don't get a doghouse, I will leave this game. Okay, we're good. I was gonna say. I don't think that's even. Because that's all I need is that and. Takers. Teammates, I'm running low on metal. People can help out with the defense. I'm also running out of brick, so it's becoming very tricky to... There we go. Got a chest. Well, if I see a metal encampment, I can call that out. 
I'm gonna look for a storm chest actually. I need takers that bad. I'll let you know if I see mysterious orb or something. It's weird when they name it that because then you have to like pretend like you don't know what it is. I'll let you know if I see a mysterious orb and Yeah. Gotta go! Thanks for hanging out, Platinum! I'm glad you could spur that gaming topic. That was fun. Talk about all the other games that get played. Turns out most of the people here play games. It's weird. Fossil Southie is bugged, yeah. You need nature and fire? Well, unfortunately... And one accepted me. Oh, fuck yeah. The college Ooh, you want accepting sure. you. That's like a really, really, really busy hooker, just picking from the crowd and saying... You. <laughs> uh, this yeah, is the loadout. $20,000 hooker, in fact. Damn. That's a hundred killer. Hmm. There's an anomaly. Anomalies and encampments are so great for metal. You barely ever need to actually mine anything. The crafting encampment. Okay. I have 60,000 gold to spend. Give me just a second. Well, that's an I can do. Say sixty thousand. Mm. Can't yes, wait for that. I'm, I'm level twenty. I'm level twenty-three. Takes me forever to get six thousand. Yeah, that's the early game. Yeah, I got far enough to see Mob Shredder is twenty thousand. I can't even hold that much right now. Yeah. Been live for seven hours. Yeah. Oh. Sound Spectre Hemlock. Sound Spectre. Yeah. Although I do hate that question because I never know what somebody's asking. This weapon or that weapon? Are you fluxing it? Vouchering it? Researching it? Are you leveling What's it up? Better? Are you asking which one I prefer? Are you asking which one is better? Are you asking me which one you should use? Which one I prefer? I mean, I don't... A couple of those questions are repeated, but you get the idea. I don't actually know. That's not a real question. Subject or subject? And then they just leave out a verb. It's like, this is English, dude. Your independent clause is incomplete. Which one do you think I should level up? There you go. Sound Spectre is better though, in pretty much every way. Yeah. Affliction is that strong that the Hemlock is kind of an unfavorable SMG nowadays. Damage wise, it's fine, but Affliction just catches every other SMG up. Hemlock used to be an S tier SMG among one of the best in the game, and now it's just. It's not bad, it's just outclassed. Yep. Same thing with the bundle bus. Yeah, and the deatomizer. Yep. No weapon can be really, really strong without pushing down another one. Ravager. Unless they all literally do the same damage. And then there's no difference. That's why I love the Pop Shot, Ground Pounder, Husk Buster trio. Those three weapons just are a rotating wheel of what's the best shotgun in the game you can just pick one out of a hat and you'd be right someone was asking me that they're like which of these three is the best what do you recommend and i kept on saying i cannot recommend one of the other yeah it's kind of annoying somebody asked me like how's supposed to ground pounder and i said yes and then he's like i knew you'd say some smart ass shit like that i was like what the fuck did you expect then if you knew i'd say that like both Somebody on stream earlier asked me why I was using the ground pounder. I'm like, I don't know, I wanted it right now. I, I gave him a better answer than that, but 
Hustbuster and Ground Pounder are both good, just because you see me using one. What should I use it on? Supercharger? If you have every 130... Oh, every hero at 130. Uh, Ability-based ones. I have a whole video that breaks down a bunch of options. I'll link it in chat here. There are a lot of different heroes in the game. And you might be surprised. Like, there are obvious picks, like Paleo Luna gets a huge benefit from it and all that, but... Um, ability heroes, Minigun, Dragon Slash, Teddy, whatever you use. If you're in the end game, you're not using a lot of Teddy, but... Takato Shadow is pretty fun, too. How feel like streaming is kind of stressful in some aspects. How are you doing mentally? Oh, I'm doing great today, actually. I normally end at this time, but I'm just going to keep going because you guys are awesome. All the taco balloons. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Seriously, usually we chat is really dead at this hour, people. and I get bored and just kind of end early, but nope. Here we are just sliding past my normal stopping point. Especially if you guys are interacting with a sponsor, checking out Marvel Strike Force, giving it a go for me. We had some pretty cool hype trains earlier. All these things motivate me. Active chat, donations. And I'm having a good time, actually. And I actually have things to do in this game. Like, I need to finish Ventures, like, very soon, and it's motivating me to do things. Ventures is gonna get me to level 49. Nose Picker said, bah. Are you a sheep, or are you just... Surprised at something. You got a gifted sub, by the way. I think. Is that gifted or is it a prime sub? I don't know, actually. I don't know. Hold on, I'll get back. Right. Hasn't said anything in 15 minutes. <laughs> <laughs> it hasn't said a word. BRB. I didn't know he was here. Thought that was iron for a second. You haven't gotten an ad. Was a, oh. Was up there in Discord. Quick, somebody give Poplio a sub so he never has to see an ad. I actually did reduce my ad showings to the minimum it'll allow me. I slid that slider all the way down. Like, what's the minimum a partnered streamer can have? Two minutes an hour? Deal. Because I make nothing from mine's ads. Like a, mine's like a minute. I make nothing. It's it's like 20 bucks a month. I fuck that. I don't want to bug my viewers for nothing like that. And like 20, that's like somebody could cheer 2000 bits and that would be way more than ads would make in 3 weeks. It's just not worth bugging you guys over. And ads are a real deterrent. Like it's a big deal to be hit with an ad on Twitch. It's not just a video where it's gonna wait for you, it's a stream. That shit keeps moving while you're watching an ad. It sucks. So, I put it at the minimum. Does my nerve have poles yet? No, Say doesn't. you had one food for the rest of your life, what are you eating? Uh, a fucking bullet. Why would you eat one food for the rest of your life? Can't be doing that. If you wanted to ask my favorite food, you could have done that without putting this horror show in my mind. I don't have one food. I eat too much variety. What's the lady got going on? She's messaging me. Okay, it seems like the stream's ending after this game. Alright. Unless a crazy hype train kicks up, this will be my final game, chat. I will be live, I think, before next week. I, I really want to finish Venture still. And, um, I just don't know exactly when that'll be. Um, but I have a lot of opportunities. It could be Thursday, Friday, Sunday, Monday of next week. 
I think probably Friday or Sunday would be everybody's favorite time for me to stream, right? So. I, I know I'm home all of Saturday and Sunday, so. It won't be Saturday, but. And I don't know, because Sunday is usually like a full day to myself. So Friday sounds like it'd be a nice, good stream. It gives me a break, that being tomorrow. And then Friday, I usually see the girlfriend a little later. So I could be live through shop and it wouldn't interrupt any of my plans. So, you know, it could be a big Friday stream. It wouldn't be a big, it'd be like five hours, but a little baby stream. That's not bad. It's a little baby stream. Please. I, I, I have breaking news. Oh, alright, alright. They, they patched the Xenon bow thing with killers. Yeah, good. Oh, yay! That good. sucked. That wasn't even a fun bug after the first try. It was like, really? So these four waves just don't matter? Don't exist. Yeah. A horde was basically was 11 waves. It was stupid. I sent the video to people into the world chat and I was watching it. I just the ladies in chat. The in all our voices. Get me buffs here. Have you ever considered starting a new series where you start over? Yep, yep, I get that comment all the damn time. It's not something I want to do. It's it's a ton of effort. It would completely steal my focus from all my other video ideas and... Ripping off Aiden is a comment I would get a lot, I'm sure. Because he has a significantly more popular series of doing that, and I just don't want to... I got enough ideas, that's my point. There's also four bases now. Excuse me. Wasn't there already four? Yeah, that's because someone. No, there was three. There's three. Oh. Somebody was saying that. I think it was Dave. Who was like, you had to defend four objectives. I was like, there was only three objectives. Uh, take my money and stay longer. Hey, if you get a hype train kicked off, I will stay longer. So. Send your money and I will. <laughs> or you could uh, sign up with Factor. That actually also works. Somebody signs up with Factor right now. I'll extend the stream. How about that? When was the last time you ate Takis? I never liked Takis in school. Sure as shit, no, I had the opportunity. Half my school was like, I think. At least half my school was Mexican, so... Takis were there every day. Every day. Skrilly, I don't think so. Said more for you. More for who? Floor freeze is good though, Kai. And you can just break them down for resources. After the recycle okay. bug is gone. Apparently there's boss waves that instantly end if you kill the boss. Ooh. Weird. Thank you for the 100 bits! You guys aren't actually gonna kick off a hype train, right? Don't do that, I'm trying to talk oh. to the girl. No hype trains. See, I'd be willing to pitch in, but Beast needs to go. <laughs> don't, don't send bits, Chad, and kick off a hype train. Yeah, whatsoever. Never, ever, ever. No. <laughs> it's the same person. That's the same guy twice, so we're not quite kicking off Hype Train. He no. <laughs> said yes, more. More? You got more? What's happening right now, Sinks? If anybody watching on mobile, by the way, is watching on mobile, you should buy bits and subs through those links. Those are much cheaper. If Takis are seen in my school, you get jumped for them. Yeah, I understand that. What's Aiden's channel name? Aiden Harris? I don't know. If you guys kick off a hype train, I'll stick around. We could run another mission or two. Alright. V-Bucks? There are no V-Bucks today. Fine, I won't send bits. Don't you dare start a hype train, cowgirl. Don't you dare. <laughs> the Cloak Shadow build's really good. I like it. Damn, Saints! How many bits are you gonna cheer? Oh. Thank you so much! Zaku is just teasing the hype train. Okay, I don't think he was trolling. He's still going. He's gonna be on the. He's already on the leaderboard. All right. All right, cowgirl. Might as well kick off the hype train. 
You want more? You know, I'm always, I'm always on board for some healthy competition. If it's the leaderboard you're after. I'm an Australian. It's hard to find players. Um, well, you should honestly, Normandy. Our Discord's a great place to talk to people. We have Australian players. You know, I'll do ten more. Are you trying to fill up my cup with purple gems right now? Because if you cheer like. What is it? Cheer one? Yeah. And then you like copy. If you guys do like this, you can cheer a bunch and it fills up the tip jar. It's kind of fun. Damn, cowgirl! 500! My vision's so blurry after a long stream in a dark room that that looked like 100, but I was like, wait a second, I had to squint. Thank you so much! Oh, five on there. There's choo, a little, choo, little five choo. there. Your razor build? I see a couple of you in chat with Prime Gaming badges. Have you two used <laughs> your Prime subs this month? It's fine if you use it on somebody else. I'm just saying, if you haven't used that sub, now's a great time. We got a hype train kicking off. Can get one of these very fun emotes. Does the lady still have her sub? She does. She does. She gets gifted all the time. She gets so spoiled in my chat. Did she say something else, or is that her... Oh, she's saying hi to Pop. Oh, yes, yes, yes. Welcome, lady. Welcome. Damn, Sinks! Thank you so much! Yeah, pot shot should definitely be affliction. You don't want to be standing still more than usual. I used it on Destiny stream? Perfect. Okay, good. Yeah. I just want to make sure it was used. I gotta, I gotta ask every Prime badge I see. <laughs> yeah, Skrilly, my camera was not liking that bright sun. Doing MSK on 300 ping is not fun. I believe you. I believe you. That is that is no good. Aw, she's sending the heart. Oh, look at that. That's the heart I have on my shirt. <laughs> oh my god, this is so loud. Okay. Merch. There we go. Let me, let me drop the merch link in chat. There you go. Just realized I don't even follow. Well, thank you so much. Enjoy the channel points for following, by the way. You have a girl girl. That emoji's a girl. I don't understand. A girl girl? <laughs> I don't understand. Also, I don't that I got my prime sub. I appreciate it, Spunkin. I really do. I'll probably be live around there. New season. Level 2, 0%. Wow. You guys perfectly filled out a level 1 hype trade. I'll say hype train right now, threatening to extend the stream. How much was all that? A thousand bits. Thank you so much, Sinks. I really appreciate it. Um, What's the best mission to get the Carolina portraits? Oh, I don't even know. I don't um, know. Ghost Towns. Ghost Towns. Yeah. Everybody's favorite mission type. Well, normally I extend streams at like level five, but... I would get more, but I'm broke. No, that's completely fine. You should always take care of yourself before you take care of others. Don't burn all your... Money. How many... Oh, I have a thousand teammate boosts? Jesus Christ. <laughs> I'm sitting wow. on like 400, I think. Yeah, 400. Ghost Towns in Candy Valley? Ghost Towns in any zone, it would be. Um, Ghost Towns in Candy Valley? I think that's going to be the hype train. We got a couple minutes left. I'll let it run out, but uh, if it if it ends here, I'll, I'll end the stream as as planned. You have 86 cents in your account. Okay, well, that's too low. You should not have... You shouldn't have donated in the first place. You got to take care of yourself. I appreciate it, though. I, I really do. It's fine. I, I'm going to trust you. All right, I'm going to trust you. What was I saving up for? Fast engineering would be nice. Oh, yeah, yeah. Never miss. No, okay, I already got that. Good. Oh, this needs a cannon ship. Let me do that right now. Um, one and a half minutes left on the hype train if anybody wants a chance to get an emote. 100 bits minimum, but you can sub for free if you have Amazon Prime. And you can uh, sub normally, gift a sub. Would you suggest Sorian Might over Assault Damage and Crackshot Scourge build? Um, It can be good. 
That could help activate Battle Beat a little more often. Um, but I'm not sure how much it'll matter. <laughs> yeah, so let's do a quick little overview here. I got 400,000 Ventures XP today. What the fuck? Yeah, I won level, yeah. I'm wow. level 49. I'm nearly 49, so I think... Oh, and then I've only got the Eliminate quest now. The, the dog houses are done. Sweet. So I've probably got a quick Ventures session. Because is it, what, 2.3 million for level 50? Yep. I'm very I close. Am, yeah, I'm at 2.208 million. So I am... So I actually wouldn't want to stream tomorrow, because we already kind of did the 140s anyway. So I think Friday seems like a really good day to go live. Also, it's a start of a weekend, so yeah. 10 seconds on live train. Oh, yeah. I don't think anybody's going to single-handedly clutch level 3, but also, it's possible. a bunch of people will be on spring break, too. Yeah, I think spring break's already been happening for like a month now. Well, that's the thing. A bunch, a couple of us, like, I'm on my spring break now. Thank um, you so much, Sings. Most of the Sings. people I know have spring break next week. Is the Trap Recycling give hat going to be fixed? Yes, I covered that in my daily video today. Epic did address it. Thank you for the impromptu hype train. I appreciate you and Cowgirl, Zaku, get it all going. Thank you. Um, the support is very much appreciated. Um, I was going to say, yeah, Ventures... So the recycling is not fixed, but currently recycling weapons gives you more than usual, which is great. Your spring break was over a month ago. Yeah, it's rolling out really weirdly. Uh, Ventures is a mode where you have a separate inventory and you start from level 1. And there's a lot of Ventures rewards that goes with it. I'll link to Ventures rewards in chat as well because it's actually really good. And part of that is superchargers. I actually have a few here. I have an unused hero supercharger. Where should I put that, huh? How about I just save it for once? I keep finding random commanders that make sense for it. I already finished Cloak Shadow, so I think I'll just save I it for now. Got, I got Assassin's Hero 144. Wow. I'll do first shot Rio. I thought about her, but I don't know who I'm going to do next because now I, I have no one who's not already supercharged yeah dude it's fun like that build can have pretty much any commander but cloak shadow so strong man he's actually really viable you smack one enemy and every enemy around you dies i love it so ventures is purely optional but vouchers does come from ventures and if you're a new player, Ventures is really useful because you can hit the 94 zones, 108s, 124s, and even 140 zones, no matter what your normal power level is. And the rewards down here are excellent. You can get hundreds of perk up, you can get millions of XP, which is really good for leveling up, all the evolution materials, a lot of stuff that's just not normally... You can level up in Ventures a lot faster than your normal power level, and... For that reason, I think for new players, Ventures is a hugely worth it time. You'll spend fifty dollars of your paycheck. You'll live on Friday. Okay. Well, I guess I'm streaming Friday. If you're gonna, <laughs> if you're gonna whore me out like that, I, I can be bought. I have the exact build with Arlene as commander because life legion explosions are nice. Well, good. Yeah, it's a solid build. For progression, to use so yeah. For progression, I actually do recommend doing Ventures. It's it's temporary. In fact, the timeline, which is linked in the YouTube stream description, shows us when Ventures comes and goes. Um, so, we have until April 3rd, and then when the next season starts next week, you'll have until June 19th. Which is... You know, only, only a couple months there, so I recommend doing that. Yeah. Yeah, seven days left. And if you're interested... I did just make a reminder video sharing everything you should grab before the season ends. So, you have time. Technically, you can finish Ventures if you start now, but it'll be, uh, it'll be a fun grind if you do that. Okay, goodbye, Discord. Let's find someone to raid. Let's call this stream an end here. I don't know where I'm going. Um, I don't know where I'm going. Bro's on light mode. Sure shit am. No raid. Oh, we need to raid someone. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. We gotta raid someone. Is there somebody playing this game? 
baby Fortnite stream, but then it's not for oh that's that's Lego Fortnite, that's different. 160 Wednesday with Chowder. Father of two. You refuse to leave? Um... Ugh. Let's see what they do with this. Gotta test the waters check. Can't just send you anywhere. I gotta hide my badge here. I'm a TwitchCon goer. There we go. Let's see what happens. The last time I, I messaged in a random guy's chat, I got banned because they hated me, apparently. So I gotta be careful nowadays. It'd be awkward to raid someone who's a meanie. Did the portrait only come out of pianos? I don't know. I don't think this is the same guy, though. Alright, good enough. I got a what's up. That's that's all I needed. All right, everybody, go say hi. If you're on Twitch, then you'll be able to get a uh, channel points for being part of the raid. If you're on YouTube, this is his link. If you want to head over to my Twitch chat right now and participate in the raid, you get 350 channel points, which can eventually amount into adding me. So, um, yeah, they're doing 160s, so a little, little late game chilling, I guess. Uh, good, goodbye now, I suppose. It was a good stream. Appreciate everybody hanging out. It's awesome. You stay for eternity. Noah, check back in on, on Friday, all right? There's nothing left for you here. There's nothing left. Go go enjoy Chowder's chat if they're a good person. Well, hopefully. Seems like it. <laughs>